Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Dragon Ball, even Zeno can't keep him, I said so. Chapter 91, Ancient Time and Space, Drink, Sun Gohan Transformed Again. The surrounding dark golden air waves instantly turned into jet shapes, and the body was surrounded by black lightning. Super 2's transformation has made his eyes return to black again, his arrogance, and his hair color is still dark blonde. The whole person looks cold, domineering, and evil. Violent aura rushed into his mind from the tail, but strangely, he could easily control his reason and not be affected by this violent aura. It looks like Son Goku's look when he transforms into Ultra Instinct in Dragon Ball Super. Extremely calm. This is no different from the transformation just now. It's just that the strength has increased a lot, said the King of Time and Space. Yes, the full power of this form increases combat effectiveness by about 150 times. But my current mutated form is a full 300 times, Sun Gohan said excitedly. Well, it seems that this mutation is caused by that weird aura. Most of the Super Saiyan transformation you mentioned is caused by the genes in the tail. Next one, the King of Time and Space waved his hand, already facing I'm not interested in this form anymore. Good, Sun Gohan put away his transformation and became normal. Immediately afterwards, he began to transform into a mysterious form, and jet-like air waves erupted instantly. Unexpectedly, his arrogance turned gray, no longer silver-white arrogance. Moreover, his eyebrows disappeared and his brow bones bulged, as if he was in his Super 3 form. The hair stood up high and turned into a gray color, and the eyes turned into a dead gray. The increase in combat power is not as much as the increase in the Super Game form. After all, the base number is there, and the original mysterious form has already reached a 500-fold increase. Now it has probably increased by about 150 times, reaching an astonishing 650 times. This proves that his mutation is still based on the mysterious form. The mysterious form is Sun Gohan's exclusive transformation, and should be the first level. The beast form in the future should be the second level. And the emotion this transformation brought to him was a pool of stagnant water, and his eyes were indifferent to any life, which was completely different from the calmness of the Super Saiyan form. Death, strange, shouldn't the rules of life be born under the influence of the original energy? I remember that the first rule I mastered was influenced by the original energy and mastered the rules of life. Said the king of time and space curiously. Could it be that the strange energy stimulated the original energy? After all, life and death coexist. Without life, how can there be death? Without death, where can there be rebirth? Sun Gohan immediately thought of the reason. Ha ha, good boy, I'm not as smart as you. What you said is probably right. The original energy must have sensed the rules of destruction, so it gave you part of the rules of death. In terms of lethality, the rules of life are far away. It's better than the rules of death. The king of time and space was also blinded. After hearing Sun Gohan's guess, he thought everything clearly in an instant. Next, next. The king of time and space became more and more interested. Ah, it's gone. Sun Gohan spread his hands. Is this gone? Where is the god of Saiyan in your Saiyan legend? The king of time and space saw the legend of the god of Saiyan from the future. I'm only eight years old. It's not easy for me to cultivate to this level. God of Saiyan, how can it be that simple? Sun Gohan shouted loudly. Ahem, okay. The king of time and space could only cough to cover up his embarrassment. Lord King of Time and Space, do you think I won't be in the same situation again in the future? Sun Gohan said worriedly. Probably not. It seems that those two breaths have regarded your body as a host. Even if it is turmoil, it should be after breaking through this world. The King of Time and Space said with some uncertainty. That's good. Ha, huh. after Sun Gohan took a long breath, his hanging heart finally relaxed. Then what cousins said, don't you care? Sun Gohan mentioned the angel family being the Grand Priest. In that future, I do not exist. Although Zeno is part of my consciousness and ability, he is also a new life form. Even if the angel family has different intentions, it is not something I should worry about. Isn't this something else? You, he he, the king of time and space dug a big hole for Sun Gohan. You are too shady. What does it have to do with me? I am just a mortal. Sun Gohan said dissatisfied. You are not a simple mortal now. If you keep getting stronger, gods will always be looking at you. 
he he. It's so cheating, you're such an idiot. Lao Lu, what do you mean? Nothing, don't be angry. In my eyes, everything in this universe is just a child's play. You have the original and the strange mysterious atmosphere in your body. Your future achievements will definitely not be worse than mine. You should broaden your horizons. In the future everything about time and space should be considered as an experience. After you break through this universe, you and I will get together again. The king of time and space consoled him. Um, after I break through this universe in future time and space, will you still know me? Sun Gohan asked. Nonsense, after reaching the unique state, no matter how much time and space there is, there is only one you. This is called uniqueness. The time and space I am in did not give birth to some messy parallel worlds. This is because I suppressed time and space. Time and space, Wong said angrily. The only realm, Lord Time and Space King, can you tell me about the realm of gods? Sun Gohan asked curiously. You don't know, the king of time and space said in surprise. I don't know, no one told me that we still measure our strength by combat effectiveness. Sun Gohan said. Okay. Then let me tell you. Based on your future division of time and space, gods are divided into two categories, upper gods and lower gods. The king of time and space began to analyze it for him. God, they are existences like the gods of the earth, King Yama of the underworld, the king of Kai, the king of the great Kai, and the servants of supreme Kai, similar to Gebet, Zamasu, etc., collectively referred to as lower gods. These gods have some abilities conferred by their positions, but their strengths vary. Some are strong and some are weak. The strong ones can defeat the gods, while the weak ones cannot even defeat some powerful races in the universe. God, it's Supreme Kai, gods of destruction, angel, and a handful of gods like Zeno. Their realms are also carefully divided. First of all, the level of life is sublimated to the level of gods, getting rid of the influence of the cycle of birth, old age, illness, death and lifespan. This step can be called the true god realm. The true god realm is just a sublimation of the level of life and has nothing to do with strength. This is the reason why Supreme Kai is weak, because the duty of Supreme Kai is to create planets and life and is not good at fighting, so most Supreme Kai Kai is in the true god realm. His fighting power is not strong, and he cannot defeat some terrifying mortal beings, such as Majin Buu, Dapura, Mara, and androids. Of course, there are also a few Supreme Kai who like to fight, and their fighting ability is not weak. Above, there is the Great God Realm. The Great God Realm is a very clear realm. This type of god has strong combat power and also has some physical skills of god, such as Ultra Instinct, Self Extreme Intention Kung Fu, Regular Skills, and Destruction Skills. The Great God Realm is also divided into stages, Early Stage, Middle Stage, Late Stage, and Perfection. Similar to Beerus, he has reached the late stage, and Champa is almost in the mid-stage. Further up, there is the realm of priests. That is the realm of most of the angel family. A god in this realm can crush the great god realm, ignore the existence of rule-breaking techniques, perfectly integrate Ultra Instinct, the physical technique of the god, into the normal state, and also master a trace of the rules of time. You can go back in time, stop, speed up, etc. It is also divided into early stage, middle stage, late stage and perfection. Angels like Myers who are interns are all in the early stage, Wiss, Vados, and those angels who have already taken office are in the midterm or late stage. Wiss has reached the late stage. Grand Priest has reached its consummation stage. Further up is the only true realm. This is the realm of the king of time and space. It is the only one in the universe, not bound by time and space, and no clones will be born. Sun Gohan became even more confused after hearing this, no, what about Zeno? What state is he in? Him, he is a special case. He has no realm, because he has mastered the power of purging, he can crush all gods. Although he is a new life form, after all, it was transformed by a trace of my will, so he cannot break through to the only true realm. This is also as a result, he exists in every parallel time and space. The king of time and space was a little embarrassed. TCH, isn't he just a tool? No wonder the angel family will have different intentions in the future. Sun Gohan mocked. Well, you're right to say that, but even if they have different intentions, they can't kill Shao Quan. 
they can only guide Shao Quan to do something beneficial to themselves. The king of time and space was helpless. Then is it possible for the angel family to break through to the one true realm? Sun Gohan seems like a problem baby. Yes, but it's unlikely. Unless they also get an opportunity like the original, weird energy, they can break through. But the original energy that gave birth to this universe is with me, and the weird energy has come to you again. They if you want to break through, I'm afraid it's just empty talk. Great, Sun Gohan said excitedly. Don't be too complacent. After all, your current strength is too weak. If they notice you, hey. The king of time and space said with a malicious smile. I understand, isn't it just hiding your clumsiness? Sun Gohan naturally understood what he meant. By the way, are there Saiyans in this time and space? No, Shao Quan has been waiting for work. Saiyan has not been born yet, and it will take a long time before a race as powerful as yours can be derived in the universe. In the current universe, gods are above all else, said the king of space and time. Okay, then can you send me back to my time and space? This is simple, but when you go back, act like you have never experienced any of this, and don't expose my existence, otherwise. I'm not stupid. Expose you and wait for some evil god to kill me. Sun Gohan rolled his eyes and interjected. What an unpleasant little guy. Go, go, go. The king of time and space waved his hand, and a huge black hole appeared in the room. From here, you can go back to your time and space. Opening the door to time and space is easy for the king of time and space. Help me say goodbye to cousins. After Sun Gohan slowly walked into the black hole, the king of time and space smoothed the black hole. Cousins, come in. Cousins walked in slowly. Master time and space king, where is Sun Gohan? Cousins asked curiously. I sent him back. Then what did he say? Cousins frowned. Don't worry, children and grandchildren have their own blessings. No matter who sits in that position, it will not affect the status of your Jackson people. After all, all the foundations are built on life, universe. You are responsible for creating, no one will embarrass you. The king of time and space naturally knew what he was worried about. You were right, I wonder when you will leave. Cousins looked at the time and space king with some reluctance. The hierarchy of ancient time and space is distinct, far less clear than that of future time and space. Cousin's attitude towards the time and space king is not as frightening as the future gods towards Zeno. Hurry up, cousins, if you come to me directly this time, you will naturally attract the attention of some priests with malicious intentions. Before I leave, you should find an heir to take over your seat. The time and space king said lightly. I understand, lord time and space king. Cousins naturally understood that the time and space king was doing it for his own good. Very good. Go back, time and space king waved his hand. Yes, cousins retreated out of the dimensional space and headed for the seventh universe. Main time and space, finally back. Feeling the familiar space fluctuations, Sun Gohan finally breathed a sigh of relief. He did not appear directly on the earth, but appeared in a starry sky that he had never been before. But he didn't bother to explore anymore, he just closed his eyes and looked for the location of the earth. Hey. It's so far away. Call out. However, no matter how far away, I can't resist an instant transmission from him. It hasn't been long since he went to date time and space. IG 764 at the end of August. Sun Gohan is about to start school. He who returned, first returned to Baozi Mountain. Gohan, where did these 10 days go? Sun Goku asked curiously. I went to another planet to play. Sun Gohan did not tell them about his experience. Who would believe it? I clearly sensed that Saiyan's breath, and then you disappeared. Vegeta said coldly. If you don't talk, no one will think you are dumb. After one year, new enemies will appear. You should work hard. Sun Gohan flew into the air and left after scolding Vegeta. New enemy. Great, my body is almost rusting. Sun Goku excited. Dot dot dot. Jingle. The class bell is ringing. Quote exclamation mark. What are you doing? Why is it like a block of iron? Vital took his little hand away dissatisfied. Why pinch me? Sun Gohan whispered. Who told you not to come to me for so long? Vital pouted, looking aggrieved. I have something to do. What's the matter with the kid? Quote dot 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 quote. Sun Gohan won't explain anymore. 
Ha, Vital snorted. Time passed slowly. Three years have passed, and Sun Gohan has not been running around in the past three years, but has been staying on the earth. For the past three years, he has been trying to control the primordial and strange aura in his body. But the effect was not great, the strange chi had been hiding in his tail and could not come out, while the primordial chi, as usual, drove the chi in his body to circulate when he was training his physical body. In three years, Sun Gohan's normal combat power has grown to 500 million points. It doesn't seem like much, but it's already very scary. You know, his current super game Dark Gold Form 1 has reached 160 times, and the Super 2 form has increased by 300 times. The mysterious form is 650 times more. So figure it out. His highest combat power has reached 325 billion points. With such terrifying fighting power, let alone Cell, even Majin Buu can easily crush it. This is not the most important thing, the most important thing is his aura, the energy is mixed with a trace of the power of rules, destruction, death. You know, this can be a higher level rule than destroying and clearing. Although there is only a trace, but the existence below the true god realm, there is no way to compete with it. Moreover, since Date came, he discovered the micro-robot that monitored him. After returning from ancient time and space, he even used Chi to protect his body, preventing the micro-robot from getting a trace of genes. Even the bowls, chopsticks and cutlery when eating, I used my air to clean up my saliva. He doesn't want Cell to get his own genes, especially the genes after returning from ancient time and space. After all, the new dark gold form will double the increase in combat power. As for the previous ones, it doesn't matter. As for why they didn't go to Dr. Jero, one, he was too lazy to look for it. Second, if you find it, you won't be able to play. Sun Goku, Vegeta, Raditz, Nappa, they are all waiting for the new enemy that Sun Gohan said. End of May. Gohan, have you heard? A very scary monster appeared on a small island not far from our school. The residents of the town were all killed. The death was horrific, and the entire body turned into a mummified corpse. Vital chatted with Sun Gohan about the news she saw last night in his spare time. There was a look of fear in his eyes. Mummy, small town, Sun Gohan had a flash of inspiration. Hee <laughs> hee, it finally appeared. Call, a gust of wind blew by, and the miniature robot monitoring him instantly turned into dust. Hey, it's strange, why is there wind when the window is not open? By the way, Gohan, what do you mean by finally appearing? Vital puzzled. It's nothing, it should be the wind blowing from the air conditioner, sit down, the teacher is coming in. Jingle bell, Vital is sitting upright, looking like a good baby. But Sun Gohan didn't believe it, because at this time, Vital had already started practicing martial arts with Satan, and his talent was so strong that generally three or five adults couldn't get in. He saw it with his own eyes. Vital kicks the wretched uncle who molested his female classmate away. He saw with his own eyes that more than 20 bad students who were bullied on campus were easily defeated by Vital alone. He saw with his own eyes that Vital almost beat a trafficker to death after school. Hey, good baby, who would believe it? Night, Bun Mountain. Because of Vegeta's arrival, Sun Gohan asked Bulma how many houses he bought. With the help of space capsules, the houses became movable and no longer real estate. At the same time, it also comes with a corresponding cooking robot. Raditz, Nappa, and Vegeta all have their own residences, surrounded by a circle about a few hundred meters away from Sun Gohan's house. Come here, Sun Gohan walked out of the house after eating and shouted loudly. Less than three seconds, Raditz, Nappa, Vegeta, all flew over. Son Goku also walked out of the room slowly. Gohan, keep your voice down, your mother just fell asleep. Ah, well, I forgot, it is worth mentioning that Chi Chi is pregnant again. It has been three months now, and my stomach is still not showing much. Unsurprisingly, it should be that Son Goten didn't run away. Bowsy Mountain, what's the matter, Son Gohan? Vegeta spoke first. The enemy I mentioned is about to appear. Let's see your strength first. Go, change places, don't disturb my mother. Sun Gohan flew to the sky first. At the same time, it shattered the tiny robots monitoring a group of them. Now that the game has started, they can't be left behind, so as not to cause unnecessary trouble. 
everyone flew at high speed, and came to an uninhabited wasteland. Gohan, where is the enemy? Son Goku couldn't help asking as soon as he landed. On the small island 3,000 kilometers away from the west of Bowsey Mountain, they have started to make trouble. The residents of that small island have been killed by them a lot. Several villages and towns have been slaughtered. After Sun Gohan came back watch the news rebroadcast carefully, and keep the address in mind. After all, artificial humans have no breath, and they can't feel it. They can't perceive it unless they emit energy like Ki Blast. What do you mean? You mean, the enemy is on the earth. Apart from you, there are powerful existences on the earth. Vegeta asked suspiciously. Hee <laughs> hee, don't underestimate this planet. Besides, the enemy I'm talking about was created by the people on Earth. You'll know it when you see it. Sun Gohan made a fool of himself. Mainly too lazy to explain. Manufactured, so they're not human, Raditz asked emphatically. That's right, it's an artificial human made by Earthlings. Ha, huh, cyborg, Red Ribbon Legion, old eight. Sun Goku was taken aback and screamed out. Kakarot, you're so low, you're killing me. Vegeta, who was standing beside him, plucked his ears in dissatisfaction. Dad, that's right, it was the Red Ribbon Legion you destroyed back then. Although most of the leaders died, a genius scientist who researched biochemical humans and robots did not die, but has been monitoring us all the time, and created a powerful artificial human. Sun Gohan said. Why can't you kill him? Sun Goku rarely showed a look of gnashing his teeth. Is it stronger than Frieza? Nappa couldn't believe it. Although they have surpassed Frieza now, in their cognition, Frieza is still a terrifying guy. Bullshit, not strong, can I tell you guys? Sun Gohan rolled his eyes. Come on, let's each reveal our own strength. Or cheer up and let me see. Sun Gohan suddenly took out an earphone and put it on his ear. Point your finger, and a picture will be projected in your right eye. Hey, what, why is it similar to a combat power detector? Raditz asked in surprise. I troubled others to do it. This detector has no upper limit, but it is much better than what you used to wear. Moreover, it cancelled the layer of glass and made a laser projection. At the same time, it was made into the shape of a headset, which is easy to wear. Sun Gohan threw them up. I don't need it. I'm not used to it. Sun Goku didn't take. HMPH, I don't need it if I have the ability to sense chi. Vegeta didn't bother to wear it either. Whatever you want. Raditz, Nappa, wear it. Who will come first? I'll come first, I'm the weakest. Raditz closed his eyes and pumped up his energy. Ah, he crossed his arms and his shape began to change. His long hair instantly turned golden, and his pupils also turned green. If it weren't for the existence of eyebrows, it would look like a living super three form. Dip, 100 million, 150 million. Sun Gohan's detector exploded Raditz's combat effectiveness index. Uncle, you are too inferior. It took you so long to improve to this point. Sun Gohan joked. I am a low-level warrior myself. It is not easy to transform into a Super Saiyan. Raditz looked complacent. Fart, do you really think that a low-level warrior like you can follow this prince? Vegeta couldn't help but cursed. Oh, it seems there is a story I don't know, Vegeta, tell me. Sun Gohan asked curiously. Ha, huh, the three levels of high school and lower are just judged by the combat effectiveness of the newborn, but the potential cannot be distinguished by this. For example, their father Burdock was born as a lower level warrior, but through conquering planets, he grew up in the battle of time, his combat power surpassed that of senior warriors. This situation also made my father realize that something was wrong, and found that Saiyan's classification of potential was wrong, so he assigned Burdock's eldest son, and Nappa, to me, be my subordinate. He wanted to change Saiyan's system, but unfortunately, before the plan was implemented, planet Vegeta suffered extinction. Vegeta revealed the secret they didn't know. King Vegeta, why haven't I heard you say that before? Nappa asked. I have been monitored by Frieza for many years, can I tell him? If I tell him, don't I just tell him that there is a Saiyan with great potential beside me? Idiot. Vegeta said angrily. Yes, yes, I'm so stupid. Even though Nappa has now transformed into Super Saiyan, he still hasn't changed his character of being afraid of Vegeta. I later thought that through Son Gohan's training, your combat power would be rapidly enhanced, 
and you would abandon this concept, but I didn't expect that you are still the same as before. What kind of grading system do you believe in? Vegeta said with hatred of iron. It seems that you have put a layer of shackles on your own hearts. Sun Gohan said slowly. So that's it. That's great. Doesn't it mean that I can grow to be as strong as Gohan? Raditz said excitedly, and his confidence began to return. Practice hard, there will be more and more crises in this universe. Sun Gohan said calmly. Okay, it's my turn. Nappa began to raise his energy, and Golden Aura surrounded him. Unexpectedly, he did not look like Sun Gohan thought, and his beard grew longer. The bald head is still the same, but with the blessing of Golden Aura, it becomes shiny, but the beard becomes golden. It seems that your baldness is gone. Raditz joked. I was born without hair, not bald. Nappa was a little angry. If you don't have hair, you're bald. Sun Gohan added. Quote dot 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 quote. Nappa, Super Saiyan has 200 million combat points. Vegeta, reached super full power, normal 50 million points, full power 80 times increase, 4 billion points. Sun Goku, super full power, normal 70 million points, full power 80 times increase, 5.6 billion points. The fighting power of the two people, under the influence of Sun Gohan, has exceeded Android 17 and 18. But facing Cell, there are still some shortcomings. Of course, Cell in perfect form. At this time, Cell still doesn't know which corner he is in. Sun Gohan also doesn't know if there is a future where Cell killed Date and traveled to the present time and space. But he plans to ask Den tomorrow. As the god of the Earth, Den can monitor the entire Earth. If anything abnormal happens, he should see it. Early next morning, it's Saturday and Sunday, and Sun Gohan doesn't have to go to school. Gohan, are you going with us? Sun Goku asked. No, I have other things. You go ahead. Sun Gohan shook his head and teleported away. Sun Goku, Vegeta, Raditz and others rushed towards the address mentioned by Sun Gohan. Arctic Ice Field. Ha, huh, all dispatched. It seems that something happened. Piccolo sat cross-legged in the air, and after sensing the anger of Sun Goku and others, he also stopped meditating, found the right position, and flew towards the destination. The Temple. Gohan, long time no see. Dend was so happy when he saw Sun Gohan. Well, are you bored staying in the temple? Sun Gohan touched Dend's little head. Due to different development reasons, Sun Gohan was already more than a head taller than Dend at this time. It's not boring at all. Let me tell you, I saw that the people on Earth have completely different reproduction methods from Islamic people. It's very interesting. Okay, you don't need to tell me this, and don't look blindly in the future, be careful of damaging your eyes. Sun Gohan quickly stopped what he said next. Ha, huh, bad eyes. No, I observe carefully every day. They seem to be very happy when they understand each other. As soon as Den said this, he became interested and very excited, but he was also worried that he didn't have this function. Exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark. Sun Gohan's face is extremely embarrassing. Mr. Popo, what are you teaching him? What's this? It's just a normal physiological problem of mammals. As the god of the earth, he naturally needs to know everything about the earth. Bobo's face was expressionless. Dend, I have something to do with you. Sun Gohan shouted loudly. Dend, who was chattering endlessly, stopped for a moment. What's the matter, Gohan? Dend looked at Sun Gohan with his innocent eyes. Have you noticed any abnormalities on the earth during this time, for example, the people on earth have been sucked dry, leaving only clothes and the like? Sun Gohan asked. After hearing this, Dend slowly walked towards the edge of the temple and closed his eyes. Obviously exploring the earth. Mr. Popo, can you teach him to do something serious? What's the use of watching those every day, he doesn't have that function. The corner of Sun Gohan's mouth twitched, depending on the situation, Den didn't pay attention to this matter at all. I'm just a servant, Bobo said calmly. Sun Gohan's face twitched and his expression was ugly. What the hell is this? Go to hell with your uncle's servant. Sun Gohan cursed in his heart. Seeing Bobo, he suddenly remembered why he didn't ask the king of time and space where Bobo came from. He rolled his eyes and thought of a way in an instant. Mr. Popo, have you ever heard of the king of time and space? Sun Gohan asked tentatively. 
Bobo's eyes narrowed and he stared at Sun Gohan. The whole body exudes a terrifying coercion. The original energy in Sun Gohan's body was running wildly under this pressure, and at the same time, Sun Gohan directly transformed into a mysterious form. Dead silence, and the breath of despair enveloped the entire sky. Dend, who was exploring the earth on the side, was instantly pressed to the ground by the breath of the two men, while his eyes revealed despair and fear. How do you know about the king of time and space? Bobo said word by word. Affected by his transformation, Sun Gohan's eyes were also full of dead silence. His gray eyes stared at Bobo without any waves and said, I know, I know. Bobo didn't speak when he heard this, but stared straight at Sun Gohan. A minute later, Bobo put away his pressure. It seems that if you are not in this time and space, you should have an opportunity. Bobo said calmly. After he put away the pressure, Sun Gohan was able to control his transformation, so he returned to his normal state, dead silent, and the aura of despair dissipated instantly. It seems that you know me, Sun Gohan said excitedly. He didn't realize how dangerous he was just now. The power of death given by the mysterious form made him ignore the sense of crisis. I don't know you. Bobo's face was expressionless. You lied to me. Sun Gohan didn't believe it. I'm just a servant. Bobo turned around and left, not caring whether he believed it or not. Heitzi, one day, I will tear off your mask. Sun Gohan cursed in his heart. Satoru, Gohan, what's going on? After the pressure between the two dissipated, Dend was finally able to stand up. It's okay, Dend, did you find anything? Sun Gohan asked. Yes, 5,000 kilometers away, there are two lifeless humans absorbing the energy in the bodies of the earthlings. There is a monster over there. He is even more terrifying, swallowing up his energy and spirit at the same time. Dend was terrified, looking in another direction. It seems that Cell is here after all. What happened to this time and space? Sun Gohan's heart was not disturbed at all. It's just that he's a little weird. Do you know that monster? Dend looked at Gohan nervously. Don't worry, Dend, leave it to me, you have time to pay more attention to the anomalies on the earth, don't look at those every day, you can't do it. Okay, let's go. Sun Gohan reprimanded a few words and left. Goodbye, Gohan, I remember. Dend shouted. Sun Gohan followed the address Dend gave him and came to a dense forest. He flew at a low altitude, observed carefully, and flew around the entire forest several times. He saw a time machine with a big hole in it. Found it. Sun Gohan landed slowly. The time machine was covered in moss, as if it had been there for several years. But Sun Gohan is familiar with the plot and knows that this is another cell in time and space. After the sneak attack on date, I took a time machine to the present. He pressed the button and the time machine was taken back into the space capsule. Then we started searching around the area and found Cell's shed body. Chop Suey, you must hide it well. I look forward to the day when you become a complete body, but I don't know if they will keep numbers 17 and 18. Sun Gohan teleported away and came to the artificial human. The Island of Chaos. Oh, they're here too. Sun Gohan sensed the auras of Piccolo and Klin. Including Sun Goku. There were six of them, flying low over the island to search. Number 20, how could they come here? Number 19 and number 20 are hiding in a dark alley. Dr. Jero transformed himself into a robot. Except for his own brain, his entire body is a cold machine. It should be that the incident on this small island has been reported. However, even if they find it, according to the data, we can kill them. Go, find an opportunity, and sneak attack one. Dr. Jero took 19 number. Heading towards the nearest Piccolo. After Son Goku and others returned to the Earth, they did not fully explode their strength. When Son Gohan inspected them last night, he also shattered the micro-robots monitoring them, and Piccolo Fusion was in the temple. The micro-robot is defective and cannot reach such high places. It was only when Piccolo was fighting Ginyu that a glimmer of information was collected. Piccolo has already perfected his control of Chi. Except for instantly raising Chi when fighting, and stopping, his robots cannot detect the specific combat power at all. Nandu Town. Piccolo landed on the ground and looked around, but he still couldn't find the existence of the artificial man. Son Goku, are they right? Piccolo cursed secretly. Piccolo Daimao. 
A voice suddenly came from the alley behind him. Who? Piccolo was shocked and turned his head instantly. Snapped. A big hand instantly covered Piccolo's face, and the chi in his body quickly disappeared. Oops. Piccolo's IQ was running quickly, and he barely raised his hand, emitting a tiny wave of light to the distance. Boom. The subtle fluctuations and aura instantly made Son Goku and the others who were searching carefully notice it. Piccolo's chi is decreasing rapidly. Son Gohan also noticed the abnormality. Number 20, they found out. Number 19 said blankly. So what if you find out? Number 20 said lightly. In less than a moment, Piccolo's energy disappeared, and he was on the verge of life and death. Let him go. Son Gohan teleported over first, and two rays of light shot out from his eyes to attack Dr. Jero. Boom. Dr. Jero let go and dodged, and Piccolo also fell to the ground. Sun Gohan rushed over at a high speed, his eyes fixed, and an invisible momentum sent the two of them flying far away. Then feed Piccolo a fairy bean. Piccolo's eyes pop open instantly. You dare to attack me. Piccolo was furious. Piccolo, change to another place, there are still a lot of humans here. Sun Gohan stops Piccolo from a furious shot. Cut Sui, do you dare to come with me? Piccolo suppressed his anger. Yes. Dr. Jero said lightly, Piccolo soared into the sky and flew towards the uninhabited plains. Dr. Jero followed closely behind with no. 19. Son Goku and the others are also coming at this time. Okay, let's go, keep up. Son Gohan stopped the crowd who wanted to ask questions. Then followed, Son Goku and others also followed patiently with doubts. Call out, die, rotten. As soon as Piccolo hit the ground, he threw a Qigong bomb at number. 20. Number 20 raised his right hand, and the red absorbing device in the palm instantly absorbed the Qigong bomb. What a strong energy, I didn't expect you to be so strong. Number 20 was very excited. Piccolo, the red dots on the palms of their hands can absorb energy wave attacks. Sun Gohan reminded. Absorb energy. Piccolo put away the energy wave that was ready to launch again. He straightened up, took off his cape, hat. Then I'll smash them to death. Piccolo said viciously. Boy, you talk too much. Number 19 turned his head in a circle and looked at Sun Gohan expressionlessly. Sun Gohan was taken aback for a moment, then put down his arms around his chest. Give you a face. Stab it. On the 19th, fear arose for the first time, looking at the big hole in his chest. It turned out that Sun Gohan came to him in an instant and punched him right through. Number 19 was furious and fearful at the same time. I also made the engine oil red, I really think that I am alive. The corner of Sun Gohan's mouth twisted, his right fist turned into a palm, and instantly pulled out the energy pack on No 19's chest. It's disgusting. Sun Gohan scattered the red liquid from his hand with a gas shock. Da da da. Number 19 retreated three steps in a row, turned around and flew into the sky to escape. I'm afraid you want to eat poopapoo. -poo. Sun Gohan's eyes narrowed, and the two light techniques shot directly at No 19's head. Don't even think about it. Number 19 stretched out his hands, aiming at the light technique. Stab. The light technique instantly penetrates the palm. Sun Gohan has not achieved nothing in the past three years. He can already use normalcy to exert a little power of rules. He endowed these two light techniques with some destructive power. The powerful power of rules instantly penetrated the palms and heads, and then exploded. Boom. The explosion on the 19th was completely destroyed. Number 19. Dr. Jero was furious, and at the same time there was a hint of panic in his heart. The strength of number 19 is almost the same as him. Sun Gohan can easily kill number 19, which means he can also easily kill him. At this time, he decided to quit with all his heart. Tattered. Where are you looking? Boom. Piccolo flew up and punched Dr. Jero on the right side of his face. Dr. Jero's body was smashed away, and Piccolo then chased after him, holding Dr. Jero's left leg with his right hand. With a swing of his big hand, he hit him high on the ground. A big crater opened up on the ground, and liquid that was unknown as engine oil or antifreeze spit out from Dr. Jero's mouth. It's quite realistic, Piccolo mocked. Asshole. Dr. Jero opened his mouth and spat out an attack wave. Key blast shot towards Piccolo's face in an instant. Boom. 
The smoke and dust from the explosion instantly covered Piccolo. Dr. Jero seizes the opportunity to get up and escape. Where to run? Piccolo broke through the smoke and chased after him. Dr. Jero's speed is far inferior to Piccolo, Piccolo quickly closes the distance. If this continues, he will catch up to him soon. I can't die, my baby hasn't been born yet. Dr. Jero gritted his teeth. In an instant, the two of them had flown 5,000 kilometers. Dr. Jero flew towards his research institute while thinking about ways to escape. Tattered, run over there. Piccolo was less than three meters away from him. Get away. Dr. Jero turned around and fired key blast. The bright light of the explosion blocked Dr. Jero's figure, and he instantly landed and hid in the rocky valley. Because he has no breath, Piccolo can't find him at all. He was running and jumping on the ground, avoiding Piccolo's sight. Get out of here. Ha ha. Piccolo condensed a huge ball of energy and threw it towards the valley. Good opportunity. Dr. Jero was instantly exposed, opening his hands to absorb all the energy emitted by Piccolo. Got you. Piccolo moved at high speed and came behind Dr. Jero. The energy wave just now was intentional by Piccolo. He guessed that Dr. Jero would not give up such a powerful energy wave. Tear. One of Dr. Jero's arms was torn off instantly. Boom. Dr. Jero used another blind trick, blasting key blast, which exploded and disrupted the line of sight. Trash, I will definitely scrap you. Piccolo used his energy to disperse the dust. Dr. Jero disappears again. He runs, he chases, he can't fly. Piccolo stood high in the sky. Search carefully for Dr. Jero. Dr. Jero saw that his research institute was approaching, so he became even more cautious. Come out here, uncle, get out of here, rags. Piccolo mindlessly fired air bombs around the ground, but Dr. Jero would not be fooled anymore. He had no idea of absorbing Piccolo's energy bombs, but slowly moved towards the research institute. Crack! A Qigong bomb hit his chest and flew away. Dr. Jero was leaning against the mountain, not daring to move at all. The iron armor on the chest was burned through by Qigong bombs. When I wake up number 17 and 18, it will be your death. Dr. Jero whispered viciously. Earth, finally reached. Dr. Jero finally arrived at the gate of his research institute. Boom, the metal door opened slowly, and Dr. Jero hurried in. Where did you go? Piccolo looked around angrily. As an existence like a think tank, being played by the artificial man between applause, he is about to be mad at him. Piccolo, you are so stupid, why don't you just destroy this valley? Sun Gohan flew over and jokingly said. Use you to teach me. Piccolo's face twitched, and he raised his hand to condense a huge energy ball. If you don't come out, die to me. Boom. A huge mushroom cloud rose from the ground, and the rocky valley was completely turned into a plane, leaving only Dr. Jero's research institute standing high above the plane. Found you. Piccolo came to the gate with a high-speed movement. Son Goku, wait for someone to come over too. Sun Gohan looked around with great interest, and thought to himself, Cell is so stupid, why isn't it here? He originally thought that Cell would be nearby, but he didn't expect Piccolo to destroy the valley, and there was no trace of Cell. As everyone knows, the sea is underwater on the beach of the island. If I didn't run fast, I would have been discovered. Dear Dr. Jero, it doesn't matter if you die, you must not die on 17.18. Cell turned out to be hiding in the bottom of the sea. The energy wave generated by the explosion disturbed Sun Gohan's perception, and he did not find the fleeing cell. In the research institute, quick, 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 Dr. Jero frantically clicked on the keyboard with one hand, and activated the sleeping cabin on 17.18. Laugh, the hatch opens slowly, drive Jero, long time no see. Number 17 walked out of the sleeping cabin, resting his right hand on the back of his neck and shaking his head, making a rattling noise. How do you feel? Dr. Jero looked nervously at 17.18. It feels good, dear Dr. Jero. Number 18 said with a wicked smile on the corner of his mouth. Afterwards, she also walked out of the sleeping cabin, and her proud figure could be seen at a glance as she stretched her waist. I'm afraid I can't even see my toes when I look down. Tight, elastic buttocks, people can't help but want to take a big shot. It seems that the program has been restored, you too, there are several powerful humans outside, go out and kill them. 
Dr. Jero's face brightened. Okay, Dr. Jero. Number 17 frowned, then let go instantly, and turned to walk towards the gate. Hand number 18 dragged his chin and sat on the frame of the sleeping cabin. On the 18th, you too. Dr. Jero ordered. Number 17 is enough. Number 18 obviously didn't want to make a move. It seems that you still haven't repaired it. If you don't want to sleep again, follow my orders. Dr. Jero took out the remote control and waved it, threatening no. 18. Okay, then as you wish. Number 18 stood up and walked towards the gate. Pong. The door burst open from the outside in an instant, and the splashed metal just hit Dr. Jero behind. Number 17 seized the opportunity, moved at a high speed, came to Dr. Jero, and tore off his remaining arm. Stab. Red engine oil was sprayed all over the place. I didn't expect that you would be reluctant to transform yourself into us, but into a complete machine. Number 17 asked curiously. What are you doing, aren't you afraid that I will? Before Dr. Jero finished speaking, snap. That's enough, shut up, you're really annoying. Number 18 didn't bother to listen to his nonsense, so he went up and stomped his head off. The only brain that can prove that he was once a human being has completely turned into a mess. Number 17 snatched the remote control from that mechanical arm and squeezed it. Let's go, number 18. See how strong Dr. Jero said the powerful human beings are. Number 17 said coldly. It's broken, get out. Piccolo's voice came from outside the smashed gate. Piccolo Daimao, I have your data in the program. Could it be that you are the powerful human being that Dr. Jero mentioned? Number 17 looked at Piccolo and said. Two rags again. Piccolo was taken aback. Boom, boom. Who are you talking about? Number 18 punched Piccolo out of the door. The two siblings also flew out. On one side is Piccolo who is wiping the blood from the corner of his mouth, and on the other side are the siblings of Android 17.18. Son Goku, Vegeta and other four are watching the battle from the sidelines. Son Goku, number 17 frowned, the instructions in the program made him want to attack Son Goku. Number 18 also followed No 17's voice to look over, and the killing intent in his heart gushed out in an instant. Dr. Jero, it seems that the order must be completed in order to completely get rid of control. Number 18 scolded. Hey, Kakarot, did you do something messy? That fool, did you have a big opinion on you? You can't hide your murderous intent. Vegeta teased. I'm wrong, I don't even know them. Son Goku also felt baffled. Hey, hey, his son is still here. Don't talk nonsense, they are artificial humans transformed by Dr. Jero. The program has entered the command to kill my father. In Dr. Jero's eyes, my father is them. Biggest enemy, Son Gohan explained dissatisfied. So that's how it is. Since you're here to find me, I'll go first. Son Goku didn't care about the opponent's strength, so he quickly found an excuse to make a move. Two rags, your enemy is me. Piccolo came back to his senses and found that the artificial man had set his sights on Son Goku, and the anger in his heart became even stronger. He moved at high speed, kicked number 18 away with one kick, turned his head and fired another muzzle shot at number 17. Number 17 folded his hands on his chest, and formed a green circular protective shield outside his body, easily blocking Piccolo's muzzle cannon. Hey, hey, Piccolo. They are looking for me. Son Goku rushed up dissatisfied. You guys play, I'll go in and take a look. Son Gohan was not interested in their battle, and walked to the research institute alone. Number 16. Son Gohan stepped up curiously and pressed the open button, scoff. The hatch opened, and the tall figure stood up. Son Gohan, there is also Son Gohan in the 16th data. I know you don't like fighting, you like nature. Dr. Jero is dead, you can do whatever you want. Don't worry about the bomb in your body that can destroy the earth, the current strength of the earth, the bomb in your body can't destroy it. Son Gohan explained the situation clearly. But there is an instruction in my data to kill your father, I can't ignore it. Number 16 said with some embarrassment. It doesn't matter, my father is outside, as long as you can kill him. Son Gohan looked indifferent. It seems that Son Goku's strength has exceeded the data. Number 16 looks like a well-developed limb, but he is not stupid, but very smart. Well, it's not stupid. You can do whatever you want. 
Sun Gohan went to the sleeping cabin on 13.14.15 again. They haven't made it yet. Number 16 frowned. I know, but I want to kill the uncontrollable factors. Although these three guys are not strong separately, they are still quite troublesome when combined. Sun Gohan recalls memories of past lives carefully. On 13.14.15, the three are fully mechanical androids, but they are endowed with permanent energy packs. The three of them were continued to be produced by a computer after Dr. Jero's death, and at the same time, the movements of the Z fighters were entered into the data. After absorbing the energy pack of No. 14.15, number 13 became super number. 13. The combat power is close to super 2. In the end, it was Sun Goku who absorbed the energy of the spirit bomb to completely destroy him. These three artificial humans obey the instructions entered by the computer and strictly abide by them. There is no possibility of whitewashing. And there is an upper limit in strength, not like no. 17.18, so Sun Gohan decided to destroy them directly. Boom, the three sleeping cabins exploded, and machine fragments flew everywhere. By the way, if you are worried, you can go to the capsule company to find Bulma, remove the bomb in your body, and mention my name, so it will work. After Sun Gohan finished speaking, he stomped his foot hard, and a big hole appeared in the ground instantly. Sun Gohan floated down. Number 16 did not leave, but followed Sun Gohan down to the basement. Dr. Jero Institute. In a straight-shaped training cabin, a creature the size of a fist is slowly growing. How do you know there is a basement here? Number 16 asked curiously. You don't know. Sun Gohan asked back. My father never regarded me as his son. Number 16 said coldly. Are you Dr. Jero's son? Sun Gohan frowned. Well, I'm his eldest son, and he used me as a test subject in order to create artificial humans. Although number 16 had no expression on his face. But Sun Gohan can feel that pain inside him. He is already dead, and he deserves to be killed by the artificial man he made himself. Sun Gohan didn't know how to comfort him. I'm just a robot now, and I don't have any emotions. You don't need to comfort me. Number 16 said coldly. What the 16th said, something Sun Gohan never knew. He suddenly thought of the theatrical plot where Sun Gohan transformed into a beast form in his previous life. Dr. Hyde who created the Super Cell is the grandson of Dr. Jero, and his father is the second son of Dr. Jero. Presumably, number 16 is his eldest son. How to deal with it? Sun Gohan murmured while looking at the cell in the cultivation cabin. What is he? Number 16 asked curiously. He is a monster created by fusion after your father collected our cells. Cell. Number 16 said angrily. Forget it, since that future cell is here, let's destroy this one in front of us. Sun Gohan raised his hand and clenched his fist, smashing the cultivation cabin with one punch, and the liquid inside flowed out instantly. At this time, the cell was still unconscious, Sun Gohan stepped up, raised his hand, and launched a not-so-powerful energy wave. The cell embryo instantly vanished into nothingness. Then he destroyed all the computer servers in the basement. Outside world, Sun Goku, my data shows that you are not that strong. Number 17 stood up, wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth, and frowned. I don't understand that, it's been a long time since I played so much. Come again, Sun Goku rushed up again. The two clashed in the air, and there was a sound of steel-like collision between their powerful bodies. The fight with Piccolo on the 18th is also in full swing. In the distance, a green figure quietly moved towards the battlefield. Haven't played enough. As soon as Sun Gohan came out, he saw their fight. Sun Goku obviously didn't show his full strength at this time. Although he transformed into Super Saiyan, he deliberately suppressed his strength to the same level as number. 17. Although Piccolo's combat power has reached 2 billion after Fusion became a fairy, he seems to have fallen into a bottleneck recently, and his combat power has not increased much, but is around 2.1 billion. Although No 18's combat power is slightly weaker, she wins because of her unlimited energy. Numerous Qigong bombs were fired from her hands, Piccolo had no choice but to dodge them in order to save energy, and had no hard resistance. The two can fight evenly. Kamehameha. Son Goku instantly shot Kamehameha to number 17. Don't even think about it. 
Number 17 condensed a protective shield and resisted Kamehameha hard. Boom, cheer, Kamehameha exploded, and although the shield was also blasted, it blocked most of the power. The final aftermath blew number 17 far away. Good chance. The eyes of Cell in the distance burst open, and he accelerated with all his strength and flew towards No. 17. Because the body of number 17 flying upside down happened to be heading in his direction. Number 17, become one with my fusion. Cell yelled violently, pulling his tail high, and the sharp tip of the tail opened instantly. No, who are you? Woo. Before number 17 finished speaking, the upper body was already swallowed by Cell's tail. Good guy, you can see through every stitch. Sun Gohan couldn't help but admire. To say that the hardest working in Dragon Ball is Cell, in order to evolve into a perfect body, he tried every means. No. 17. Number 18 was shocked, and flew over quickly, trying to save No. 17. Piccolo and Son Goku also stopped attacking and looked at Cell seriously. Did Jean swallow the 18th? Son Gohan was also thinking about how to deal with it. If Cell doesn't swallow number 18, relying on the second form will not bring any improvement to Son Goku and the others at all. But looking at the goddess he liked in his previous life, he felt a little reluctant to let go. Snapped. Son Gohan slapped his thigh. How could I forget this? He has Saiyan cells and the ability to regenerate from the dead. Can't I just seriously injure him and let him recover? Moreover, in the original work, after the perfect cell was beaten and vomited out number 18 and self-destructed, he used the chip in his mind to restore his complete body, and his strength reached the second level. Hum. After cell swallowed number 17, his body was wrapped in a strong energy, and number 18 was unable to break through the defense. Ah, Cell yelled for a while before evolving into its second form. You're here too on the 18th, what a great opportunity. Cell was overjoyed. The second form of Cell that swallowed No 17's combat power increased dramatically, and its powerful aura even crushed No. 18. Monster, let go of No. 17. Number 18 was overwhelmed by anger and attacked Cell regardless of the situation. Cell didn't block at all and allowed her to attack. Bang bang bang. Within a few seconds, Number 18 attacked with hundreds of moves. She didn't notice that Cell's tail had already reached the top of her head. Now, Cell shouted, his tail instantly opened, and he swallowed No. 18. I'm afraid you want to eat shit, a voice said. Sun Gohan transformed into an air blade and cut off Cell's tail with a sword. I woke up instantly on the 18th. Stay back, why help me? Number 18 was a little confused. You're quite pretty, it's a waste to be swallowed up by this disgusting monster. Sun Gohan teased. Little hooligan, Number 18 blushed. Get away quickly. Sun Gohan ignored her. After calming down on the 18th, he also understood that he was no match for Cell. So she retreated, Sun Gohan, you dare to disturb my good deeds. Cell was furious. What can you do to me? Sun Gohan's mouth provocatively provoked Cell. Seeking death, Cell punched Sun Gohan. Sun Gohan turned sideways and rushed forward, boom. While dodging the attack, Iron Fist instantly hit Cell in the abdomen. Wow, Cell spat out acid water. The extreme pain instantly made him fall to his knees and cover his abdomen with both hands. You can't do it either. Sun Gohan provoked wildly. Cell roared angrily. Cell struggled to his feet and attacked Sun Gohan again. Bang bang bang. Sun Gohan's eyes narrowed, and countless fists hit Cell. Cell couldn't see Sun Gohan's movements at all. The body was smashed into dense fist pits. Gohan is so strong, Sun Goku said excitedly. Vegeta, Raditz, Nappa and Piccolo all looked at Sun Gohan in shock. At this time, Sun Gohan has not transformed into any form. There was just a hint of red flame around the body. That's right, he beat Cell so hard that he couldn't get up just with his Kaioken. At this time, Cell is already in his second form, with a combat power of more than 3 billion. When he evolves into a complete form, his combat power will increase exponentially. Cell's energy dropped rapidly. Sun Gohan, you can't be that strong, my data tells me that you are not that strong. Cell looked at Sun Gohan in disbelief and said. You are just an idiot. Although you have fused Saiyan, the cells of the Earthlings Namek, you cannot fully utilize the advantages of each race. 
Saiyan's basic ability is to double his combat power after rebirth after dying, but the deepest it is the will, tenacity, the will to become stronger after the war, do you have it? You don't have it. The foundation of the Namek people is the regeneration of limbs, but they yearn for nature and love peace. Do you have it? You don't have it either. Although the people on earth are weak, but they have a positive attitude of pursuing the unknown, do you have it? You don't have it either, that's something that's imprinted deep in their souls. Just a few cells haha. What you have is just relying on a hodgepodge of various cell fusions. Is it wrong to say you are a fool? No, you are just an idiot. Sun Gohan kills people, no matter what he understands is right or not, he will tell Cell. Cell's face was hideous and distorted. It was as if Sun Gohan's words touched his heart. Shut up, shut up, shut up, I'm not a fool, I'm the strongest artificial human. Why a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a who was watching the battle from a distance, was puzzled and frowned, Gohan, don't provoke him, it's dangerous. Don't worry, Dad, I have a measure. Son Gohan is very clear about his purpose. Cell, with a bloated body, waved his huge palm like a cattail fan, taking pictures like Son Gohan. Son Gohan squatted with his legs slightly, his right fist concentrated on his waist to gather strength, and at the moment when Cell's big hand was about to reach, he punched out with a powerful punch. The moment the two collided, there was only a crisp sound of bone cracking, and a powerful wave of air swept past. Like a sharp blade, it directly sliced off the flesh and blood in Cell's palm, and purple-black blood gushed out, and Cell's entire palm was bloody and bloody in an instant. Pain. Wow. Cell yelled out the pain, and stepped back again and again. After the air wave dissipated, Sinbai's hand bones were exposed. Sun Gohan also felt that it was about the same, and he stepped closer again, and hundreds of fists slammed into Cell's abdomen. First acid water, then purple black blood, finally Cell couldn't hold it anymore, the undigested number 17 surged upwards from the stomach. No. Don't spit. Cell tightly covered his mouth and nose with both hands. Attempt to prevent the number 17 from being spit out. But Sun Gohan launched powerful iron fists continuously, and the cramping pain in his stomach made his body instinctively insist on spitting out number. 17. Spit it out, bang, just spit it out, bang bang bang. Sun Gohan said while attacking his stomach hard. Finally, wow, Cell couldn't bear it anymore. He spit out number 17 with a big mouth. No, 17. Number 18 nervously looked at number 17 who was wrapped in stomach acid. Pong. Sun Gohan kicked number 17 in front of no. 18. He gave it to you. I did what I promised you. Hurry up and leave. Give up the instructions in your mind. You are not my father's opponent. Both of you siblings are not my father's opponent. Sun Gohan persuasion. Hey. Number 18 said something with a hard mouth and a soft heart, and then picked up number 17 and disappeared. Sun Gohan looked down. Where is it crooked? It's inexplicable. Then he turned his attention to Cell. Sun Gohan, Sun Gohan, oh yeah. Cell degenerated into the first form again. Extremely furious, he pumped up his energy with all his might. The whole body swelled rapidly, and instantly grew into a ball tens of meters high. Die, you all have to die. The bomb in my body is enough to blow up the entire earth. Hey, Sun Gohan, let's die together. With the will to die, Cell directly turned on the self-destruct mode. Gohan, be careful. Sun Goku felt the powerful energy in Cell's body, and quickly reminded Sun Gohan to be careful. First, your self-destruction can't destroy the Earth. The strength of the Earth in this time and space is far beyond your imagination. Second, don't take yourself too seriously. The mere self-destruction of this energy will hurt you. No more, Sun Gohan is still pissing off Cell. Sun Gohan, you are too arrogant, even if you can't blow up the earth, you will be killed. You can't escape, Cell began to roar impotently. Hee <laughs> hee, although it won't cause any harm to the earth, you should go to space and explode. 
Sun Gohan stepped forward slowly and put his palm on Cell's swollen belly. Call out. The two disappeared instantly. Sun Goku, Vegeta, instantly looked up to the sky. They were the first to sense Sun Gohan Chi reaching space. Then came Piccolo, Raditz, Nappa. The second young Master Saiyan is still the second young Master Saiyan. His fighting talent and talents are not comparable to those of ordinary people. The countdown to self-destruction starts. Cell is incompetent and furious. Blow it up, blow it up, let me see if one explosion can make you reach the second level. Sun Gohan took a few steps back and turned on the golden aura shield. He crossed his arms and looked at Cell who was about to self-destruct. Boom, a fierce explosion started, and the violent aftermath blew Sun Gohan's hair back. But in the vacuum of the universe, sound cannot travel. Sun Gohan looked at the explosion point quietly. The bright light produced after the explosion looks like a second sun rising when viewed from the earth. The light gradually dissipated. A black chip as big as the palm of your hand is floating in space. A trace of meridians, flesh and blood began to be reborn from the chip and reproduce. Less than three minutes, a fierce, powerful, unfamiliar yet familiar aura suddenly erupted. Ha ha, son Gohan, I have to thank you very much. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't have known that Saiyan could become a complete body thanks to his near-death rebirth. A complete cell appears with well-defined facial features, wings on its back, and black spots on its skin like ants. Is it just over one full power level? It seems that spitting out number 17 will have a big impact. Sun Gohan murmured, not paying attention to what Cell said. Sun Gohan, did you hear what I said? Cell has the genes of Kurdish and Frieza, and can naturally survive in space, but his voice cannot be transmitted, and Sun Gohan can only rely on the shape of his mouth to identify him say what. He pointed at the earth and landed at high speed. Cell realized what he meant and landed on earth. The two returned to the battlefield in less than a minute. Sun Gohan, to thank you. I will kill you with all my strength. The perfect cell is one level weaker than the cell in the original work because it did not swallow number. 17.18. Although he is now complete. But the combat power is only about 15 billion points. But the current cell is just right for Sun Goku, Vegeta and the others to practice. Although there is still a gap of billions of points, Sun Gohan feels that relying on their combat experience, they can have a good battle with cell. Anyway, he has the finishing touch. Dad, come on, he is enough for you to practice now. Sun Gohan retreated to Sun Goku. Good boy, so this is what you planned. Vegeta said excitedly. I'll go first. Sun Goku stood up. No, I'll go first. Vegeta was not to be outdone. Then, rock paper scissors. Sun Goku proposed a solution. Come on, come on, who is afraid of whom? Will this prince lose to you? Vegeta's eyes widened. Rock, paper, scissors. Son Goku came out with cloth and Vegeta came out with scissors. Hee <laughs> hee, I don't like the feeling of losing. Vegeta said proudly. TCH, you go first, you can't beat me anyway. Son Goku made a rare sarcastic comment. Fart, Kakarot, open your eyes and watch. Vegeta was furious. Cell's face was distorted and twitching. You are so arrogant, you are looking for death. He was completely angered by the two people's actions. After being fully recovered, he was so confident that he took the lead and attacked Vegeta. Come on, Wa crosses his arms and bursts out with all his breath, directly boosting to super full power. Vegeta burst out with all his anger. Transformed into a super full power form, the combat power reached 4 billion points. Oh, it seems that the game won't be so boring anymore. Cell smiled evilly. After his complete body, he regained his arrogance and arrogance. Sun Gohan also saw everything, but he didn't say anything to remind him, but watched the battle with interest. Him at this time, I no longer look down on so-called enemies like Cell and Majin Buu. Cell now has a playful mentality and suppresses his combat power to the same level as Vegeta. It's still a little weak. It seems that without experiencing life and death, the normal combat effectiveness will not be significantly improved. Sun Gohan looked at Vegeta carefully. Time goes back to last night. Sun Gohan couldn't help but frown when he saw Sun Goku and Vegeta unleashing all their strength. A normal combat power of 70 million, and a normal combat power of 50 million. Dad, why is your normal state so weak? 
Sun Gohan was a little confused. Weak, Sun Goku also felt confused. Although, we have been practicing hard and tempering our bodies, we have never fought with all our strength. Saiyan has the characteristic of getting stronger as we fight. Blind training cannot increase our strength much. Even if we compete with them every day, it is still experience. The improvement of physical skills cannot greatly enhance combat effectiveness. Vegeta naturally knew what Sun Gohan was wondering. It seems that I am dragging you down. Sun Gohan thought carefully. In the original work, from the moment Vegeta appears, the pace of time becomes extremely fast. Saiyan Crisis, Namek Crisis, Cyborg Crisis, Cell Crisis. One thing comes after another. This also caused Son Goku and the others to never stop and quickly become stronger through battles. Not to mention the arrival of the theatrical version of Cooler. Son Gohan eliminated Cooler and Frieza in advance, leaving them without a suitable opponent, which also led to a slow improvement in their normal combat effectiveness. Although it is not described in the original work, Son Gohan feels that at least when Son Goku reaches full power form, his combat power has exceeded 10 billion points. But now, there are only 5.6 billion points. Sun Gohan started planning last night. Back to now, Cell was the first to take action, with a low leg sweep. Kick to Vegeta's lower body. Vegeta jumped to avoid the attack, and then fired a key blast, blinding Cell's eyes. Big explosion attack. Vegeta is not a fool, and naturally senses that Cell's energy is stronger than him. So he directly used his unique skills. Big bang attack. It's also one of Vegeta's special skills. Boom, Cell was instantly knocked upside down. Vegeta seized the opportunity and rushed forward, stretching his hands forward. A momentum cannon instantly knocked the flying Cell to the ground. Ah, da da da. Vegeta stood high in the sky, and the familiar prince's tactics appeared, and countless Qigong bombs hit Cell. The semicircular energy group got bigger and bigger, and finally an energy group the size of a football field enveloped Cell. Vegeta raised his right hand flat in front of his chest, condensing a blue energy sphere that looked like substance. Photon smash. To say that the battle is flashy. Also belongs to Vegeta. He has created the most types of special energy wave attacks alone. I saw him throwing down the energy ball in his hand like a baseball thrower. Boom. A semicircular energy group the size of a football field was shattered and invaded by photons, instantly causing a qualitative change. The gold turned directly into red, and then exploded suddenly. The powerful explosion directly blew the entire island to pieces, and a huge abyss appeared. The seawater poured in and the sky was filled with dark clouds. It has to be said that Vegeta is suitable for short-term bursts. The set of combos just now cannot be easily taken by enemies even with twice his combat power. But Cell's combat power is more than twice as high as his. Whoops. Vegeta gasped for air. The consumption just now was also very huge. However, his aura did not decrease, but instead slowly increased. The combat power of 4 billion points has been increased to 5 billion points. It seems that fighting is the best way to improve your strength. So strong, King Vegeta is still so decisive and decisive in killing. Nappa looked at Vegeta excitedly. Click, click, click. A figure walked out from the edge of the abyss. Cell appears again. That set of attacks just now was good. Cell shook his head and his neck creaked. Bah, I can really pretend. Vegeta said disdainfully. Come on, the warm-up battle is over. Cell hooked his fingers and signaled Vegeta to attack. Who is afraid of whom? Vegeta moved at high speed, and when he came behind Cell, he raised his leg high and performed a split. Call out. His attack missed, and what he kicked was just the afterimage of Cell. Call out. Cell kicked a right whip and also kicked the afterimage of Vegeta. The two moved at high speed, chasing each other, and a sonic boom sounded in the air. Bang bang bang. In a few seconds, the two exchanged hundreds of moves. Vegeta's fighting power continues to improve. The background of long-term exercise is starting to explode. 5 billion, 6 billion, 7 billion. He gets stronger and stronger as he fights, and Cell also increases his chi as he improves. It is not only Vegeta who has benefited a lot, but also Cell. He learned Vegeta's combat experience, and he was evenly matched from the beginning when he was at a disadvantage in his moves. Fist to fist, elbow to elbow. Cell kept up with Vegeta's rhythm and movements. 
What a strong learning ability. Son Goku couldn't help exclaiming. After all, it is fusion of all of our cells, even if I deliberately showed a look of looking down on him just to provoke him. Son Gohan sighed. The two fought faster and faster, and no one could see their figures clearly. You can only rely on the strength of Chi to perceive which of them is stronger and weaker. Son Goku also benefited a lot from watching the battle from the sidelines, his Chi involuntarily increased. Raditz, Nappa, same thing. The four of them practiced hard for three years, and the accumulated foundation began to explode. As the first person to fight, Vegeta's ascension is the greatest. Boom, the two punched with all their strength, and then each retreated hundreds of meters. Hee <laughs> hee, interesting, interesting, it's so interesting. Cool, Cell shouted happily. What are you excited about? Vegeta said arrogantly. You deserve to call me an idiot. Cell's mood instantly became depressed. Fusion created you with so many cells, aren't you a fool? Vegeta crossed his arms and looked extremely arrogant. Hee hee, ha ha, courting death, Cell laughed out of anger. Arms crossed, hum, four identical bodies appeared. Hey man, even Tian Shinhan can do four body punches. Son Goku exclaimed. But the fighting Vegeta didn't see it that way, because he hadn't seen Tian Shinhan's four body punch. It's just an afterimage caused by mere speed. Vegeta disdainfully said. Hee hee, try it. The four cells spoke at the same time. Vegeta was taken aback when he heard this, because he heard four voices. Be vigilant in your heart. Vegeta, that's a four body fist. It can create three clones, but don't take it too seriously. The separated body is only a quarter of the strength of the main body. Even the main body will be weakened. Son Goku reminded loudly. HMPH, it's up to you. Vegeta didn't appreciate it. Father, you're a little bit out of martial arts. Son Gohan also joked. Ah, can't hold back, can't hold back, hee <laughs> hee, I really want to fight him, Vegeta. You should hurry up, Son Goku stomped anxiously. Your mouth is broken, Cell also expressed dissatisfaction. Come on, Vegeta took the lead. With a flash, he came in front of a clone, and with a move of momentum, the clone flew far away. The other three figures rushed up instantly. Punch, kick, key blast, three attacks for Vegeta. Vegeta didn't know which one to block, so he crossed his arms and chose to block them all. Bang, dang, boom. Vegeta didn't feel any strong pain. It seems that the strength behind the avatar is really not strong. The corner of Vegeta's mouth rose. Arrogance, the four cells rushed up again. Hee <laughs> hee, kid stuff. Vegeta squatted with his legs slightly, crossed his arms, exuding a powerful and violent aura. Golden arrogance soared into the sky. Burst wave. A powerful energy erupted from his body, and the instant burst of air blast directly knocked away Cell's avatar. The avatar couldn't bear such a terrifying air wave, and it directly melted into nothingness. Fusion with Cell's body. This move is so strong. Son Goku exclaimed. Vegeta's burst wave is a low-profile version of his self-sacrificing burst, which condenses most of the energy in his body and explodes in an instant. After sublimation, the explosion multiplied several times, and exploded with sacrifice. In the original book, he blew himself up after facing Majin Buu. During the Dragon Ball Super Tournament of Power Period, because of his transformation into Super Blue, his life level was sublimated, and his physical strength increased. He can control it perfectly and will not be killed by the explosive energy, but the disadvantage is that his physical energy is exhausted. The low-profile version of the explosive wave only consumes a lot in his body, and will not lose his combat effectiveness. Because the strength of the Cell clone is insufficient, the burst wave is enough. Cell's clone was scattered by Vegeta's explosive wave and returned to itself. Interesting, haha, it's so interesting. Cell's fighting spirit is getting higher and higher. Not only did his chi not drop, but it was still rising. The hardy battle made his potential begin to explode. Although Vegeta's chi has dropped, his fighting spirit is not weaker than Cell's. He paused for a moment, recovering his disordered breathing. Laughing at your mother, by the way, you don't seem to have a mother, but, you have our cells in your body, if you call me dad, hee <laughs> hee. Vegeta was rebellious and went to death taunt Cell. Cell's originally happy expression froze instantly, and his eyes were extremely cold. You, you will pay for what you said. Even if you call me daddy, 
Daddy won't admit it. I can't help but want to vomit just looking at your disgusting appearance. Shaking and cold. Sal is trembling all over. What the hell is Vegeta doing? Why are you pissing him off? Raditz wondered. He wants to have a life and death duel to break through his limit by angering Cell. Son Goku thought of Vegeta's plan in an instant. I have to say, Son Goku's IQ. Once involved in a battle, it will always soar at a very high speed. It coincides with each other, it seems that I don't have to worry about it. Son Gohan felt that his painstaking efforts were not in vain. Die, the wings on Cell's back trembled, and he came to Vegeta in an instant. So fast. Cell's full speed exceeded Vegeta's imagination, and he had no time to react. Boom, pong, Vegeta's body was like a boiled shrimp, bowed and thrown hundreds of kilometers away, until it hit a mountain on another small island before stopping. He flies, he chases, he cannot fly without wings. Cell followed closely, no slower than a smashed Vegeta. Go, keep up, Sun Gohan flew out first, and everyone watching the battle followed. The moment Vegeta hit Zhongshan, Cell rushed to him again. Bang bang bang, Cell continuously punched Vegeta like a machine gun. Vegeta crossed his arms, lifted his legs up, and protected his body. The thousand meter long mountain was directly smashed out of a big hole by his body. Boom, boom, the mountain collapsed, and countless rocks crashed down, crushing on the two of them. Drink. Cell yelled violently, a powerful air wave erupted from his body, and the rock that was about to hit him instantly turned into dust. This also gave Vegeta a chance to fight back. Regardless of the falling gravel, he opened his hands wide, and the palms condensed terrifying energy. Flash cannon, Vegeta's outstretched arm pulled hard towards his chest, and a thick, powerful beam of energy rushed out instantly. Flash Cannon, the low-end version of Final Flash, the energy is not as good as Final Flash, but it can be fired instantly. Magic Flash, Cell also used Piccolo's Magic Flash. One yellow, one blue, the two beams of light collide in an instant. Instead of competing with each other as imagined, the moment the two energies collided, they exploded. The powerful energy generated after the explosion directly destroyed the island. There are not enough islands for them to fight. Sun Gohan said airily. I saw that there are no humans on this island. Piccolo said indifferently. The light of the explosion was like a sun rising above the sea level again. But the Earth's core was strengthened by Shenron, and no earthquakes occurred. Not even the slightest tremor. This completely dissipated Sun Gohan's worries. The aftermath of the explosion set off huge waves, and the tsunami headed towards the coastal cities, but the moment it was about to arrive, the huge waves calmed down at a speed visible to the naked eye, and disappeared. It seems that Shenron's strengthening also involves a little bit of rules. Sun Gohan pondered. The light dissipated, and the center of the small island was blown up, turning into a huge abyss, and the seawater flooded back, completely covering it within a few minutes. Cell stands coldly in the air, searching for Vegeta. Vegeta, get out of here. Cell yelled loudly, call out. Why are you looking for your grandfather? A voice fell from above Cell's head, and Vegeta stood with his arms folded and his toes lightly tapping on the top of Cell's head. Ha ha, it's really underwear, as expected of Vegeta. Son Gohan laughed out loud. Underwear, what do you mean? Raditz asked curiously. Pretend, what do you mean? Son Gohan said casually. Raditz, Nappa, Keelan, were taken aback when they heard this, and burst out laughing instantly. Piccolo's face twitched, trying to suppress a smile. It really doesn't fit his aloof personality to laugh out loud. Gohan, how did you fail to learn? Son Goku frowned. Dad, how can I? Son Gohan was dissatisfied, but he didn't argue with Son Goku either. Back to the topic, Vegeta, you are really deceiving people too much, I won't play anymore. Ah, Cell was completely enraged, and Vegeta's actions made him lose his breath. He no longer hides his clumsiness, and directly explodes with all his strength. The powerful air wave instantly sent Vegeta flying, golden flames soared into the sky, and there was a trace of lightning flashing indistinctly. Sun Gohan's eyes were fixed. Good guy, are you about to break through to Super 2? That's right, jet-shaped golden gaseous flames, a faint flash of lightning. This is obviously about to break through the state of Super Saiyan 2. Raditz, 
Nappa reacted very quickly, and directly activated the cochlear detector to detect the fighting power of the cell. 18 billion, 19 billion, 20 billion, and still rising. Raditz was so shocked that his jaw couldn't close. King Vegeta is a lot weaker, only about 9.5 billion points. Nappa looked nervously at the battlefield. Although you look disgusting, your strength is really beyond recognition. I'm coming too. Vegeta squatted his legs slightly, crossed his arms, a terrifying energy wave burst out. The seawater was rolled up, setting off a tornado tsunami. Yeah, Vegeta's breath suddenly increased. Here we come, 10 billion, 10.5 billion, 12 billion, 13.8 billion. Nappa looked at Vegeta excitedly. In the end, Vegeta's combat power stabilized at around 14 billion. Although there is still a gap from Cell. One, who has been cultivating for three years, has accumulated a lot of background information, and the other has just been born, gradually getting familiar with the body and mastering himself through battles. The soaring combat power is really normal. Vegeta, die, Cell took the lead. I think it's beautiful. Vegeta strikes back, lacing air cannons with both palms, knocking Cell into the air, and then getting close and hitting Cell's face with a punch. That's experience. Vegeta sees the opportunity and hit Cell's face with consecutive heavy punches. Cell's head was beaten so dizzy. Binding ring. Vegeta pointed his finger, and a golden ring instantly covered Cell's upper body. Such a smooth set of combos leaves Cell empty-handed, but unable to perform. The scorching energy of the bondage ring instantly scalded Cell's arms, and Cell was awakened by the pain. I saw Vegeta raised his hand sideways. Big bang attack. A terrifying energy exploded on Cell's body. The law of smoke without injury is triggered. A green aura protective cover appeared, and at the moment Vegeta attacked, Cell broke through the restraint ring and propped up the protective cover at the same time. Although number 17 didn't stay in his body for a long time, he had already received no 17's data at the moment of devouring it. Or a shield, of course he will too. Chapter 101. Vegeta, I can see your actions clearly. Cell did not become angry as Vegeta expected. On the contrary, he was very calm. Big talk, Vegeta said disdainfully. Ha ha, come on, attack as hard as you can. Cell hooked his fingers at Vegeta and then crossed his arms. It seems to be saying, I will give you both hands. Rampant, Vegeta shot towards Cell, a punch to Cell's stomach. Call out, Iron Fist failed, Cell's body is slightly on one side. Dodge the Vegeta fist. Ah, da da da. Vegeta used his fists and kicks, but it was of no use. Cell just dodged his attack with simple movements. Yeah, if you don't show off, you'll get kicked. Son Gohan rolled his eyes. Don't hide if you can. Vegeta was furious. Okay, come on over. Cell put down his hands, his muscles tense. Boom, Vegeta's iron fist hit Cell's abdomen. But unexpectedly, Cell was like a towering mountain, not moving at all. No, impossible. Vegeta was instantly shocked. When? Ah, Cell instantly raised his right elbow and hit Vegeta's Tianling guy hard. Vegeta's eyeballs almost popped out. The extreme pain made him scream, and then he took a few steps back and pressed his head with both hands. He felt like his brain was beaten into a paste. Prince Saiyan, nothing more than that. Cell mocked mercilessly. Then he slowly floated towards Vegeta, crouched slightly, and punched him straight. Hit Vegeta hard in the stomach. Wow, the pain shifted, and Vegeta felt that his head no longer hurt, and he clutched his abdomen tightly while spitting out a mouthful of old blood. King Vegeta, Nappa was shocked and shouted instantly. Prince, he's just a waste, Cell said disdainfully. How dare you, look down on this prince. Get out of here, Vegeta exploded at his limit, and an energy ball instantly smashed Cell away. Whoop whoosh, Vegeta seized the opportunity and quickly recovered. The law of smoke and no harm was triggered, and Cell appeared unscathed. If you have the ability, you can take my last move. Vegeta gasped. Ha ha, come on. Cell stood face to face in front of Vegeta. HMPH, you will pay the price for your rampant behavior. Vegeta stepped back a hundred meters, and opened his hands again. The muscles in his two arms suddenly swelled and bulged high, looking very discordant with his height. Finally, flash, condensing energy beyond the limit, 
he gave up the super full power form and condensed all the energy into the final flash. One move determines life and death. Cell, you must not hide. Vegeta said coldly. Cell looked solemn, but he was extremely excited inside. Come, finally, flash cannon. A wave of energy-like substance rushed towards Cell instantly. Cell raised his hands, and directly hard-wired it. Laugh. There was a sizzling grilling sound coming from both of his palms. Aha! The muscles in Vegeta's arms swelled again, and the output beyond the limit caused traces of blood to appear on his arms. In the end, the power of the flash increased to another level, and Cell's palms were bloody and bloody. Oops, I was careless, my body can't bear it anymore. Cell suddenly felt bad. But it's too late. Die to me. Vegeta's whole body swelled again, bleeding from all seven orifices, exceeding the output of Fuhi, making his body unbearable. Boom. Final flash explosion. Space is blurring. Vegeta no longer had any strength, and fell towards the sea. Vegeta. Nappa rushed up instantly, hugged Vegeta and returned. Ahem. Vegeta was still coughing up blood, the attack just now was too forced. The backlash of his body put him on the verge of life and death. Hey, fairy bean. Son Gohan took out a fairy bean and threw it into Vegeta's mouth. Petal. Vegeta's eyes regained their brilliance, his body swelled slightly, and his physical strength recovered. Then stand up. He felt that his strength had increased a lot again. In the end, the light from the flash cannon is also slightly dissipating. Is it dead? Keelan looked at the explosion point in confusion. No, can still feel his key. Son Goku said. The explosion dissipated, the dust settled, a pair of legs suddenly appeared, and there was nothing above the waist. Goku, this should be dead, his head is gone. Keelan looked at the half-body cell in amazement. Don't forget, he has Piccolo's regenerated cells in his body. Son Gohan explained. I don't have the ability to regenerate when my head disappears. Piccolo said angrily. Piccolo, don't worry, look. Son Gohan pointed at Cell. Cell's waist began to grow blood buds, bones. In a few seconds, his upper body rushed out, and his body surface was covered with a layer of mucus. Piccolo, don't underestimate yourself. Since he can do this, it proves that you can do the same. You haven't improved much after fusion with the gods for so long. You can try to focus on the advantages of regenerating limbs on, blindly meditating, penance, cannot optimize your cells. Sun Gohan explained Piccolo carefully. I got it. Piccolo looked serious and listened carefully to Sun Gohan's enlightenment. That move just now really scared me. Vegeta, not bad. Keep going. Hee <laughs> hee. Cell laughed. No, no, it's my turn. Vegeta, you've eaten the fairy bean, it's my turn. Sun Goku couldn't wait. HMPH, I didn't grab you. Vegeta snorted coldly with his arms crossed. His pride does not allow him to fight by cheating. Since he ate the fairy bean, it means that he has lost just now. Of course, this is also the reason why Sun Gohan is in charge. If there is no Sun Gohan in charge, even if they swarm up, they will kill Cell in the end. You, Sun Goku, although I have the command to kill you in my head, I don't want to fight you now, because you are not as good as Vegeta. Cell pointed to his head and said. Ha ha, you have a good eye. Kakarot, did you hear that, I am better than you. Vegeta couldn't help laughing happily when he heard Cell said that he was better than Son Goku. Hey, it's not that bad, you'll know it after you fight. Another place, Son Goku didn't mind their teasing at all, and even pointed to a small island not far from them to invite Cell. Kojima, how the hell did I provoke someone? Since you're looking for death, I don't mind completing my mission. Cell flew away first. The crowd followed. Hey hey hey. As soon as Son Goku landed on the island, he started warming up, doing push-ups, sit-ups, leg pulls. What's the use of your movement? Cell asked in puzzlement. It's nothing, just get used to it, come on. Son Goku patted his chest, ready to go. Hee hee, you can do whatever you want. Cell said disdainfully. Wait, Gohan, are there any fairy beans? Give me another one. Goku yelled at Gohan. Cut, I knew it. Son Gohan naturally understood what Son Goku was going to do. He didn't refuse either, and threw out a fairy bean. Here, you just fought with Vegeta, your stamina and chi have dropped, I don't want to lose my victory. Son Goku threw the celestial beans to sell. 
Oh, then I won't be polite. Bang. Cell bit the fairy bean and swallowed it. A stream of heat exploded in an instant, Cell's body swelled, and his aura was fully restored and improved at the same time. What an amazing bean, ha ha ha. Son Goku, you are looking for death. Cell laughed happily. You can really wave, are you all Saiyans like this? Piccolo's mouth twitched. Hey, no way, but don't worry, with me, even if he is ten times stronger, he is still not my opponent. Son Gohan explained. The second game begins. Son Goku crossed his arms, squatted slightly, and a bright golden light suddenly appeared. The golden air wave set off a monstrous storm. At this moment, Son Goku came down to the world like a god burning with golden flames. Although Son Goku's background and potential at this time have not yet been transformed into combat effectiveness, his style seems to be higher than that of a prince. The fighting spirit in his eyes can melt everything. You are not my opponent, let Vegeta come. After sensing Son Goku's anger, Cell looked down on him. Hey, don't worry, I'll catch up to you soon. Yeah. Suddenly, Raditz and Nappa turned on the cochlear detectors. 5.6 billion, 7 billion, 80, 10 billion. Raditz exclaimed. HMPH, I knew it. Vegeta showed an expected expression. It's clumsy again. My old father, I doubt that you have broken through to Super 2. Son Gohan was also very surprised. From the looks of it, it was obvious that Son Goku had hidden his strength again last night. Oh, as expected of Son Goku. I'm suddenly interested. Cell's fighting spirit also began to rise. After using the fairy beans to restore him, his combat power has not increased much. The sudden increase from 15 billion to 20 billion is already abnormal enough. As for Vegeta's sudden increase from 4 billion to 14 billion, it is because of the foundation of three years of penance and the potential explodes in the battle. Cell has just been born and doesn't have much background, although the potential is equally strong and terrifying. Let's fight. Cell took the lead, immediately came to Sun Goku, and then advanced Bankwan, where the iron fist passed, the space was blurred. Sun Goku responded in time. He pressed Cell's arm with both hands and pressed down. With the help of his body, he jumped, a front flip, and rolled onto Cell's back. Then, he strikes back and kicks Cell in the calf with a kick. Pong, Cell's foot was unstable, and he fell to one side. Son Goku didn't let him go, and raised his hand to uppercut, which hit the right cheek of Cell who was about to fall to the ground. The body of Cell that fell to the ground was instantly erected, and then fell to the other side. Yaha! Son Goku fired an momentum cannon at the end, and the invisible air cannon directly blasted Cell into the air. The first move, Son Goku wins, and the weak hits the strong, the scene is extremely comfortable. Pervert, it's more powerful than King Vegeta, Nappa said in amazement. Boom, the blasted Cell instantly blasted away the rocks that were pressing down on him. Son Goku, you're fine. Into it, Cell spat out the blood in his mouth. With a ferocious face, he didn't even react to the silky combo just now. This is just the beginning. Son Goku's IQ exploded in the battle. As long as he is fighting, he will concentrate on it, and his movements are even more untraceable. The martial arts taught by Master Roshi, as well as the days of training in the temple, made his foundation extremely solid. You don't have to think about it, you can make the action that best suits the actual situation. Son Gohan was even more shocked when he saw Son Goku's actions. I'm afraid at the same level, I can't achieve such a perfect reaction from my father. Martial arts can't be achieved overnight. Son Gohan put away his inflated mentality. Son Goku's fighting style is the exact opposite of Vegeta's. Vegeta tends to attack hard. And when the first move was made, the second move was already in his head. Son Goku tends to block, defend, counterattack, and strike after the strike. This requires deep and solid combat experience. At this time, Son Gohan also understood what was said about the two in the original book. Son Goku can learn Ultra Instinct, not luck, but profound accumulation. Everyone thinks their own way, the battle is still going on. The fight with Cell was extremely uncomfortable, far less enjoyable than the fight with Vegeta. The fist-to-body attack is useless in front of Son Goku. I saw Cell hit Son Goku with a right uppercut with all his strength, and Son Goku squatted slightly, rubbing his hair with fists. 
Then he took a step forward in an explosive stride, raising his elbow at the same time, bam. A powerful elbow strike instantly made Cell's stomach ache unbearably. Get out of here. Cell endured the pain and exploded with all his strength, and the invisible air wave sent Son Goku flying. Son Goku became more and more excited as he fought backwards. After flying upside down, he instantly increased his speed, came to the top of Cell, and kicked towards Cell with the help of the downward force. Enough. Cell moved at a high speed to dodge, and Son Goku plunged straight into the ground. Boom. Son Goku was taken aback for a moment, then exploded and flew out of the ground, but Cell managed to seize the opportunity. Qigong Cannon Cell stood proudly in the void, posing Tian Shinhan's unique move with both hands. Tian Shinhan's Qigong Cannon is a must, there is no firing trajectory, and it reaches the target in an instant. Boom! A big square pit appeared, and Sun Goku was blasted into the ground by a powerful Qigong Cannon. Cell succeeded in one blow, but did not continue to attack, because Sun Goku's combat experience made him eager to learn. Sun Goku, get out, I know you're fine. Cell shouted towards the pit. Blow, the breeze was blowing, and there was no response. If you don't come out, I'll go in myself. Cell's face was ugly. Rush down directly at high speed. What is Sun Goku doing at this time? The moment Cell rushed down, the ground shook violently. Boom, boom, boom. Dozens of explosions sounded. The aftermath of blue energy rushes out of the ground. Yes, it worked. Sun Goku rushed out from another ground, shouting loudly. It turned out that after Cell blasted him into the ground with a Qigong cannon, he fell into a cave. Then he buried dozens of Qigong bullets, and left through another passage in the cave. At the same time, suppress the Qi to the lowest level, so that Cell can't even notice it. As he expected, Cell couldn't help but rushed down. The moment he rushed down, he saw dozens of shining blue dots. But the stalactites in the cave are rugged, and he has already touched a spot of light. With an explosion, all the energy buried by Sun Goku was triggered to explode. The moment Sun Goku sensed the explosion, he stopped suppressing his chi and rushed out of the ground at top speed. Sun Goku, you are despicable. Cell roared angrily. The explosion dissipated, and the cell slowly emerged from the cave. I saw a pair of black wings behind him, already in tatters, and one leg was blown away. The face was even more disfigured by the dust after the explosion. The whole person looks embarrassed. I'm so despicable, it's just that you are too stupid. Hee <laughs> hee. Son Goku smiled innocently. But this simple smile is even more infuriating than Vegeta's sarcasm. I won't play anymore. Son Goku, you will die for me. Cell's anger completely overwhelmed his rationality, and he flew high into the sky, posing in a Kamehameha pose. Hey, hey, don't do it, how can you turn your face and turn your face? Son Goku said hastily. Hee hee, Son Goku, dodge if you have the ability, my blow will destroy the earth, I have Frieza's gene in my body, I can survive in the vacuum of the universe. Turtle, hi. Cell began to gather energy with all his strength, 20 billion all the fighting power of the point broke out. My current anger can't stop such a powerful Kamehameha. Son Goku looked embarrassed. Dad, don't worry, the earth has been strengthened. It can't be destroyed, he probably wants to eat Puff Puff. Son Gohan shouted disdainfully. So that's it, then don't blame me. Son Goku moved at high speed, and instantly came to the opposite side of Cell. I saw him let go of his forehead with both hands. Solar flare. A blinding light suddenly appeared, and Cell was instantly blinded by the light. The stinging pain in his eyes instantly made him give up condensing Kamehameha. It's not that he can't hold on, because he also heard what Sun Gohan said. Since the earth cannot be destroyed, Sun Goku will not hardwire it either. He reluctantly launched an attack, but it was in vain. And it's a waste of energy. That's why Son Goku dared to come before him. He believes that Cell will give up his savings Kamehameha. Fighting is not only a confrontation of strength, but also a game of psychology. Speaking of this, I have to mention one more thing, Son Goku in battle, his IQ is off the charts. With one sentence from Son Gohan, you can accurately guess the reaction of Cell. A small island in the south of the earth. The originally picturesque and peaceful island has turned into a dilapidated one. I don't know how many islands they want to destroy. Kojima. Don't come here. 
Sun Goku's solar flare is something most people didn't expect. Only Keelan and Sun Gohan closed their eyes in time. Vegeta, Raditz, Nappa, Piccolo, all four people's eyes were temporarily blinded by the shaking. Kakarot, where did you learn so many weird tricks? Vegeta yelled angrily. Rubbing your eyes at the same time. Sun Goku, didn't expect you to be solar flare too. Whoops, the angry cell suddenly became ruthless to himself, and went so far as to poach the eyeball with two fingers. Then instantly regenerate the eyeballs. The battle is changing rapidly, and he dare not be careless in the face of Son Goku, who has a strange number of ways. So he made a decisive decision, and directly regenerated the eyeballs, repeating the light. Hey, you are so cruel to yourself. Son Goku said in surprise. Son Goku, stop playing childish tricks. I'm going to be serious. Cell regained his composure. Is that so? Well, I haven't fought against such a powerful being for a long time. Come on, don't hold back, my body can't help shaking. Son Goku was so excited. The cold wind blows, the two faced each other, exuding a powerful aura. Bang bang bang, countless fist shadows, leg shadows. It exploded. The sound of fierce fighting resounded in the air. An air wave burst out from the center of the fists of the two colliding. The figures of the two also quickly disappeared, turning into two golden streamers chasing and colliding with each other. Wherever the golden track passes, the earth shakes and the mountains shake. The fists of the two are like overwhelming mountains and seas, endless. Fist to flesh, strong physical duel, let the whole scene explode instantly. Where the two of them passed by, nothing existed, and the lives of the people were devastated. The scorching air waves turned the ground into dark brown scorched earth. Kojima. There is no end. But after Shenron strengthened the earth, that is, the surface suffered damage. Otherwise, such a battle would have caused the volcano to erupt long ago. Seeing the battle between the two, everyone was enthusiastic, and they wished they could rush up to fight too. Four demon fists. Cell yelled violently, and two arms grew out of his shoulders again. Da 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 da. Bang bang bang. Four arms hit Son Goku like a machine gun. The sudden change made Son Goku unaware for a moment, and was hit by hundreds of punches by Cell, and he flew upside down and fell into the sea. Tian Shinhan used this trick when Son Goku was a child, at the Tenkaichi Budokai. But at that time, Son Goku was far stronger than Tian Shinhan. He swung the afterimage of his eight arms with extreme speed and crushed Tian Shinhan directly. But now, Cell's strength is obviously superior to him, and his speed can't crush Cell. Son Goku, who fell into the sea, was not in a hurry to get out, but was thinking about how to face the four demon fist. Yes, Son Goku had a flash of inspiration, and suddenly thought of a way. Son Goku, come out for me. This time Cell didn't rush into the sea like he just rushed into the cave, but fired countless Qigong bombs and threw them at the place where Son Goku fell. He was afraid of being ambushed by Son Goku again. Here we come, what's the hurry? Son Goku rushed out of the sea in an instant. Come to sell again. In my mind, I have your data against the four demon fist, but you don't want to succeed. Your speed can't crush me. Cell said vigilantly. Hey, I'll know after calling. Son Goku smirked. Then rushed up. Cell's forearms hit Son Goku at the same time, and Son Goku blocked the fist with hands and feet together. At the same time, he hugged two arms with both hands, a right arm that grew out later, and an original left arm. I have feet too. Cell kicked Son Goku's crotch with a high kick. Son Goku clamped his legs and clamped Cell's iron legs. Ha ha, Son Goku, you can't escape. Because the legs were lowered to block Cell's iron legs, Cell's other two arms were released. Attacked fiercely towards Son Goku. Just waiting for you. Son Goku's eyes lit up. The arm on Cell's right shoulder was instantly dislocated by him, and the original left arm was blocked by him grabbing the wrist and turning up and growing out. The pain of the dislocation instantly made Cell's movement stagnate. Son Goku quickly used the dislocated arm to wrap around the other attacking arm, then raised his palm and pressed forward, and the two arms were pressed against Cell's chest. Son Goku repeated the same trick, dislocated the other two arms, entangled with these two arms, and tied a dead knot. Hey, four arms are bad for four arms. Son Goku laughed. Asshole. Cell wanted to untie the entwined arm, but the dislocated arm didn't move at all. 
The only arm that is not dislocated, as long as it struggles, the other three will be extremely painful. Hiss. Cell cried out in pain. How could Son Goku let go of such a good opportunity? Countless fist shadows hit Cell. And it still hit the entangled arm. The four arms were bloody, the arms that were originally thick and muscular, had turned into pieces of paper, a thin layer, and only the skin was left. That's enough. You're enough. You. Cell was furious, and the anger made him forget the pain in his arm, and started to fight back with his legs. It is obviously not practical here if the arms can't twist the thighs. Son Goku flew up and down, left and right, and attacked Cell's whole body. Get out, get out, get out of here. Cell exploded with gas all over his body, and a green aura shield instantly propped up and then expanded rapidly. Hum, a radius of 10 meters was covered by his protective cover. It has to be said that no 17's move was brought to the extreme by him. Whoa, whoa, Cell panted heavily. The forearms also broke in an instant, fell. Hey, Piccolo, your genes can also cut off limbs by themselves. Why haven't I seen it? Son Gohan was surprised. Who is idle and free to cut off his arm every day? Piccolo twitched the corner of his mouth and said in a bad mood. Two arms grow again. Son Goku, you, ya. Yeah. What Son Goku did made him feel infinite humiliation. Obviously I am stronger than him, why would I be led away by him? Cell didn't understand, but at the same time, the anger in his heart was burning, the extreme anger and the humiliation made him completely lose his mind. A terrifying, shocking war erupted from his body. Jet-like flames surrounded the entire area in an instant, crackling. Dense lightning rose from his body. In an instant, the sky was dark, the earth was shaking, and the sky was covered with dark clouds, lightning and thunder, as if celebrating the breakthrough of Cell. The sudden change shocked everyone instantly. Good guy, the whetstone has turned into a knife. I didn't expect him to break through the super two first. Hey, Sun Gohan exclaimed. What's going on, Sun Gohan? That's it. Vegeta turned to look at Sun Gohan. As you can see, he has reached the level of Super Saiyan 2. I don't know if my father still has hidden strength. Sun Gohan directly pointed out the mutation of Cell. Also looking forward to Sun Goku. After Sun Goku's great battle just now, a lot of hidden background and penance accumulation have also exploded. The combat power of 10 billion points has also reached 18 billion points. He couldn't help frowning when he saw the changes in Cell. What should I do? It seems that I can't fight, but I still want to fight. Son Goku said unwillingly. Son Gohan looked at Son Goku's expression and understood that he did not break through to Super 2. Looks like it's time for me to act. But he didn't say anything, because after Son Goku admits defeat, he will be on the top. So strong, so strong, this energy, so strong. Cell looked at his body in surprise. Ha ha, Son Goku, you are finished. Cell laughed loudly. The powerful aura shocked the audience, and the eyes of the onlookers widened. Hey, Super 2, Raditz, Nappa exclaimed, HMPH, this monster broke through to Super 2 first. What a shame, Vegeta snorted coldly. Dad, do you still want to fight? Son Gohan teleported to Son Goku. Gohan, Dad still wants to try to see if he can continue to fight and break through. Son Goku is also extremely excited now. Cell's powerful and terrifying aura made his fighting spirit and enthusiasm extremely high. Sun Gohan raised his eyebrows. Okay, then be careful. He was a little worried, but then he vanished into nothingness, after all, he can easily crush Cell now. If the situation is not good, he can shoot at any time. He got a little more serious and looked at the battlefield vigilantly. Cell, do you mind if I eat a fairy bean? Son Goku was physically exhausted after a long battle. After all, Cell's energy is more than twice that of him at this time, and fighting with a tired body is tantamount to courting death. Originally, with his heart of martial arts, it was impossible to make such a request, but in order to break through the limit, he didn't care about so much. He knows that Son Gohan's purpose is to let Cell be their sharpening stone. In order to live up to Son Gohan's kindness, he will fight again. Whatever. With the improvement of Cell's strength, his mentality expanded again. Crunch, Son Gohan throws a fairy bean to Son Goku. As the fairy beans entered his stomach, Son Goku's breath swelled suddenly. 
The combat power of 18 billion points has increased again, reaching 20 billion. All the details of three years of penance have exploded. Sun Gohan vaguely feels that Sun Goku only needs to experience a near-death rebirth. It should be able to break through to Super 2. However, now Cell's combat power can instantly kill Sun Goku. He didn't dare to be careless, watching the battle nervously. Come, Sun Goku took a fighting stance. He he, come attack. Cell hooked his fingers. Sun Goku's body instantly turned into a golden trajectory, rushing towards Cell in an instant. Phew, when, Cell folded his hands on his chest, raised the corners of his mouth, and looked playfully at Sun Goku who hit him in the stomach. Sun Goku's elbow hit Cell hard, but to his surprise, Cell didn't react, not even backing away. Danger, Sun Goku suddenly felt a chill down his spine jump out of Cell's attack range with continuous backflips in an instant. Oh, did you sense it? Cell looked at Son Goku with a smile on his face. That's right, the moment he was about to make a shot, Son Goku dodged in an instant. Cell, I think there's nothing I can do about you. Son Goku said in distress. Son Goku, it's too late for you to admit defeat now. I will pay you back all the humiliation and humiliation I suffered just now. Cell's face twisted ferociously, and extreme anger exploded. Whoosh, Son Goku flew upside down, spit out a mouthful of blood. Cell continues to pursue. Son Goku barely raised his head, don't even think about it. Call out, Son Goku moves at high speed and dodges Cell's fist. But he turned around and looked around, but he didn't see Cell. Goku, watch out, behind you. Krillin shouted in shock. With Keelan's voice, Son Goku felt a chill again, and he moved at high speed again. Whoosh, but no matter where he moves to, Cell is behind him. Seeing that he was no match for him, Son Goku landed on the ground. I can't beat you. Originally, I said it was up to you to break through the limit, but it seems I was thinking too much. Son Goku conceded defeat and spoke very casually. Dream, I don't allow you to admit defeat, come to fight. Cell was furious, and he started to fight himself. Boom, Son Goku was instantly blown away. Cell, stop, Son Gohan was furious, and teleported directly to Cell. At this time, Son Goku was hit hard in an instant. Ahem, so strong, Son Goku stood up reluctantly, coughing up blood. Seeing the appearance of Son Gohan, Cell had an evil smile on the corner of his mouth. Son Goku, don't you just want to break through? Let me help you. My experience just now tells me that anger is the catalyst for breaking through the limit. Cell's palm instantly looked like Krillin. Keelan's body flew into the sky uncontrollably. Cell, stop. Son Goku's eyes widened and his tone was hurried. Goku, Keelan seemed to see Lord Yama's figure. Boom, Keelan instantly exploded into a ball of minced meat. Bloody and bloody. Cell, Son Goku was furious, flames burst out of his eyes instantly. A powerful momentum bursts out. Lightning, air waves, and the sky instantly darkened. His hair stood on end. Die, die, die. Ah, Son Goku looked up to the sky and roared like a beast that lost his mind. His mind flashes of Keelan training with him at Master Roshi, running with a turtle shell on his back. Son Goku's combat power soared from 20 billion to 40 billion points in an instant. Violence and hostility directly broke through his reason. Clack clatter, Son Goku walks towards Cell step by step. Boom, the fists of the two collided instantly, and the powerful aftermath of the collision shattered everything nearby. The ground is barren, Son Gohan quietly withdraws from the battlefield. In fact, with his strength, he was enough to stop Cell just now. But then he thought that Cell was helping Son Goku break through, so he stopped. Keelan worships the heavens, with boundless mana. The fate set can never be detached. Son Goku became furious, broke through to Super 2, and lost his mind. Although his combat power was as good as Cell's, his violent movements made him risk life and death. Exchanging injury for injury, use your life to win. The current Son Goku is in this fighting mode. He seems to be more violent than Vegeta. Bang bang bang, the sound of fierce fighting between the two resounded through the sky. Fate, is it really impossible to escape? Sun Gohan saw thousands of complicated thoughts in his heart when he saw Klin worshipping the sky. He was completely lost. What is my destiny? Why did I come to this world? 
Is there someone behind me? Sun Gohan is no longer paying attention to the battlefield. My thoughts are completely confused. Whoosh. The battle between Cell and Sun Goku was really hot. The earth is as stable as Mount Tai. Death. Sun Goku lost everything in his eyes, only the cell in front of him. If you have the ability, kill him. Cell was not to be outdone and attacked with all his strength. The aftermath of the battle between the two set off a huge wave. The fierce fight forced Piccolo and others to retreat again. Only Vegeta was left standing proudly, looking at everything with cold eyes. The battle between Son Goku and Cell is in full swing. After falling into madness, Son Goku is like a madman, he doesn't care about his injuries at all. The original grass green eyeballs have disappeared, turning into a chilling white. But the strength of the two is still in the middle, so how can they say clearly which is stronger and which is weaker? Sky, the surface of the sea, the bottom of the sea. The entire earth has become a battlefield between two people. Roar, Son Goku was like a furious beast, and the tyrannical aura made Cell tremble uncontrollably. They are both super too, and their combat prowess is at the same level. The strong physique and the fist-to-body duel made Vegeta, who was watching the battle, couldn't help but sigh. Perverts, all perverts, Kakarot is worthy of being Burdock's son, and Saiyan's level really cannot be divided by high school. Piccolo was extremely annoyed, and at the same time was thinking about how to improve himself. Bobo's words kept echoing in his mind. The bloodline of the dragon god Salama, the concentration of refreshing bloodlines, miracles, the power of wishes. All kinds of things also made Piccolo fall into deep contemplation like Sun Gohan. His breath fluctuates, invisible and powerful spiritual power burst out from him. Essence, energy, spirit. Saiyan cultivates the body, energy belongs to Chi, and also belongs to essence. Namic people tend to be conscious, and there are countless superpowers. But for God, cultivation of God also cultivates heart. God is elusive. Piccolo, Sun Gohan seems to have fallen into an epiphany while cultivating immortality. Sun Gohan is confused about his own destiny. Piccolo is contemplating your own future. The pursuit points of the two people are different, and the corresponding effects are naturally different. Piccolo's aura is getting thicker and more solemn, and as time goes by, his combat power slowly increases. 2.8 billion, 3 billion, 4 billion. Sun Gohan this way. The original energy was spinning crazily, as if trying to wake him up, and the strange energy also ran out from the tail again. Two mysterious and powerful auras that even the gods cannot feel are emanating from them. Sun Gohan's body was completely reduced to a battlefield. The original energy and strange energy were like two invincible generals using his body as a battlefield to start a conquest. Sun Gohan's mind is completely sunk. Destiny, future, and traveling to this world, what exactly is it? Unnameable, far away, unknown land. An old Taoist priest wearing a shabby Taoist uniform is telling people's fortunes. He was suddenly startled. What a good boy. He was able to fall into such a deep enlightenment when his strength was not enough. Much better than that rude and perverted little guy. He was stunned for just a moment, and then told someone's fortune again. Little brother, old Taoist temple, your eyebrows are dark, and dark clouds are covering your head. There will be a bloody disaster recently. The old Taoist priest has not finished his words. The servants dressed as young men were furious. You stinky fortune teller. This is the young city lord of Weiyang City. How dare you say that the young city lord is in danger of a bloody disaster, and you are looking for death. The two servants raised their fists to beat the old Taoist priest. Stop it, master. The young city lord's face was gloomy. Ha ha, if you want to solve the bloody disaster, you need to love the people like your own children and abstain. The old Taoist priest took one step forward and reached the city gate tower in an instant as if he had shrunk to the ground. Wei Yang army, stop him. Young city lord shouted loudly. Before Wei Yang's army could make any move, the old Taoist priest had already left the city, taking two or three steps and disappearing. Servant, master, young city master, I met the master. Shut up, young master. Tell father, I will be in retreat soon. The young city lord returned to the city lord's mansion and walked into the retreat hall. Ahem, back to the topic. Everything just now just a small episode. Please check out the extras Dragon Ball, Vegeta's Rebirth, for details.
Dragon Ball World, Earth. Although Son Goku fell into madness, he was unable to cause much damage to Cell with the same strength. The breath of the two people began to decline. Son Goku's sanity is slowly returning. Cell, how dare you kill Krillin, you are looking for death, you are looking for death, Kamehameha wave. Son Goku fell to the ground after regaining his consciousness. Then strike the classic Kamehameha pose. Powerful, solid, and pure blue energy gathered in the hands around his waist. Son Goku left no escape route for himself, and poured all his energy into it. Son Goku, am I afraid of you? Cell is not to be outdone. A gathering of equally terrifying and powerful energy. Wave, wave. As soon as the word, wave, was spoken, two thick blue light beams rushed towards each other instantly. Beep. A big crater instantly appeared on the ground in the center. Aha! Son Goku raised his aura beyond the limit, and all his orifices were bleeding. Just to avenge Klin. Don't even think about it. Cell secretly shouted, and the two light beams instantly thickened again. The scene reached a deadlock for a time. King Vegeta, what should I do? Can I take action? Nappa asked nervously. Raditz is already concentrating his unique skills on the side. You all stop it, this is my battle with him. Before Vegeta could speak, Son Goku shouted loudly. Stop it, don't you even have the dignity of Saiyan. Vegeta and Son Goku have the same attitude. Raditz was stunned when he heard this, and then the energy in his hand slowly dissipated. As expected of Son Goku, whom Dr. Jero takes seriously. Just as Raditz was condensing energy, Cell suddenly felt bad. After all, his fighting prowess is on par with Son Goku. The aftermath of Raditz's energy is tantamount to the last straw that breaks the camel's back. Thanks to Son Goku who spoke up in time to stop him. Cell felt that the crisis dissipated, so he poured energy into it without any scruples. Until now, Cell no longer cares about the instructions in his head, but enjoys the joy of fighting. After all, he has Saiyan cells in his body, a strong opponent makes his heart unbearably excited. Dot dot, ha, Cell exploded again, Kamehameha thickened at a speed visible to the naked eye, and pressed towards Son Goku. Cell, Son Goku shouted angrily, and the blood capillaries on the body surface also began to flow out of blood. The two blue beams of light reached an impasse again. The powerful aftermath also awakened the contemplative and confused Son Gohan and Piccolo. Dad, Son Gohan came back to his senses, and was shocked when he saw the scene in front of him. Gohan, this is my battle, ha, Son Goku shouted and stopped Son Gohan who was going to shoot. Son Gohan was taken aback, and decided to follow Son Goku's advice. Son Goku's strong will surpass the shackles of the physical body. After his limit broke out, Kamehameha became thicker again. Since ancient times, Sun Jia wins. Sun Goku's Kamehameha crushes Cell's Kamehameha. No, impossible, absolutely impossible, Cell roared again. He regretted it, regret killing Krillin and forcing Sun Goku to break through. As he roared unwillingly, Sun Goku's Kamehameha completely crushed him. Boom, seen from space, a huge mushroom cloud has risen from the surface of the earth. Cell's physical body was completely annihilated. No matter where the chip in the body is transferred to, it cannot avoid the energy aftermath. As the dust from the explosion gradually dissipated, the huge waves began to calm down. Klin, Son Goku froze on the spot. Cell's death wiped away his anger, but what followed was extreme sadness. Okay, Dad, can't we just resurrect him? Son Gohan stepped forward to comfort him. But his body is gone, Son Goku said sadly. This is simple, isn't it just a matter of asking Shenron to rebuild his body? Moreover, the Earth's Shenron can also grant three wishes after being strengthened by Dend. Son Goku didn't know about this situation. After hearing Son Gohan's explanation, he was instantly overjoyed. Okay, I'm going to find Bulma to get the Dragon Ball radar. Son Goku didn't even return to normal, and flew towards Bulma's home at full speed at Super 2. Okay, it's over, everyone goes back to their homes. Son Gohan stretched and disappeared in an instant. Piccolo also flew towards his place of practice. Vegeta, Raditz, and Nappa are all flying towards Bowsy Mountain. After an hour, Temple, Dend, hello, Mr. Popo, long time no see. Son Goku stepped forward to greet the two of them. It's Uncle Goku, what can you do? 
Dend asked. I'm here to find the Dragon Ball. Is the last Dragon Ball in the temple? Son Goku asked. Well, I left one behind after reviving Vegeta last time. After making a wish, I tested the Dragon Ball's recovery time. I'll get it for you. Den trotted back to his residence and took out the last one. Three planets. Seven Dragon Balls gather and shine brightly. Come out, Shenron, and fulfill my wish. Son Goku couldn't wait and summoned Shenron directly in the temple. He also forgot his promise to Bulma. Time goes back to an hour ago. Bulma estate. Son Goku, you really never come to me when nothing happens. Are we still friends? Bulma said angrily. Son Goku put his hands together in embarrassment and apologized. Ah, I'm sorry, Bulma, but Krillin is dead, can you give me the Dragon Ball radar? I want to resurrect him. Hurry up. What, Klin is dead? Wait, Krillin and Bulma are also good friends. When Bulma heard this, he was also shocked. He quickly ran back to the research institute and took the Dragon Ball radar to hand to Goku. Thank you so much. Son Goku stretched out his hand to get the Dragon Ball radar. Bulma suddenly retracted his hand. Wait, it seems like the current Dragon Ball can grant three wishes, right? Listen to Gohan, it seems like this. Give it to me quickly. Son Goku replied. How many wishes are needed to resurrect Klin? Two, hurry up. Bulma, I'll tell you when I'm back. Son Goku couldn't wait. No, I want the Dragon Ball radar. You must grant me a wish. Bulma stepped back and made the condition. Okay, okay, this is easy to say, I will give you my last wish. Son Goku immediately agreed. Okay, here, here you go. Bulma handed over the Dragon Ball radar. Son Goku dodged it and flew high into the sky instantly. Son Goku, you haven't asked me what my wish is yet. No, after you collect the Dragon Ball, come back and make a wish for me. Bulma shouted towards the sky. Got it. Son Goku's voice came down. Dot dot dot. Back to now. Hum. The Earth's sky suddenly turned from light to dark, and no one on the Earth knew why. But this happened when Vegeta was resurrected some time ago, and there was no disaster on the Earth, so most people didn't take it seriously. Bulma estate. I knew this crazy guy was unreliable. If others don't know, how can Bulma not know? After she cursed angrily, she took out a space capsule and threw it on the ground. Pong, a weird-looking machine appeared instantly. Thanks to this girl, I have built an aircraft with three times the speed of sound. You guy, just wait for me. Bulma opened the hatch and sat in. She also set up the function of searching for Dragon Balls on the aircraft, just to make it easier for her to find Dragon Balls in the future. The aircraft floated high into the sky, boom. The tail erupts into a thick flame. The aircraft flew directly towards the temple at a speed exceeding three times the speed of sound. Temple, say your first wish, and any three wishes can come true. Shenron's majestic voice sounded. Shenron, please resurrect Krillin. Give him his original body. Son Goku made a wish. This is simple, but it requires two wishes. Shenron, I know, let's make these two wishes come true. Son Goku said excitedly. Okay. Shenron's huge dragon head pointed towards the sky, his eyes glowing red. Hum, the first one to appear was Krillin's body. Underworld, Kaio, Klin, who was training, suddenly felt his soul flickering. It seems that someone has resurrected you. King Kai said. Great, Lord Kaio, goodbye. Klin waved his hand, and his soul body disappeared. Temple, Klin's soul entered his body, and his eyes opened. Goku, thank you. Krillin ran to Goku excitedly. Great, Krillin, you were resurrected. Son Goku was also very happy. Okay, tell me your third wish. Shenron's majestic voice sounded again. Hey, I seem to have forgotten something. Son Goku was stunned. He completely forgot about his promise to Bulma. Time is running out, you'd better hurry up. Shenron obviously couldn't hold it in any longer. Klin suddenly had an idea. Suddenly he said, by the way, Yamcha, resurrect Yamcha. I am in the underworld, and I am not called Yamcha. The king of the world said that Yamcha has disappeared from the underworld. Shenron, please resurrect Yamcha. Klin took the initiative to say. Hum, this wish can't be fulfilled. Shenron used his ability, and after a second. But he said he couldn't do it. What do you mean? Klin was surprised. 
He is not in this universe, beyond the scope of this Shenron's ability. Change another wish. It turns out that Yamcha has disappeared and is no longer in the seventh universe. Shenron's abilities are limited and he cannot fulfill his wishes across the universe. Unless you find Super Shenron to make a wish. Blow. Just when Krillin and Son Goku were in a daze, Bulma arrived in time and the hatch opened. Son Goku. You. Bulma yelled angrily. Hey, I just said I forgot something. Hurry up, Bulma, Shenron can't hold on anymore. Son Goku quickly sold the goods. Shenron, make this girl three years younger. Bulma didn't care whether there was anyone else in front of her. Make a wish quickly. This wish is very simple. Shenron hurriedly fulfilled Bulma's wish, and then couldn't hold on and disappeared. Bulma felt her slightly sagging place suddenly jump. The loose crotch instantly became tight and tangible. Hee <laughs> hee, Bulma, why are you only three years younger? Why don't you go back to 18? Clint stepped forward and teased. You know what the heck, you look so much younger all of a sudden, don't people notice it? Bulma, how old are you this year? Son Goku asked curiously. When? Bulma instantly hit Son Goku with a speed that was a hundred times faster than Super Saiyan. Don't you know it's rude to ask a lady her age? Bulma shouted angrily. Okay, okay, don't ask. Don't ask. Hiss. Son Goku was still wondering at the same time, could it be that Bulma is also an alien? How to hit someone is so fast and painful. Hiss. Bowsy Mountain. Son Goku came back and told Son Gohan what happened in the temple. Ia am also curious about Bulma's age. But comparing it with his own age, he felt that Bulma at this time was at least 30 years old. He was born in 757 AD, Son Goku is already 19 years old. This year is 767 AD. Bulma is at least 3 years older than Son Goku, Son Gohan is 10 years old, Son Goku is 29 years old, and Bulma is at least 32 years old. By the way, Gohan, what do you think about Yamcha's disappearance? Son Goku felt vaguely bad. Dad, I'm going to the underworld. Son Gohan disappeared in an instant. Hell, Kaio sama Gohan, long time no see. You've grown so tall. Kaio sama long time no see, I want to ask you, why did Yamcha on Earth disappear after his death? Son Gohan asked in confusion. Yamcha, that guy, although I haven't paid special attention to it, Lord Yama said some time ago that a person's name disappeared inexplicably from his book of life and death. This name is Yamcha, he thought it was me who accepted it. Yamcha, King Kai suddenly remembered the message that King Yama gave him some time ago. Lord Kaio, under what circumstances will the names in the book of life and death disappear? Sun Gohan frowned. The soul is completely dead, unable to be reincarnated, or has the power of God, and the level of life is sublimated breaking away from the shackles of life, and the king of the realm suddenly stopped. What else? Sun Gohan asked quickly. Furthermore, there is a being that is more powerful than the operating rules of the universe, and has erased the names in the book of life and death. Lord Kaio suddenly looked serious. Gods of destruction, angel, something like that. Sun Gohan was a little surprised. It's possible, but the possibility is slim. I haven't felt any powerful dimensional gods descending on the underworld. The Kaio's face became more and more solemn. So, there is a powerful being from another universe who took away Yamcha. Sun Gohan was stunned for a moment, then his tone was cold. If you guessed correctly, this should be it. Kai Wang said. Okay, leave this matter to me, Kaio sama I'm leaving first. Sun Gohan disappeared. Supreme Kai Star. After Sun Gohan left the underworld, come here. He told old Supreme Kai about Yamcha. After hearing this, the old Supreme Kai suddenly looked cold and heartless. Sun Gohan, you don't need to worry about this matter. It shouldn't be the interference of other universe gods. What do you mean, old Supreme Kai? This was the first time Sun Gohan saw old Supreme Kai being so cold. I can't say too much, but there are too many unknown forces in the universe. Some of the six universes destroyed by Lord Zeno were due to anger from Lord Zeno, and some were due to external factors invading the world. Universe, let Master Zeno clear the entire universe as a last resort. The old Supreme Kai didn't explain it too clearly. Okay, but after all, he is still a seventh universe earthling. If you have any difficulties, please come to me in time. 
Sun Gohan said. Well, I know. By the way, you little guy. Have you had any adventures recently? I see how you seem to have the aura of a god now. Speaking of which, I have to admire the vicious eyes of old Supreme Kai. You really have a sharp eye. That's right, some time ago I. As Sun Gohan spoke, old Supreme Kai's expression became more and more excited. It's true, it's true, I didn't expect it. You can also see the legendary king of time and space, and Kassens, the ancestor of the first generation of Supreme Kai. The old Supreme Kai was so excited that he couldn't stand it. Do you also know about the king of time and space? Sun Gohan asked curiously. Sun Gohan, it seems. You don't know that Supreme Kai's space-time ring and ability to travel through time and space. It was caused by your influence. The old Supreme Kai revealed a shocking secret. What? Because of me? Impossible. Sun Gohan jumped up in shock. Ancestor, why didn't I know about this? Supreme Kai Shin couldn't help but say. It is mentioned in the inheritance of Supreme Kai that at the end of the Time and Space King's calendar, the ancestor of Kassens brought a strange boy to visit the King of Time and Space. Later, all the Supreme Kais in the universe were given the ability to travel through time and space by the King of Time and Space. But traveling through time and space is a serious crime. Under normal circumstances, you are not allowed to travel casually. Unexpectedly, that boy turned out to be you. Old Supreme Kai had to sigh at the magic of time and space. The king of time and space is really powerful. Sun Gohan couldn't help but sigh. Hey, since the king of time and space disappeared, the entire universe has lost the suppression of the king of time and space. Countless parallel times and spaces have appeared, and some external forces have begun to take advantage of it. The inherited memory left by the ancestor of Kassens mentioned that the king of time and space suppressed all time and space. At that time, there was only one time and space where the king of time and space was, and no external factors could break through the defense of the king of time and space. Old Supreme Kai sighed. Ahem, I'm going too far. Little guy, let me see the strength you mentioned. I'm really curious, Old Supreme Kai said curiously. Okay, boom, Sun Gohan was the first to transform into Super Saiyan, and his dark golden arrogance erupted instantly. Then comes, Super Saiyan 2. The surrounding air waves turned into jets, his hair turned into dark gold, and dense black lightning crackled on his body. Although the violent and violent emotions in the tail were constantly pouring into his mind, he was not affected by it at all, but it was very natural. In the past three years, he can already perfectly control the transformation of Super 2 and his violent aura. Even the violent aura that originally emitted has become very calm. But Sun Gohan felt that if he untied himself, he would immediately turn into a violent beast. Yes, yes, Sun Gohan, you have a trace of divine energy in your breath. God's energy, is this what you're talking about? Sun Gohan's face was ruthless, and a dark golden energy emitted from his index finger, surrounded by the rules of destruction. It's too strong, the dimension is more powerful than that guy's destructive power. Old Supreme Kai was excited. Okay, little guy, where is that form? Old Supreme Kai gestured for him to transform into a mysterious form. Don't worry, Old Lord Supreme Kai. I have a new transformation in this form. This is also my first time. Please stay away. Sun Gohan stepped back, and a violent, violent aura erupted from one side of his body, and his whole person was wrapped in a dark golden light. Ah, the Supreme Kai star began to tremble, Old Supreme Kai, Supreme Kai Shin, and the two of them were instantly blown away. That's right, after Sun Gohan fell into confusion some time ago, the original energy and the strange energy caused chaos again, which caused his body's bottleneck to break again. He thinks, he can transform into Super 3. This is his first transformation, so he can't control his momentum perfectly, so he told them to stay away. He had no idea what was going to happen. Ah! His hair grew instantly, and the dark golden long hair made him look extremely noble, his eyebrows disappeared, and the brow bone was raised high. It seems that under the influence of the strange energy, his Super 3, like Super 1 and Super 2, have undergone terrifying mutations. The original 400 times increase in combat power instantly doubled to 800 times. 500 million points of normal combat power, an 800-fold increase, 400 billion points. 
The dark golden light flickered on his body, and even the ordinary martial arts uniform looked extremely noble and mysterious. Dense dark golden lightning flashed across the entire body. Master Supreme Kai, this is Super Saiyan 3. The combat power increase is normally 400 times. But because of my chance, the multiplier has doubled to 800 times, Sun Gohan looked at his form with satisfaction. However, Chao San's energy consumption is too great, just for a moment, his physical body feels a little tired. Although this trace of exhaustion is nothing at all, Sun Gohan knows that if he fights in this form, his persistence will be much shorter than in the mysterious form. Moreover, the mysterious form is also surrounded by terrifying death rules. Although the multiplier is not as terrible as the increase of Super Saiyan 3, its consumption is extremely small, and it can be used for protracted battles. The Super 3 form can only be resolved quickly. Good boy, although this form is strong, it is far from the form I developed for you. Old Supreme Kai said slowly. You're right, it's true, but this transformation can be used as a whole card. Sun Gohan returned to normal. Immediately afterwards, an aura of despair, dead silence, and people who don't want to live envelop the entire Supreme Kai star in an instant. A gray arrogance erupted from Sun Gohan's body, with gray and tall bristling hair, and dead gray eyes. It looks extremely desperate and horrifying, like the god of death who came to the world from hell. The eyebrows are also raised, and the eyebrows disappear. Super Saiyan looks evil, tyrannical, and full of hostility. The mysterious form is despair, and the shadow of death covers everything. Even the grass under his feet instantly lost its vitality, dried up, and died. And this situation is still spreading, 10 meters, 100 meters, 1 kilometer, it won't be long before the area shrouded in Sun Gohan's aura will turn into a land of death. Enough, stop, stop, stop. The old Supreme Kai shouted anxiously. Sun Gohan's dead eyes turned, and he glanced at the old Supreme Kai. The old Supreme Kai instantly felt chills down his spine, and the shadow of death enveloped his heart. Sun Gohan slowly closed his eyes, and the gray breath returned to his body as if going back in time. He's back to normal. Strange, why does it feel like I'm a little stronger? After Sun Gohan returned to normal, he suddenly felt that his physical body had become much stronger. Absorption, it is absorption, just now the life force of the grass under your feet was exhausted, when you return to normal, that dead breath returned to your body with the absorbed vitality. That's why you feel that your physical body has changed again. Much stronger. The old Supreme Kai saw the problem just now. Ah, when I opened my eyes, I became a devil. Sun Gohan was also shocked. Absorbing life force sounds very evil. There is no distinction between good and evil in power. It depends on the person who uses this power as right and evil. Sun Gohan, you must stick to your heart and not be tempted by this powerful force. Old Supreme Kai reminded. I see, Master Supreme Kai. Sun Gohan said firmly. After the mysterious transformation, this is the first time he has transformed outside of the space-time king's residence. The fact that the ability to absorb life force was not found at the beginning should be due to the suppression of the space-time king. Supreme Kai Star Sun Gohan left after communicating with Old Supreme Kai for a long time. The Old Supreme Kai speculated on the future development of the mysterious form for him. The current mysterious form, due to the influence of rules, has changed and cannot be measured according to common sense. The Old Supreme Kai boldly predicted that according to the method he used to tap Sun Gohan's potential, Sun Gohan will guide it on his own. At the peak of this form, the increase in combat power will reach a terrifying 1,000 times. From now on, the old Supreme Kai no longer dares to think about it. Sun Gohan needs to make a breakthrough on his own. However, Sun Gohan is also confident that Gohan, the beast form in Dragon Ball Super Season 2, is definitely the second level of the mysterious form. In that form, Sun Gohan has no mutations caused by the rules, and his combat power can compete with Sun Goku, Vegeta's super blue form, and even surpass it. However, this is also his speculation. It is not easy to reach that level. After all, the current soul is no longer Sun Gohan himself. The transformation of Super Saiyan can proceed according to the familiar plot. The mysterious form has the help of the old Supreme Kai, but the beast form is purely a mutation of the original Sun Gohan. There is no experience to draw from. 
he has to eat one bite at a time, and now he has surpassed the original Sun Gohan by countless times. The original Sun Gohan's peak combat power during the Cell period was at most 50 billion. Later, he became a waste until the Majin Buu chapter. His combat power decreased instead of increasing. It was not until the old Supreme Kai was born and helped him develop the mysterious form that he returned again, peak. At this time, Sun Gohan, not to mention the two major powers of destruction and death, the 800 times Dark Gold Super 3 increase alone is enough to crush Majin Buu, and the 650 times mysterious form is also enough. What to do next? Just follow the method taught by the old Supreme Kai to increase the multiplier of the mysterious form to 1000 times. It is worth mentioning that after breaking through the Super 3 bottleneck, his normal combat effectiveness has once again shown signs of substantial improvement. Just after transforming into Super 3 for the first time and returning to normal, the normal combat power increased by 200 million. He feels that his potential is still flowing out. After saying goodbye to the old Supreme Kai, he returned to Bowsy Mountain, took out the gravity chamber, and began to practice crazily. Push-ups, sit-ups, frog jumps under multiple gravity. Sun Gohan is sweating profusely and enjoying the pleasure of increasing his combat power. After the physical strength is exhausted, he swallows fairy beans to recover, and the cycle repeats. But the physical body recovered easily, but mentally he was very tired. But even though he was mentally exhausted, he did not give up his practice. Instead, he sat cross-legged and followed the method taught by the old Supreme Kai to develop the potential of the mysterious form. Sun Gohan continued to practice hard like this. In addition to eating, he even saved time sleeping. He meditated to restore his mental power and develop his potential at the same time. Crazy hard training greatly stimulated Sun Goku and Vegeta. Sun Gohan was already so much better than them, yet he still practiced so hard, which directly stimulated everyone's mentality. So the gravity chamber belonging to Sun Goku couldn't stop at all. Vegeta comes out. Sun Goku comes in, Sun Goku comes out, Raditz comes in, Raditz comes out, Nappa comes in, and then Vegeta again. When not in the gravity room, the remaining three people competed and fought frantically. Anyway, with the blessing of the fairy beans, everyone was completely free to fight. Seriously injured, reborn on the verge of death. This happens all the time. Involution, crazy involution. Three months later, Lan Chi suddenly appeared and broke everyone's inner circle. Sun Gohan, get out of here. Da 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 da. The blonde Lan Chi carried the blue flaming Gatling and fired wildly towards the gravity chamber. But Sun Gohan's gravity chamber is made of the strongest thunderbolt steel in the seventh universe, even if the barrel of Lan Chi's gun is burning red, let alone bullet holes. Not even a scratch appeared. Stop it, where is the crazy woman? You want to die. Seeing this, Raditz was furious, and raised his hand to kill Lan Chi. To say that the guy who is most loyal to Sun Gohan is Raditz. Under Sun Gohan's practice of slapping a sweet date at the beginning, Raditz surrenders to Sun Gohan from the bottom of his heart. In addition, Sun Gohan usually politely calls him uncle, which made him feel the warmth that he has never had before. So, Raditz's emotions explode in an instant. Raditz, stop. Sun Goku casually fired a Qigong bomb, smashing it at the Qigong bomb fired by Raditz, and the two Qigong bombs collided and exploded instantly. The fierce explosion instantly sent Lan Chi flying a hundred meters away. Ba ba ba, Lan Chi spat out the sand that splashed into her mouth. Sun Goku, what do you mean? Raditz looked at Sun Goku with sharp eyes. Hee <laughs> hee, Raditz, she is our friend, I believe, Gohan doesn't want you to kill her either. Sun Goku explained with a wry smile. So that's the case, forget it. Raditz heard that he was a friend, and instantly let go of his murderous aura. Lan Chi, why did you find me? Sun Goku walked up to Lan Chi and asked. Sun Goku, I'm going to ask that son of yours, where did he hide Tian Shinhan? When Lan Chi explained the reason, she was so angry that she was about to explode. Tian Shinhan, by the way, it has been more than four years since Gohan sent Tian Shinhan to the Three-Eyed Clan. Lan Chi, don't worry, I'll call Gohan. Sun Goku walked to Sun Gohan's gravity room in front of you, press the communicator. Because the sound insulation effect of the gravity chamber made of thunderbolt steel is too strong, Sun Gohan can't hear the movement outside at all. 
In addition, Lan Chi is attacking with a gun and has no air, so Sun Gohan can't sense it either. What's the matter, Dad? Sun Gohan asked through the communicator. Lan Chi has something to do with you, come out for a while. Sun Goku said. Lan Chi, by the way, why did you forget Tian Shinhan? Dad, tell her to wait for me, I'll take a shower, I smell so bad. Sun Gohan said. Oh, I see. Ten minutes later, I have to say that a man can wash his face faster than a woman can wash her face. Sun Gohan opened the door and walked out slowly. Even the martial arts uniform couldn't cover his chiseled and sculpted muscles, and the eight-pack abs showed a trace of traces under the not-so-loose martial arts uniform, looming. After a long period of penance, Sun Gohan is also unkempt. Although he doesn't grow a beard at his age, his dark hair does hang down his shoulders. The facial features are deep, a pair of eyes are like cold stars, and the two sword eyebrows are like paint. The appearance of Sun Gohan in his youth is far better than that of Sun Gohan in his adulthood. I'm afraid the person surnamed Wu and the person surnamed Chen will give up three points after seeing this appearance. Cough cough. Far away. His handsome appearance also stunned the fiery blonde Lan Chi for three seconds, but the cold light in his eyes made Lan Chi tremble with fear. Lan Chi, I'm sorry, I forgot about Tian Shinhan, he should be in his ancestral star. I'll go and bring him back right away. As soon as Sun Gohan spoke, Lan Chi suddenly recovered. But when she spoke, she was unexpectedly gentle. Ah, okay, don't worry. Don't worry. The unexpected expression made Sun Goku's eyes widen instantly. It was the first time he saw the blonde Lan Chi showing such a peaceful and gentle look. The blonde-haired Lan Chi seemed to realize that she was abnormal. Go, let me go now. Lan Chi shouted loudly. At the same time, I said sorry to Tian Shinhan in my mind. Sorry, sorry, Tian Shinhan, although he is very handsome, I still like you. After Sun Gohan smiled, instant transmission disappeared. New Three-Eyed Star Two years after Sun Gohan brought the spaceship of King Tianmu to the New Three-Eyed Star, the members of the Three-Eyed Tribe also arrived at their new home. After several months of land reclamation and infrastructure construction, the new Three-Eyed Star has begun to take shape. After the crisis subsided, the tribe exuded a vigorous and prosperous atmosphere. The construction of the new Tianmu Palace has been completed. It is majestic and domineering, shocking people. Tian Shinhan, when can we return to Earth? Dumpling asked with a pout, looking aggrieved. With his back to the dumpling, Tian Shinhan looked up to the sky. Jowzi, it's coming soon, I have a hunch, that little Gohan, it's coming soon. Tian Shinhan's third eye flashed a golden light. Oh, it seems that the three-eyed clan didn't lie to me, Tian Shinhan. You can predict my ways. As soon as Tian Shinhan finished speaking, Sun Gohan's voice sounded behind them. Are you? Gohan, we haven't seen each other for a few years, and you have grown so big. Tian Shinhan looked at Sun Gohan in horror. Well, Saiyan will grow like crazy when he is a child, a teenager, and an adult. He looks different every day. Sun Gohan said calmly. I see. No wonder Goku has changed so much in the last world number. 1 Budokai. Tian Shinhan instantly remembered how Sun Goku looked when he was 19 years ago many years ago. Don't talk about me, let's talk about you. How have you been living here for four years? Sun Gohan asked curiously. Hearing this, Tian Shinhan smiled wryly and said, Hee hee, there seem to be many people in the clan who don't want me to appear. Ha, huh, I'm going to find the Tianmu king. Sun Gohan frowned, and an inexplicable anger rose in his heart. Don't. Before Tian Shinhan could stop him, Sun Gohan had disappeared. Jowzi, let's go there too. Tian Shinhan took the dumplings and walked slowly towards Tianmu King's palace. His pace is not fast, maybe he subconsciously hopes that Sun Gohan will teach the three-eyed people a lesson. Inside the palace hall, left Prime Minister, this planet is much bigger than the original three-eyed star, why do you insist on letting your clan members compete with others for territory? Right Prime Minister pointed at left Prime Minister angrily. You fart, what do you mean I let you snatch it? I have many sons and grandchildren. What's wrong with taking more points? Besides, do you need to go up the line in the competition between juniors? Zuo Shang pointed at the same time without showing any weakness, scolding the right minister angrily. The ministers of the two factions also began to insult and attack each other. 
King Tianmu frowned and his face was extremely ugly. You have few descendants, it's you who are wicked. Fart, don't think we don't know how many children were assassinated by your arrangements. You're talking nonsense, we don't occupy the space for ourselves, but to build a palace for young master Tian Xinhen. A member of the leftist faction suddenly raised the question of Tian Xinhen. Young master, you still have the face to mention the young master, don't forget how the eldest son of the left minister insulted the young master. The people of the right minister's faction became angry when they mentioned this. The Tianmu king couldn't hold back any longer, and a powerful aura erupted in an instant. Shut up, everyone. The scene suddenly became quiet. All of you, do you think my palace is a vegetable market? In the past, under the crisis at the end of the planet, although the left and right sides were tit for tat, the ultimate goal was to solve the crisis. Once the crisis subsides, all greed. The ugliness and greed all exploded. Where there are people, there will be fights, not to mention the three-eyed clan with a total population of eight billion. Also please His Majesty Tianmu Wang clearly. The two figures on the left and right spoke at the same time as if forcing the palace. The face of the third eye king twitches with anger. He he, Tianmu King, it seems that you are not doing well. A voice suddenly sounded. A figure slowly floated down from the top of the hall. The person coming is none other than Sun Gohan. Little friend Sun Gohan, you're here, long time no see. Tianmu Wang was pleasantly surprised but secretly worried. To his surprise, Sun Gohan rescued him from the scene before him, but his worry was that Sun Gohan would find out the humiliation suffered by Tian Xinhen. I've been listening to it for a while now, it seems that you three-eyed people are not monolithic. Sun Gohan said in a cold tone. Well, this makes you laugh. Ha ha, King Tianmu smiled awkwardly. At this time, Prime Minister Zuo's forehead and back were involuntarily dripping with cold sweat. The appearance of Sun Gohan instantly awakened his greedy heart covered by desire. The scene of Sun Gohan destroying the star instantly appeared in his mind. Sun Gohan shook his head. I have nothing to do with the civil strife of the three-eyed clan. What I care about is only my friend, Tian Xinhen. So, I want to ask, is the eldest son of the left prime minister here? Middle. The cold murderous aura instantly covered the audience. Calm down, little friend Gohan, calm down, things are not what you think. Zuo Shang hurriedly opened his mouth to explain. Call out. Sun Gohan's eyes froze, and two golden light beams rushed out of his eye sockets in an instant, the pupils of the left phase enlarged, and the breath of life stopped abruptly. Boom, Zuo Shang fell to the ground, and blood spread. Insult, there is a price to pay. Sun Gohan's murderous aura terrified everyone present. Fear corrodes their greedy hearts. Sun Gohan, here is the three-eyed star, Tianmu Wang froze, suppressing his anger. Hee hee, three-eyed star, three-eyed star. Ha ha. Sun Gohan laughed loudly, and the powerful momentum erupted instantly, directly shattering the ceiling of the palace. Sun Gohan soars high into the sky. At the same time, he dragged the right minister with his air, and came to his side. Come on, point me in the direction. Sun Gohan said coldly. What direction? Prime Minister on the right was taken aback. Which direction is the person who insulted Tian Xinhen? Sun Gohan asked coldly, with extreme killing intent, the right minister dared not refuse at all, and tremblingly pointed to the direction where the left minister's eldest son was. Little friend Gohan, be merciful. King Tianmu shouted loudly. Sun Gohan was condescending, no matter what, he fired a cannon directly along the area pointed by the right-hand man. The terrifying energy intimidated the world, and the area in the pointed direction instantly turned into a piece of red land, with no people left, and even the basic buildings were not left behind. Things have exploded, and Gohan is too ruthless. Although Tian Xinhen said this, the corners of his mouth were raised and he was obviously very happy. Although he belongs to his clan, but to put it bluntly, he has been on earth for the first half of his life, and he has no sense of belonging here, so Ida s okay to be nice to him, ostracized, insulted, he can't hold back for a long time. If it weren't for Gohan's embarrassment, I'm afraid he would have done it himself. It is possible that others have forgotten, Tian Xinhen, but one of the original villains in the Dragon Ball plot. Whitewashing is also because of the influence of Son Goku. He is not the Holy Mother, but he is getting older and restrained a lot, but it doesn't mean he has no temper. 
Gohan's approach is very in line with his wishes. So what about the clansmen? The clansmen who were loyal to him in the first place have long since died. The current clansmen are just some new generations. Little friend Gohan, you are too much. King Tianmu was furious. Chi's body is trembling. King Tianmu, I saved you in the first place because your nation is not a brutal race. Remember, I can make you live, and I can make you die. Sun Gohan's eyes were sharp, and the majestic aura made the air thin what a score. The Tianmu king's anger dissipated in an instant, and a chill rushed into his heart in an instant. The ministers in the palace are also trembling, walking on thin ice. My friend Gohan, I'm blinded by a leaf, don't worry, this kind of thing won't happen again in the future. King Tianmu immediately lowered his posture and said respectfully to Sun Gohan. There is no future. Tian Shinhan suddenly appeared and moved to the two of them at high speed. Young master, Tianmu King said anxiously, that's enough, I don't bother to be your young master. If it wasn't for Gohan's face, I would have done it long ago. I want to go back to Earth, and I won't stay on your planet. Tian Shinhan yelled angrily. The Tianmu King's face became even more ugly. The explosion just now also made all the elders in the closed door retreat come out. The great elder was the first to speak out. Little friend Gohan, we made a mistake in this matter, and we should pay the price. Young master, please don't give up on your tribe. The great elder has long known the cause and effect, but the power of the left prime minister has already surpassed their elders. He also told the Tianmu king long ago that if it continues to develop, there will be unpredictable consequences. But the Tianmu king is indecisive, and he is reluctant to weaken the strength of the three-eyed clan. It's still reasonable, Sun Gohan said lightly. My little friend, please don't blame me, the great elder said with a low posture. His appearance also made Tian Shinhan's anger dissipate a lot. After all, the one who helped him lift the seal was the great elder in front of him. Great elder, I don't care about the others, but you, and the other elders of the elder group, I will treat you as my family. Tian Shinhan said firmly. But, the elder also understood Tian Shinhan's attitude, but he still wanted to say something. It's nothing to worry about. After all, Tian Shinhan is still the young master of the Three-Eyed Clan. As long as you are loyal to him, I guarantee that your Three-Eyed Clan will return to the top. Sun Gohan made the decision for Tian Shinhan. Tian Shinhan's anger dissipated. He did not refute Sun Gohan, he is not stupid, he knows that Sun Gohan is doing it for his own good. Eight billion tribesmen with thousands or tens of thousands of fighting power are also a fighting power that cannot be ignored. Tianmu King, Great Elder, many ministers and Sun Gohan Tian Shinhan are seated in the hall again. King Tianmu, do you have any opinions on the matter of the left minister? Sun Gohan said coldly. Tianmu King clenched his fists tightly when he heard this, and then relaxed in less than a second. No. His tone is very bad. HMPH. Whether you have it or not, listen to me, fists are the truth. If you are upset, you can challenge me at any time. Before you beat me, don't make trouble behind my back, I am too lazy to play you don't even bother to play tricks and tricks, you are not qualified. Sun Gohan can naturally see how unwilling he is in his heart. Little friend Gohan, we all understand what you said. Seeing that Tianmu King did not speak or refute, the great elder hurriedly followed Sun Gohan's words. Tian Shinhan, come back to earth with me, if you don't go back, Lan Chi will tear down my house. Sun Gohan said angrily. Lan Chi, no, 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 then I won't go back, the three-eyed star is fine. Upon hearing the word Lan Chi, Tian Shinhan's eyes were full of panic as if he had seen a scourge. Zhou, you are still a man, why are you afraid of a woman? Sun Gohan scolded. Women, have you ever seen a woman with a cannon? Have you ever seen a woman with a gatling bulging towards you? Gohan, you're not kidding. Tian Shinhan said that he didn't want to go back with him. Idiot, doesn't she just want to test your length? Just tell her about her depth, conquer her, let her listen to you from her heart. Think about it, blonde hair, blue hair, gentle, violence, two personalities, double happiness, I will teach you. Sun Gohan lowered his voice as he spoke, and even leaned behind Tian Shinhan's ear. Tian Shinhan's face is getting redder and redder, and the shyness on his face is like a young girl in love. Understood. Sun Gohan patted Tian Shinhan on the shoulder and asked. Hum, 
Can what you said really work? Tian Shinhen still couldn't believe it. Nonsense, isn't that what matters between men and women? Listen to me, you are absolutely right. Sun Gohan is full of confidence. However, Gohan, you know so much at the age of 10. No wonder Bulma said you at the beginning, you too will be okay. Tian Shinhen looked at Sun Gohan strangely, recalling the party at Guixian Island, Bulma taunt him as a critic. Shut up, Tian Shinhen, this is none of your business, mind yourself. Go, go back to Earth. Sun Gohan grabbed him and disappeared with dumpling instant transmission. Only the stunned Tianmu King and his party were left behind. Big, big elder, let the young master do this, okay. Tianmu King's eyes were dull. Maybe, okay, maybe next time I come back, I can see the little young master. The elder was also stuttering. Although their cochlea is not as developed as the Namek people, but the third eye is very good. Through Sun Gohan's mouth, they understand how Sun Gohan guides Tian Shinhen. Good guy, I didn't expect there to be such a magical skill as the 36 characters of Yin and Yang. I want to try. King Tianmu then walked towards his harem. Elder, my subordinates have also resigned. My concubine in the 36th room is in a good mood these two days. I'm going to study. Right Prime Minister hurriedly left. Farewell, Grand Elder, we are also retiring. My grandson got married today and left first. My sister-in-law is here today, I'll go back and say hello. In less than a moment, the humming and majestic palace hall was silent. Ahem, I don't know the young man. I come to see, the great elder said to himself, and left the hall with his hands behind his back. Earth Bun Mountain, call out, two figures appeared. Tian Shinhen, the blonde Lan Chi ran to Tian Shinhen in an instant, tightly hugging Tian Shinhen's arms with both hands, fearing that Tian Shinhen would disappear again if he didn't notice. I've brought him back for you. Don't make a mess in Baozi Mountain. Sun Gohan said helplessly. HMPH, what I want is Tian Shinhen. Blonde Lan Chi snorted coldly. Okay, that's enough, woman, shut up. Don't mess around without my permission in the future. Tian Shinhen remembered Sun Gohan's words and scolded him sternly. Quote question mark. Tian Shinhen, I know, the blonde Lan Chi was stunned, then her face turned red, and she agreed softly. She seems to really enjoy Tian Shinhen's attitude towards her. Tian Shinhen was also very surprised, and Sun Goku's eyes widened even more. Sun Gohan blinked at Tian Shinhen, as if to say, listen to me, right? Tian Shinhen nodded slightly and said, then we won't disturb you anymore, Gohan, Goku, goodbye, call me if you need anything, I'm always here. Well, okay, Tian Shinhen, bye. Sun Goku waved his hand. Sun Gohan took a step forward and said, next time we meet, let's have a good discussion. I feel like it won't be easy after you lift the seal. No problem, I also want to taste the power of Super Saiyan. Tian Shinhen not only lifted the seal, but also read countless documents of the Three-Eyed Clan. Goodbye, don't forget what I said. Hee <laughs> hee, Sun Gohan said with a bad smile. Tian Shinhen's face turned red and he whispered, I know. Tian Shinhen hugged Lan Chi and flew high into the sky, with Dumpling following closely behind. But Sun Gohan immediately grabbed the Dumpling. Dumpling, please do me a favor. Sun Gohan said. What's the matter, Gohan? Although Daozi wanted to be with Tian Shinhen, but faced with Sun Gohan's request, Daozi decided to help him. You help me go to the temple to play with Dend for a few days. He is a little bored. Let me tell you, Dend is. Sun Gohan explained as he left with the dumplings. In order for Tian Shinhen to conquer Lan Chi, Sun Gohan took great pains. Naturally, we cannot let go of the 3000 watt light bulb dumpling. After arranging the dumplings in the temple, Sun Gohan was finally free. Ha, huh, it's more tiring than a fight. There are only four years left before the agreement with Beerus, and there are still a few days before school, why don't I go to the gods of destruction first? Vegeta and the others are still worse. Far, not up to the standards of Beerus. I also want to ask Wis how to break through the dimension of God. Sun Gohan thought for a moment alone and decided to go to the gods of destruction first. Call out. Gods of Destruction Star. Oh, why did you come early? Lord Beerus hasn't woken up yet. Whis looked at Sun Gohan in surprise. I have nothing to do. I'll study with you for a few days. 
I'm sorry to bother Mr. Wis these two days. Sun Gohan said politely. Oh ho ho ho, there's no delicious food, I don't agree. Wis joked. A delicious food is always available. A. Sun Gohan throws a space capsule. It contains a variety of instant noodles, cup noodles, seafood, braised, spicy, spicy, bone soup, everything. Chapter 111. Gods of Destruction Star. As for why Sun Gohan prepares so many instant noodles, of course there is a reason. He decided to go to the Gods of Destruction because he wanted to ask Wiss for advice, so naturally he couldn't go empty-handed. The best way to conquer Wiss, Beerus is with delicious food. The day before coming to Gods of Destruction, Earth. Mom, please don't run around these two days, your belly is so big. Sun Gohan carefully helped Chi-Chi sit down. Chi-Chi is six months pregnant and her belly is quite a bit bigger. Hum, why is your hair so long? Hurry up and cut it, like a bad boy. During pregnancy, Chi-Chi's temper changed even more. It was calm one second and stormy the next. Vegeta, Raditz and Nappa are so scared that they dare not practice near Son Goku's house recently. The gravity room has also been moved near Vegeta's house. Your dad, half of you can take care of people. Don't worry, Gohan, mom is fine, but I feel a little old. When I was pregnant with you, I was much better than now. Doing housework and cooking will not delay anything. Hey, old man, brat, let me tell you, you can't be like your father when you marry Vital, do you hear me? Chi Chi chattered about Sun Gohan. Sun Gohan is one head and two big. Okay, mom, I see, I'm going to see Vital, I haven't seen her for three months, I'm afraid she's about to explode again. Sun Gohan hurriedly found an excuse to leave. What, you haven't been there for three months? You brat, go quickly. As soon as Chi Chi heard about his future wife, he quickly let Sun Gohan go. Sun Gohan came out and found Sun Goku, Vegeta and the others. After telling his father that he needed to take care of his mother, Sun Gohan swept through several supermarkets and came to Gods of Destruction Star. It is worth mentioning that Saiyan's combat effectiveness has become much stronger after the crazy involution. Raditz, normal combat power 100 million points, Super Saiyan at full power, 80 times increase, 8 billion points. Nappa, normal combat power of 150 million, Super Saiyan at full power, 80 times increase, 12 billion points. After Vegeta solved the problem last time, the two of them solved the knot in their hearts, and through the crazy battle with Son Goku Vegeta, their combat power soared like crazy. Exaggerated growth. And Son Goku also guided them on how to reach full power for three months. It has always maintained its Super Saiyan transformation, so it is expected that it will reach full power. Vegeta, the normal combat power is 400 million points, the Super 1 full power is increased by 80 times to 32 billion, and the Super 2 initial stage is 40 billion. That's right, by fighting Cell, Super Saiyan 1's combat power soared to 18 billion, and Super Saiyan 1 lacked a hardy battle. After the first month of crazy introversion practice, he passed the battle with Son Goku, successfully broke through Super 2. Son Goku Normal combat power is 500 million points, Super 1 full power increases 80 times, 40 billion points, Super 2 initial power increases 100 times, 50 billion points. To say that those who have grown the most are Raditz and Nappa. Vegeta's breakthrough to Super 2 is also a huge growth, but this is also expected. Son Goku has the least growth. After all, he broke through to Super 2 due to Krillin's sacrifice in the Battle of Cell. During this period of time, it only stabilized the Super 2 form and did not reach full power. According to Sun Gohan's calculation, Super 2 also has full power. The lightning that flashed outside the Super 2 should be the reason why the breath in the body is too strong. After reaching full power, the breath will be more stable, and the multiplier will increase by 30 to 50 times around. The amplification multiple of Super Saiyan can be said to be fixed or not fixed, just like when Super Saiyan first broke through, the aura was violent, and the arrogance on the outside is the expression of the aura, which consumes a lot of energy. After reaching full power, the aura is restrained and no longer outward. It won't consume so much energy. Naturally, the increase in strength is high. This also leads to different multiples of combat power increase. Full power means taking this form to its extreme. 
The same is naturally true for Chaoror. In addition to the jet like gas flames, there are also dense lightning flashes, which is the reason for the multiple increases too strong, the breath is released, and the reason is unstable. If you converge your aura, no longer generate lightning, consume too much energy, the combat power multiplier will increase, and you can better utilize this form to the extreme. Super 3 is different. Super 3 itself is a transformation with high energy consumption. Although the increase in combat power is strong, it also consumes a lot. If you want to reach the full power of Super 3, you might as well think about how to break through Super Saiyan God, or the Super Saiyan God. 4. The extremely long hair, raised brows, powerful aura, and lightning denser than Super 2 all illustrate how exhausting this form is. Super 3 itself is the transformation developed by Son Goku in the underworld. The underworld is the destination of people after death. After death, there is no such thing as physical strength, so Son Goku can perfectly display Super 3 in the underworld. This doesn't mean that you can't reach the full power of Super 3 while alive, but it's just too troublesome, strenuous, and not worth the loss. It's better to choose to break through Super 4 and be super awesome. Next, it's Son Gohan. Son Gohan. Normal combat power is 9 billion. That's right, he developed himself through hard training and using the methods taught to him by the old Supreme Kai day and night. His normal state has reached a combat power of 9 billion points. Super 1, Super 2, Super 3, there is not much change, still, 160 times increase, 300 times increase, and Super 3's 800 times increase. But he developed the mysterious form to the limit, a 1000 fold increase. Sun Gohan transformed into a mysterious form, and his combat power has reached 9 trillion, which is 9 trillion. Moreover, after such high pressure hard training, the air bombs fired normally can now be given a little power of rules. If calculated as a percentage, the normal state should be 0.5%. Don't underestimate this 0.5. If the strength is the same, Sun Gohan's key blast attack will slowly erode the opponent's key blast. Therefore, if you don't have the same level of rules power to fight against Sun Gohan, you can't even hope to beat him. In Super Saiyan's transformation, the rules of destruction will reach the 1 to 3% level, corresponding to Super 1, 2, and 3. The transformation of the mysterious form, the death rule reaches a full 5%. But he still doesn't know how to improve the level of the rules. He can only rely on physical enhancement to improve without thinking, but this improvement is half the result with twice the effort. So this is why he came to ask Wiss for advice. One is how to raise his life level to the dimension of God. The other is to learn how to master and increase the concentration of the power of rules. As for whether he will be noticed by Grand Priest, it is completely out of his concern. First, he only told the old Supreme Kai about the King of Time and Space. Old Supreme Kai knows how deep the water is and will not talk nonsense. Second, even if he exposes the power of his rules, he will not attract the attention of the Grand Priest. After all, he is too weak now and is not qualified to attract the attention of gods of that dimension. Things in the world are all kinds of weird, but it's not like no one has the power of rules. But if you want to cultivate the power of rules to a certain level, reaching a level that would attract the attention of Grand Priest, Zeno, etc., there are not many of them yet. The three-eyed evil clan of the 13th universe counted, but they also did many evil things, causing Zeno to take action to eliminate them. Sun Gohan is not stupid, he will not seek death like the three-eyed evil tribe. Moreover, he is not like the protagonist in the novel who treats the supreme god as the villain. Just follow your own path. Talking about the unfairness of heaven and those who go against heaven, in his eyes, they are just bad guys. Why are they going against heaven? Did God mess with you? I really think I am a dish. Be hard when you should be hard, and be soft when you should be soft. This is the way to survive. People can be reckless, but they cannot be stupid. Don't have the mentality that everyone in the world is your father, and everyone in the world is your mother. When he was working in sales in his previous life, he understood the proverb that although this proverb is very vulgar, it is very practical. As for those picky, picky people who have no faults, just ignore them. No one is perfect, no matter what you do well or badly, there will always be those who complain that your stuff is not good or your product is not good. All kinds of things. Haha, ha, 
You, if not, why don't you go give birth? What are you using my stuff for? Please use it. Or is it that my product is not up to standard and has not passed the review, so I am not qualified to sell it? In his previous life, Sun Gohan was very receptive to correct suggestions and product problems, and was willing to correct them. However, Sun Gohan would never tolerate those who thoughtlessly found faults. This is not directed at anyone. Whis tasted all flavors of cup noodles and instant noodles in one go. Sun Gohan, you are indeed an interesting little guy. Tell me, the agreed time has not come, and you have not brought a suitable candidate. Your purpose is not simple. Ah, Whis said, blowing hot air of instant noodles. Mr. Whis, it has to be you. To be honest, I came here this time to ask you to teach me how to reach the level of a god. Sun Gohan humbly asked Whis for advice. Ha ha, speaking of this, I want to ask you, do you know what God means? Whis asked. Beyond the shackles of mortal lifespan, the level of life is sublimated and the dimension is raised. Sun Gohan replied. This is just a general division. I also know that gods are divided into two categories, upper gods and lower gods. Under the gods of destruction, they belong to the lower gods, similar to the kings of the realm and the gods of the earth. The upper gods are subdivided into true gods, great gods, and priests. Sun Gohan continued. Ha ha, where did you hear these? They are all very ancient realm divisions. Times are progressing, and the universe is developing. Now there is no such thing as upper and lower gods. Wiss was stunned, and then said Sun Gohan said is not accurate. Ha, huh, then please explain it to me in detail. Sun Gohan couldn't wait. He did not expect that the realm he had just learned from the king of time and space had already become an antique division. This is normal, after all, 3.1 billion years have passed since the era of the king of time and space. Moreover, it is still the time of Wong Calendar, and the time calculation methods of Wong Calendar and Earth are different. If it were replaced with Earth time, it wouldn't even be calculated. What you just said about breaking away from the bondage of lifespan is not very accurate. For example, your hometown, the god of the earth, although he calls it god, he has not broken away from the bondage of lifespan. Wis pointed out that he was wrong. Well, what you said makes sense. Keep talking. Sun Gohan motioned Wis to continue. Wis then began to explain to him in detail the current division of gods. First of all, the gods of each planet must be ancient and have experienced many civilizations before they can be given the position by the king of the galaxy who controls the galaxy. Strictly speaking, they are not real gods. It's just that he has the ability to travel between yin and yang, communicate with the king of realms, and monitor the planet. Next, there are gods such as King Yama, king of the realm, and great king of the realm. They are given the ability to manage both yin and yang dimensions by the supreme kai of each universe, as well as unlimited lifespan. This type of god is freed from the constraints of lifespan, but its combat effectiveness is uneven. Since they need to manage the human galaxy and the underworld for a long time, most of them have weak combat effectiveness. This type of god is called a virtual god. Next, there is supreme kai. Supreme kai has the responsibility of creating life, planets, and monitoring the universe by traveling through time and space at will. If you want to become Supreme Kai, you still need a long period of training and hard work to hold this position. The initial Supreme Kai abilities were all given by the original king of time and space. Their level of life, the dimension is higher than that of the virtual gods, so in the original Majin Buu chapter, Piccolo cannot make a move when facing Supreme Kai Shin, because the dimension is two levels higher than him, and above them are the King of Kai, King of Yama, and King of Kai above is Supreme Kai. They can choose their own successors, and there is no need for Zeno, Grand Priest, to give the position a second time. This type of god is called the True God Realm. Next up, it's Gods of Destruction. The duty of this type of god is to destroy planets that have developed incorrectly and gone astray. Just in case, they were given the power of destruction, but if they want to control this power of destruction, they must be strong enough to withstand the erosion and backlash of the power of destruction. So as gods of destruction, there are no weak ones, only stronger ones. This type of god is called the Great God Realm. Moreover, starting from the Great God Realm, combat power is divided into more details. The Great God is divided into nine heavens, each level is stronger than the last. From the first level to the fifth level, 
they are usually gods of destruction who have not been in the position for a long time, or whose talents are not high and their potential has reached its limit. This is the early stage of the great god realm. After the fifth heaven, the six, seven, and eight heavens are the middle stage. Most of these great gods are powerful and talented geniuses from each universe. Only they can reach this level. The strength can crush the gods of destruction below the fifth heaven and the fifth heaven. Ninth heaven is the perfection of the great god realm. This type of great god has reached the limit of the great god realm, and there is no way forward. After some ancient gods of destruction reached this state, in order to improve the state, many gods would choose to resign, and then retreat to break through. Of course, there are very few who can break through, and Wiss has never heard of it. Going down again, it is the realm of the priests. Ahem, you just need to know the previous realm of the priest. Trying to break through the realm of the priest is tantamount to fantasy. Wiss suddenly stopped. Mr. Wiss, it's inappropriate for you, it arouses my curiosity, so don't say it again. Don't worry, I won't go out and talk about it. Just tell me, please. Sun Gohan was dissatisfied, so he begged Wiss to continue. Young people, don't aim too high. Wiss said lightly. Hey, well, I wanted to show you a barbecue next time, forget it. The pleading failed, Sun Gohan immediately threatened with food. Barbecue. Kiki, okay, but you're not allowed to talk nonsense. Wiss eyes lit up. Yeah, definitely. Wiss began to tell him what a priest is. The priesthood refers to the servants of the gods of destruction, the angel family. Although angel is a servant serving gods of destruction, she is also a supervisor. After all, the gods of destruction has great power, if evil thoughts arise, they can correct them. I heard, isn't angel all neutral? Sun Gohan asked. Speaking of this, the meaning is far-reaching. After Master Zeno takes over, it turns out that the angel family at the beginning did not have this rule. But no matter any creature or god, once possessing terrifying power and power, it will be corrupted by desire. The six universes that were cleared out of the eighteen universes were not all cleared by Zeno due to external factors as the old Supreme Kai said, but some angels also betrayed their responsibilities. Cause chaos in the universe. Therefore, the Grand Priest consciously set a rule for the angel family. Angel can only supervise the gods of destruction, and cannot intervene in the development of the universe. No matter whether it is good or bad, it must be neutral, otherwise it will be punished and disappear. Wiss didn't continue to talk about this question. After all, the water inside is too deep. You know, in the original book, Myers disappeared and resurrected because of his involvement in Mara, but he lost the ability of Angel and became mortal. Of course Sun Gohan knows that whether he is neutral or in line, it is just the words of the Supreme God. So I did not continue to ask. Wiss continues to talk about the priesthood. In the priesthood, the combat ability is strong, and there is a trace of the ability to use time and space. Reverse time, stand still, accelerate, all can be done, but it is also limited. Backflow, speed up, stand still, no more than three minutes. In terms of combat power, Ultra Instinct is perfectly integrated into the normal state, the body can dodge, block, and defend against any attack by itself. The power is also stronger than Gods of Destruction, Wis can stun Beerus with a hand knife. As for whether there is a clearer division of the priesthood, Wis did not say, but only said that all angels who oversee Gods of Destruction have integrated Ultra Instinct into normalization. But Sun Gohan thought to himself, there will be strengths and weaknesses in the priesthood. Stinky boy, don't think about the gods of destruction. Although there are resigned gods of destruction, the level of life has been cultivated to the state of being out of life, but I have never heard of breaking through to the gods of destruction. You take the great gods as your strive for your goal, work hard. Wiss also stopped. Well, then first reach the great god realm, and then the priest realm. Sun Gohan was full of confidence. Because, he possesses the strange, original two mysterious auras that allow him to break through to the unique realm. This is something that the Grand Priest, Zeno does not have. Of course he wasn't stupid, he didn't say anything about it. No matter how kind Wiss is on the surface, who knows if he can't stand the temptation and do something to him. Okay, so far, the first thing to do is to find a way, how to break through the life level to the false god realm, let me see your strength, and then talk about how to become a god. Wiss said. In fact, 
Sun Gohan also knows how to become the god of Saiyan, but that requires five kind-hearted Saiyans to transfer their energy. Now it's full of cards, including him, a total of five, Sun Goden has not yet been born, he can't wait, so come to ask Whis. Moreover, he can't guarantee that Vegeta, Raditz, and Nappa are now kind-hearted Saiyans. After all, they have committed too many murders. In the original book, Son Goku became a god because Vegeta had a family and became more and more kind, so Son Goku became a god. There is also a reason to find Whis. In the original book, Vegeta secretly came to the gods of Destruction Star, consulted Whis, and then transformed himself into the god of Saiyan alone. Desperation, the shadow of death came out through the body. The gray flames, like the willow the wisps of hell, surround Sun Gohan. He directly transformed into a mysterious form. Whis was stunned for an instant. This is, a rule. A rule that has never appeared before. Whis then frowned. He hadn't seen the rules of death, but Sun Gohan's form made it easy to pass for an evil and terrifying existence. Mr. Whis, now I am in full strength. Sun Gohan said calmly, looking at Whis indifferently. It wasn't his intention, but this form made him become like this involuntarily. Whis was deep in thought, with a heavy face, he carefully sensed Sun Gohan's breath. Then the expression became more and more relaxed. He found that the death rules exposed by Sun Gohan are not simple, although it looks horrible and evil. But he also felt a very pure and peaceful breath, just the power of death, without any evil thoughts, rules of evil thoughts. He even felt a power of death and rebirth that Sun Gohan hadn't discovered. The pinnacle of death is reincarnation, the power of life. He didn't know that the king of time and space also told Sun Gohan that death and life are closely related. Maybe after Sun Gohan understands all the rules of death, he will understand the rules of life by virtue of the rules of death. Sun Gohan, I'm very curious, how did you get such a high dimensional rule power? Whis asked curiously. I don't know, it's just so natural, hard work, and then it became like this. Sun Gohan's clumsy excuse made Whis even more suspicious. Sun Gohan also has no choice. His super race and mysterious forms have undergone mutations, and they will be exposed sooner or later. Let me take a look at your body. Whis walked in front of Sun Gohan, powerful mental power gushed out instantly. Sun Gohan's body tightened, but the strange aura and the original aura seemed to have discovered Whis investigation. The original aura completely transformed itself into the aura in Sun Gohan's body, and the strange aura turned into the tyrannical aura in the tail. Both auras were hidden independently. Stand up. Whis probed for a long time, and found nothing abnormal in Sun Gohan's body. On the contrary, it is a trace of death rule that resists his investigation, making him unable to see through Sun Gohan thoroughly. It's strange, it's really strange, what is the reason, the chi in your body has a little bit of regular power, and it even makes your shape change. Tisk tisk tisk, Whis was amazed. Well, it's not bad for me, is it? Sun Gohan deliberately showed a worried expression to mislead Whis. HMPH, little guy, you're playing tricks on me. Forget it, if you don't want to say it, I won't force you. With your weak power of rules, it's hard to say whether you can reach the peak of cultivation. Whis instantly I saw that Sun Gohan was misleading him. Mr. Whis, you should tell me how to become a god. Sun Gohan was a little embarrassed when he saw that he was worried, so he quickly changed the subject. HMPH, if you want to become a god, you must understand what the core point of becoming a god is. Whis snorted, very dissatisfied with Sun Gohan's deliberate concealment. Then what is the core point of becoming a god? Sun Gohan asked. Becoming a god, firstly, is a position given by a powerful god, allowing it to possess the power of god, sublimate the level of life, and increase the dimension. Secondly, it is to practice on your own, understand the power of god, and evolve the power of god that suits you. God the power of rules can also be said to be the prerequisite for understanding the power of rules. But you seem to have gone the wrong way. Although you have a trace of the power of rules, this trace of the power of rules has not sublimated your life level and improved your dimension. And, you only achieve the purpose of using the power of rules through transformation. But your transformation is not simple, it is much better than the Super Saiyan who went astray. If you keep this form, you will be no different from a god. Now, 
Whis couldn't help but praise Sun Gohan's mysterious form. To be honest, Sun Gohan's mysterious form is actually not much different from the normal form. It's just that the combat power is multiplied, the aura is more powerful, and the consumption is not much different from normal. Didn't you say that the real god is free from the shackles of lifespan? Sun Gohan asked doubtfully. Whis shook his head and said, You already have a hint of immortality in this form. But if you want to completely become a god, you must evolve your own godly power and then normalize it, so that your life level will be completely separated. Lifespan bound. Whis' explanation made Sun Gohan even more confused. He clearly remembered that in the original work, Sun Goku had a red-haired form after he transformed into the god of Saiyan. At that time, Sun Goku could fight Beerus in the vacuum of the universe. Judging from the situation, he should have sublimated his life level. But Sun Goku didn't incorporate the Saiyan god form into the norm. Instead, it evolved into a super blue form again. Is it necessary to integrate into the normal state you said? If you use cheating methods to break through to become a god, and then return to the normal state, will your life level drop? Sun Gohan asked. It seems that you have a way to cheat. Whis said in surprise. Sun Gohan did not hide it from Whis, but used the Dragon Ball as an excuse to say, Well, I made a wish like Shenron, seeking a way to become a god. It told me to gather five kind-hearted Saiyans and instill the power of the heart into one Saiyan. Will become the Saiyan god who appeared in Saiyan, but Shenron also pointed out that the Saiyan god is also a transformation. Ahem, you know, let me find five kind-hearted Saiyans. He asked the Shenron, but he just used Shenron as an excuse. So that's it. If you follow what you said, transforming into the Saiyan god and then falling back to normal, it will only improve the level of life, and perhaps derive the ability to absorb oxygen without breathing air, and the lifespan will also be increased. But it will not completely break away from the lifespan. Again, if you want to completely break away from the lifespan, you must achieve the goal of integrating the power of God into the normal state. Wiss insisted on his point of view. Sun Gohan thought about it carefully. In the original work, Sun Goku fell back to the Super Saiyan form when fighting Beerus in space, but he could still survive in space. This should be the improvement in life level that Wiss said, and he did not need to absorb oxygen to survive. Purpose. As for how high the lifespan can be, it's unclear. After all, Saiyan's lifespan itself is very long. Okay, then, Master Wiss, please teach me how to comprehend the power of God. Sun Gohan licked his face and called him Master directly. You really hit the snake with a stick. I remember Saiyan was not so shameless, Wiss said angrily. But he didn't refuse, because he discovered that Sun Gohan's talent was high enough and his potential was unlimited. Where can I find such a good apprentice? This is the power of God. I will pour it into your body, and you will return to normal to understand it carefully, and then realize your own power of God. Go to my scepter space, no one will disturb you, it will help you concentrate on comprehending. You already have a trace of the power of rules. It should be very simple to comprehend the power of God. Wiss raised his hand, and a blue substance flowing energy body as big as a fist merged into his body. Sun Gohan instantly felt that his body was extremely comfortable, as if he was soaked in amniotic fluid. Very comfortable and peaceful. Wiss also used the scepter to receive him into the scepter space. Sun Gohan begins to comprehend the power of God. Fu, Wiss, my ability can't predict his future. The prophecy fish is influenced by it and is also a food lover. It blew on the instant noodles in front of it, and after saying this, it took a big gulp. Smooth and chewy. It's cool, it's so delicious. The prophecy fish couldn't help admiring. Suck, who says it's not? Wiss also said it was delicious. He has a trace of the power of rules in his body. Although he cannot control it independently and the concentration is not high, it is a rule with a deeper dimension than destruction after all. It cannot be predicted, it is normal. Wiss is very calm. Then you're not afraid of him causing trouble. Prophecy fish. I'm afraid of a hammer hitting a sunflower. If he wants to surpass the gods of destruction in a short time, I'm afraid it will be difficult. If the sky falls, a tall man can hold it up. Anyway, under the leadership of the lazy Lord Beerus, the seventh universe is already ranked second to last. Maybe when Sun Gohan grows up, he can also drive the ranking of the seventh universe. 
Since his appearance, there have been more masters on the Earth, and the three-eyed star, although he is a remnant of the thirteenth universe, has stayed in the seventh universe. After such a long time, he has become a member of the seventh universe. I am still looking forward to that little guy doing more things. He is already second to last, no matter how hard he works, how bad can he be? If the hard work is done, the ranking it will also be pulled up. Wiss showed a completely opposite appearance from the usual elegance. The beginning is even more foul-mouthed. The gods of the seventh universe clearly surpassed many universes. But Beerus's lethargy caused many planets with distorted development to not be cleaned up, which also lowered the overall score of the seventh universe. Wiss also sees it and is anxious in his heart, but they are restricted by the rules of the angel family and cannot change the direction of the universe at will. They can only guide the gods of destruction. Moreover, there were some reasons for Beerus's lethargy, which made him unable to force Beerus. Others, universe gods of destruction, who doesn't cultivate a few powerful combat power, or the successor of gods of destruction. Only Beerus has never accepted a disciple or trained a master. This time I finally tried to recruit Sun Gohan, but was rejected. Fortunately, Sun Gohan agreed to introduce him to a strong man suitable to take over as gods of destruction. The seventh universe has too little high-end combat power. Moreover, some powerful ones are not imprisoned in the Galaxy Patrol prison. He is a sealed evil person. Cultivating this kind of existence is not safe, and it will backfire on you. Be more ambitious, let alone raise the ranking of universe, as long as you don't destroy universe. For example, Majin Buu, who has no sense and only kills and destroys wantonly, Mora, who can absorb the energy of the planet, and the frozen demon clan, etc. This kind of person is just a knife, and training them is just causing trouble for yourself. Wiss rarely made a lot of complaints. Wiss, I heard that in other universes, there are already existences whose combat power is comparable to, or even surpasses, gods of destruction. The prophet Fish asked curiously. At most, with the strength of the early stage of the great god realm, under the fifth heaven, surpassing the gods of destruction, it is just an exaggeration. This is just a means of publicity, Wiss said disdainfully. Then you won't be affected by accepting Sun Gohan this time, right? After all, you are neutral and are not allowed to interfere. Ask the prophetic fish. Who ho ho, what's the impact? My duty is to serve, supervise gods of destruction, and find suitable candidates to take over the position of gods of destruction. Isn't Sun Gohan suitable? Very suitable, but will he take over as the alternate gods of destruction? The position of destruction must be accepted by others, right? Did I do something wrong? Wiss became even more disdainful. Angel has already taken advantage of this kind of thing, so why can't he? Wiss, I suddenly realize that you seem to be a little out of your mind. Have it, yes, very yes, it doesn't matter, who said I can't lose my temper? Wiss said nonchalantly. Dot dot dot. One month later, Earth, Vital's home. Because of Sun Gohan, Cell did not let the world know about it, and Satan did not profit from it. But the protagonists are hiding in the world, and Satan is considered the strongest person on earth. Through a lot of competitions. He has also made a lot of money, and Vital's living conditions are getting better and better. At this time, Vital was practicing boxing crazily in the martial arts field of her villa. She filled the sandbag with iron sand and wrapped it with ten layers of cowhide, causing it to fly up and down. Sun Gohan, you disappeared again. She was cursing while practicing boxing, as if the punching bag in front of her was Sun Gohan. If nothing else, Sun Gohan missed the first day of school again. Vital has been to Bowsy Mountain no less than ten times, but he has never seen Sun Gohan. This also made her anger build up to the limit, and she had to come to the martial arts training ground every day to vent her anger and suppress it. Sun Gohan, haha, Vital punched with anger, completely breaking the sandbag, and the iron sand fell to the ground. Hey, little junior sister is so strong, why do I feel that she is even more powerful than teacher Satan? You are right, I feel the same way. That is an iron sand bag made of ten layers of cowhide. It's scary, it's scary. Let's stay away, little junior sister seems to have no target to vent her anger to. A group of grown men frantically stayed away from vital sight, because Vital's eyes were darting around, as if he was looking for the next target. 
HMPH, Sun Gohan, just wait for me. Seeing everyone disappearing, Vital had no choice but to take a shower first. Dot dot dot, Bulma Estate, what, are you kidding me, transform you into an android? Bulma was completely shocked. The person in front of me is Clint with a determined look on his face. Yes, the two siblings on the 17th have already looked for you, right? I believe that with your intelligence, you will definitely leave the data, right? Clint said. Clint, why do you want to transform yourself? Isn't it good to be a normal human being? Bulma didn't understand Clint's thoughts at all. Bulma, in just a few years, the gap between me and Goku has become wider and wider. They are all aliens with great talents and potential. I am not willing to accept it. I really am not willing to accept it, especially this death. After rebirth, I realize that I have dragged everyone down, and I am not willing to give in, not willing to give in. Clint shed tears of unwillingness. Clint, Bulma looked at Clint sympathetically, recalling every bit of their past. Bulma, please, help me. As far as I know, the two siblings on 17.18 are also Earthlings. If they can become so powerful, then I can be stronger than them. After all, they were ordinary Earthlings before they were transformed. People, Clint was not idle during this period. Instead, he went to the temple, got the traces of No. 17.18, and learned everything from them. On 17.18, it was only because of Sun Gohan's intervention that he survived so they did not hide it and told Clint about the two people's deeds to repay Sun Gohan for saving his life. At the same time, Clint also learned about the two siblings who found Bulma to defuse the bomb in her body. Clint felt that Bulma would never miss such a good opportunity. The corresponding data must have been retained. Okay, Clint, let me help you. Bulma finally agreed to Clint's request. After Clint received the consent, he became excited instantly, and his body was trembling with excitement. In fact, it's no wonder that Krillin would make such a move. In the original work, Son Goku and others improved step by step. Now, it can be called an explosive improvement. The huge sense of disparity made Klin unable to accept it for a while. He chatted with Master Roshi for a long time. Master Roshi also agreed with his idea and told him, Klin, you and Goku are both my apprentices. No matter what method you use to become stronger, as long as you don't lose the original martial arts heart, master I can't fight anymore. Power does not distinguish between good and evil. It just depends on whether the person who uses the power is good or evil. So what about the artificial man? As long as you are still the Krillin in your heart, then you will still be my disciple. Go ahead and chase your dreams. Master Roshi's words are nothing short of giving him great support. This made him more determined. Earth Bulma Estate. Klin, don't be too happy. Now there is a very serious problem. Bulma looked at the excited Klin and said. Keelan was stunned. What problem? The body of No. 17.18 is not much different from normal people, but has been partially modified. They can have children and have children, and they are not fully mechanical artificial humans. Their core is a strange infinite energy pack. But they don't know where Dr. Jero got this infinite energy pack, and there are only these two, so Dr. Jero can barely transform himself into a fully mechanical man. Bulma explained. Infinite energy pack, you mean, without this, there is no way to transform me. Keelan clenched his fists nervously. That's right, if you want to become like them, you must have that energy pack, otherwise, even if I transform you into an artificial human, you will have an upper limit, and your strength will not increase. Moreover, the combat effectiveness of mechanical artificial humans is not not high. Bulma can make a combat power detector, so he can naturally understand combat power. Then is there any other way? Keelan asked nervously. 1. Look for that little rogue with great powers, he must know, 2. Shenron. Bulma's words were short, pointing to the core of the problem. The supernatural little hooligan, Keelan was taken aback. Oh, that brat son Gohan. Bulma also realized that he had lost his composure. Bulma, there's something wrong with you. Keelan teased. Shut up, girl, do you still want me to help you? Bulma became furious. Ahem, tell me, speaking of chicken feathers, I have already told you the solution, you can deal with it yourself. Bulma swears, then turns and leaves. Gohan, Shenron, first go and see if Gohan is here. 
If not, I'll collect the Dragon Ball. Keelan immediately decided to go to Gohan first. He flew high into the sky and headed towards Bowsy Mountain at full speed. Bun Mountain, Son Goku, who was fighting Vegeta, was taken aback, Kong. Kakarot, you, are you insulting me? How dare you get distracted while fighting me? Vegeta yelled angrily. Boom, Son Goku was thrown into the air in an instant. Pause, pause, I feel that Keelan is coming, call again later. As soon as Son Goku finished speaking, Keelan's figure was clearly visible. Blow, Krillin, why are you here, what happened? Son Goku spoke first. Goku, I'm here to find Gohan, is he there? Keelan asked anxiously. Gohan, he disappeared for a month and I don't know where he went. Goku replied. Aren't you there? That's the only way. Goku, is the Dragon Ball radar in your place? Hum. I haven't returned Bulma since I revived you last time. What's going on, Klin? Seeing Klin's anxious look, Goku hurriedly asked. Goku, do you trust me? Krillin decided to hide it from Son Goku. Yes, how could I not believe you? Goku was taken aback for a moment, then said firmly. Just don't ask, don't worry, there is no crisis, can you give me the Dragon Ball radar? Keelan said softly. Son Goku frowned slightly then immediately let go, wait, I'll get it for you. Son Goku went home to get the radar, came back in a hurry and handed it to Kling. Thank you, Goku, I have something urgent to do, let's go first. Krillin flew away. Hey, Krillin, the Dragon Ball has not been used for a long time, and it hasn't recovered yet. Son Goku shouted. But Klin has disappeared, but he also immediately realized the problem. He pressed the Dragon Ball radar, and there was no response. Hee <laughs> hee, I was in such a hurry that I even forgot such an important thing. Keelan rushed to the doctor in an emergency. He also remembered that the Dragon Ball has only been used for a short time, and it is still seven stones now. I have no choice but to wait for Gohan. By the way, Master King Kai. Keelan remembered that King Kai can teleport telepathically across distances. But he doesn't have the method of telepathy. So he flew to the temple again, he didn't, then did. The temple, okay, Keelan, wait a moment, I'll help you contact Lord Kai. Dent quickly contacted King Kai by using his ability to communicate yin and yang, and also told Keelan that he had something to do with him. The messenger is online, Keelan, what's the hurry? King Kai's voice sounded from the bottom of Klin's heart. Master Kai, can you find out where Gohan is? I need him urgently, it's very important. Keelan shouted directly. Your voice is too loud. I can hear it. It shocked me to death. King Kai complained. Um, I'm sorry, Master King Kai, I lost my temper. Keelan said embarrassedly. Son Gohan didn't know where he went recently, and I can't find him, you can only wait. King Kai didn't know that Gohan went to Gods of Destruction Star. Moreover, his dimension is not qualified enough to explore the gods of Destruction Star, the Supreme Kai Star. Hee <laughs> hee, I can't eat hot tofu in a hurry. Then I can only wait. Keelan said in frustration. That's why you're looking for me. King Kai's tone was a little cold. Ah, Lord King Kai, I'm sorry to bother you, I'm sorry. Keelan heard King Kai's tone and hurriedly apologized. HMPH, what do you think of me? The king of the realm snorted coldly, and immediately cut off the telepathic channel. Gohan, where are you? Keelan's disappointment was beyond words. Gods of Destruction Star. Buzz buzz. Oh, it's ready so soon. Whis opened the scepter space in surprise. The figure of Sun Gohan slowly appeared. Sun Gohan, what's the situation? It looks like you didn't succeed. Whis asked curiously. Because he didn't feel any changes from Sun Gohan. At this time, Sun Gohan is still normal, his life level has not been sublimated, and his dimension has not been improved. I have encountered a problem. I have roughly comprehended the power of God, but I want to evolve my own power of God. I can't do it. I feel that I need a battle, a battle with God, a battle with God. It is only through a vigorous battle that the power of God that belongs to Saiyan can be smoothly evolved. Sun Gohan was also very distressed. True God Realm most of them can't beat you, great god realm, you still can't touch that limit, it's difficult. Wis frowned. Saiyan is a born fighting nation. 
I feel that the divine power belonging to Saiyan requires not only kindness and justice, but also needs to be catalyzed through fighting. Sun Gohan expressed his understanding. Okay, leave this matter to me. Whis directly assured. Okay, I don't have any breakthroughs for the time being. I'll go back to Earth first. If nothing happens, I'll have to clean up again. Mr. Whis, how long has it been? Sun Gohan said in distress. According to the time of the Earth, it's more than a month. What's the matter? There are still people on the Earth who can deal with you. Whis was very curious. One month, skipping school for a month, my mother is probably going to die of anger, and vital. Mr. Whis, I'm leaving first, bye. Sun Gohan's body trembled, and the feeling of uneasiness in his heart became more and more intense, before Whis could reply, he left with instant transmission. Good guy, I want to see who can subdue this 800-hearted Sun Gohan. Whis's voyeuristic desire soared instantly, and his curiosity exploded. He directly activated the monitoring function of the scepter, and a projection screen slowly appeared. Earth Bun Mountain. Sun Gohan looks at his home. I dare not go back for a long time. He seemed to have seen an extremely ferocious beast, opening its maw of the abyss to swallow him. His body couldn't help but shiver. Death or life, we have to face it and fight. Sun Gohan gritted his teeth and stamped his feet, walking towards home with trembling legs. You traitor. How dare you come back? As expected, there was a loud shout as soon as he entered the door. Chi Chi had a big belly, holding a rolling pin that had not been used for a long time, and swung it at Sun Gohan with all his strength. Snapped, I asked you to skip school. Bang bang bang. I won't let you go home for a month. When? Vital was so anxious that he cried. Bang bang, pong pong. After a few moments, Chi Chi changed the rolling pin again. Master. Master, this is the last rolling pin. If it breaks, there will be no pasta-making tools tomorrow. The cooking robot seemed to have consciousness and came to Sun Gohan's rescue. Get out of here. What does it have to do with me teaching my son a lesson? Bang 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 bang. Gaba, the second rolling pin broke. Defense, it's simply impossible, absolutely impossible. How could Sun Gohan dare to defend himself? He was afraid that an accident would cause Sun Goden to give birth prematurely. Mom, please forgive me, I was wrong. Sun Gohan begged bitterly. Gods of Destruction Star. Ha ha. Whis, I didn't expect, I didn't expect. Sun Gohan would be so afraid of this weak earthling. The prophet fish laughed. You deserve it, you brat, if I let you play tricks on me again, it's really like one thing is the best for another. Whis couldn't help but sigh. At the same time, I am very happy, happy that Chi Chi teaches Sun Gohan a lesson. Whis, the prophetic fish's face straightened. Well, I know, I've seen such a filial child. Whis naturally understands what the prophetic fish means. Sun Gohan's current situation is unexpected. Looking at his attitude towards Chi Chi, you can tell that he is definitely a filial son. It is absolutely impossible for such a person to go astray unless his bottom line is touched. But at this time, Sun Gohan, Whis, and Beerus can be said to be the strongest existence in the seventh universe if they don't take action. Who dares, or who can touch his bottom line? Seeing this scene, Whis was even more sure that his choice would not be wrong. Look at the gods of destruction. If Master Beerus shows signs of waking up, please notify me in time. Let's have a hearty battle. What about the twelve universes? It's very simple. The Whis scepter tapped the ground. A seven-color stream of light instantly covered the whole body. Whis left the seventh universe to find a suitable opponent for Sun Gohan. Bowsy Mountain. The abnormality in Sun Goku's home also woke up the neighbors, Vegeta, Raditz, and Nappa. It's scary. It's so scary. The women of Earth are scarier than the women of Saiyan. Raditz said in horror. Who says otherwise? But it seems that ordinary women can't conquer us. Nappa was also afraid. HMPH. It's embarrassing for Saiyan that a mere earthling makes Sun Gohan so afraid. Vegeta said something different. Sun Gohan's house. Mom, it doesn't matter to me how you beat or scold me, but you have to be careful about your body. Sun Gohan didn't care at all that Chi Chi beat him, but was very worried about Chi Chi's body. You brat, don't think that I can spare you just because you beg for mercy. You've already learned bad things. When your brother is born, he won't be like you. After Chi Chi vented for a while, 
He also had no strength and could only talk. Sun Gohan. Yes, yes, everything you said is right. I was wrong, okay. Mom, don't be angry. Sun Gohan helped Chi Chi sit down in a flattering manner. The action is even more cautious, for fear that one mistake will cause Sun Goden to miscarry. Chi Chi calmed down for a moment and said, Gohan, mom knows you are born smart, but you should do what you want at any age. You are only 10 years old now. Mom doesn't want you to lose the happiness of being the same age. Going to school is the right way. Mom doesn't want too much how good you study, but mom doesn't want you to lose the experience you deserve, youth. Do you know that? Poor parents all over the world. After Chi Chi calmed down, he taught Sun Gohan earnestly. What can Sun Gohan do, listen obediently, who let her be his mother? Yes, yes, mother, I understand, I will go to school tomorrow. Don't be angry, Sun Gohan flattered him. Are you impatient? No, no, how dare I be impatient? Sun Gohan said helplessly. Woo, my Gohan has gone bad. A pregnant woman's temper is like unstable weather, changing every moment. Sun Gohan is very helpless. Instantly thought of vital. He teleported, and came back in less than a second. But he brought back someone, and it was vital. He has no choice but to ask vital for help. After vital saw Sun Gohan, he was happy at first, and then angry. Then, when she saw Chi Chi who was wronged and crying, she quickly put other things aside. Aunt Chi Chi, what's wrong with you, don't cry. Shouldn't Gohan be happy when he comes back? Vital hurried forward to comfort him. Satan's house. You, son Gohan, you took my vital away. Satan roared dissatisfied. Vital is sharing lunch with him at home, and as soon as son Gohan shows up, take vital away. Dot dot dot. Wow. Vital, good boy, when did you come? When Chi Chi saw vital, he was even more aggrieved. Cry out loud holding vital like a little child. Auntie, don't cry. When you cry, I feel very uncomfortable, and I want to cry too. Woo, vital was weird, think of a way in an instant. Good boy, whoops, don't cry, don't cry, it's all Gohan's fault. Son Gohan, come here and get beaten. Chi Chi put away tears in an instant, picked up the broken rolling pin and swung at Son Gohan again. Son Gohan can only suffer, it doesn't matter if he gets beaten, it won't hurt him anyway. But he can't stand two women crying, ah. Being able to get a beating and keep the two women from crying is the best way. Bang bang bang, the broken rolling pin, split in two again. Whoa, whoa, vital. Be good, don't cry. I've already taught him a lesson for you. Chi Chi gasped and stepped forward to comfort vital. Well, it's good that you don't get angry, you are still pregnant with a child, you must maintain an optimistic and happy attitude. Vital comforted Chi Chi like a little adult. Oh, you're so good. Good boy. Hug from auntie. Chi Chi was deeply moved. I was also annoyed why she didn't give birth to a daughter. Phew, it's finally over. It's so hard. Sun Gohan let out a long breath. This is the scary Saiyan. Are you kidding me? Vegeta's eyes widened. Everything that happened just now was seen by them. Auntie Chi Chi, I can bear Gohan skipping class, but I can't bear him not coming to me. Vital complained deliberately. Oops, Sun Gohan secretly thought something was wrong. Bang bang bang. This time Chi Chi just picked up the mop. Brat, made you upset Vital. Sun Gohan was beaten again. Vital watched Sun Gohan get beaten with excitement and a distressed expression. I asked you to help solve the problem, not create it. Sun Gohan said loudly. HMPH, and Chi Chi's problem, I have already solved it for you. The rest is my problem. Vital snorted dissatisfied. Clap, how dare you talk back. The cylindrical mop has become flat, and the sound of hitting is like a big sinus. In this scene, the mother-in-law and daughter-in-law are really united, and their benefits cut through gold. The morning after Sun Gohan's return, the extremely handsome Sun Gohan flew towards the school with Vital in his arms. Vital didn't go back last night, but stayed at Gohan's house, sharing a room with Chi Chi. Chi Chi also explained everything to his in-law Satan. Although Satan is aggrieved, he is a grown man. He wouldn't be offended by Chi Chi, let alone a pregnant woman. Vital looked shy. At the same time, I was very surprised, surprised that son Gohan could fly. Gohan, my dad said, 
These are all tricks. Is there a rope hanging on as flying in the sky that I can't see? Vital said while holding Sun Gohan and touching his back with both hands. She didn't notice the rope. It is worth mentioning that even if Sun Gohan is holding Vital, he is still flying vertically. Flying on your stomach. Impossible. Absolutely impossible. Vital, this is called flying technique. It uses one's own energy to fly. It's not a trick, Sun Gohan explained patiently. He has decided to teach Vital the method of controlling Kai. At this time, Vital, although young, already has a combat power of over 100 points. Can I? Vital looked at Sun Gohan with her innocent eyes. Of course, today is Friday and tomorrow is Sunday. Take a rest tomorrow and I will teach you. Sun Gohan said softly. Yeah, that's great. I want Dad to see that this is not a cover-up. Ha, huh, Dad has become more and more self-righteous in recent years. Vital applauded and at the same time complained about Satan's inflated mentality. The brain rebels against the bones, and rebels against Tiangong. The little cotton padded jacket instantly turned into a leaky leather jacket. Have a safe Friday. Sun Gohan promised Vital to pick her up at her home tomorrow and teach her how to sense and use chi. But plans are worse than changes. The next day, when Sun Gohan planned to pick up Vital, Klin came. What, you want to transform yourself into an android? Sun Gohan lost his temper and almost bit off his own tongue. Well, Gohan, help me. Krillin's face was filled with unwillingness. What can I do for you? Of course Gohan would not refuse. After all, Klin had helped his son family a lot. The infinite energy pack Bulma mentioned can't be found on Earth. I originally planned to make a wish with Shenron, but Shenron just used it for a short time and has not recovered yet. Bulma said you must have a way. Klin looked at it with expectant eyes. He. Say, I don't even know what the infinite energy pack is, this woman, Sun Gohan was speechless. But Klin's decision touched him deeply. Just wait, I'll help you with this. Sun Gohan gritted his teeth. Instant transmission disappears. He asked Dend about the location of number 18. Lucian rises to dominate the dragon. Yeah, I won again. Number 18 jumped up happily. Although number 17 is the younger brother and extremely cold, he still looks helpless when facing no. 18. He just gave way to number 18 on purpose. After the cell incident, the two did not cause trouble on earth. Instead, I returned to my hometown in my memory and settled down. Call out. Sun Gohan appears. Hey, aren't we with you on the 16th? Sun Gohan asked curiously. Sun Gohan, why are you here? Number 17 asked. He found out through number 18 that it was Sun Gohan who beat up Cell and made him spit him out. Although there is an order to kill Sun Goku in his mind. But facing Sun Gohan, I am still very grateful. I'm here to ask any of you to come with me. Sun Gohan said calmly. Blow. Number 18 stood in front of number 17, and a woman's unique body fragrance instantly poured into Sun Gohan's nose. It smells so good. Sun Gohan couldn't help but sigh. Then I looked at the tall figure in front of me, the slender legs, and the pair of not too big, but extremely strong. Opening parenthesis dot. Closing parenthesis opening parenthesis dot. Closing parenthesis. Sun Gohan, what do you want to do? No 18's tone was cold. She would not allow others to hurt no. 17. She blamed herself very much when Dr. Jero took her away. What are you thinking? If I wanted to kill you, I wouldn't have saved you in the first place. Didn't Klin come to see you some time ago? I came here for this matter. Sun Gohan said angrily. No 18's face turned red with embarrassment. The steps quietly stepped back to the side. What's wrong? Asked no. 17. That infinite energy bag cannot be found on Earth. I would like to ask you to come with me and ask others what this infinite energy bag is. I believe you are also very curious. Sun Gohan explained. If you're not curious, let number 18 go with you. The corner of no 17's mouth raised. What? Why do you want me to go? I won't go. You go. Number 18 resisted. That's enough. Let's go. Gggyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyyy
I'll let you taste the power of toothpicks when I get the chance. Sun Gohan gritted his teeth in anger. Ha ha, little naughty, who are you afraid of? Number 18 looked disdainful. Sun Gohan was furious. Suddenly, Number 17 came to the rescue. You too, it seems that you have gone astray. Or, Sun Gohan, do you want to be my brother-in-law? Is this a rescue? Isn't this adding fuel to the fire? Number 17, shut up. Who wants to marry this little gangster? Number 18 shouted loudly. I don't want this old woman. Sun Gohan also shouted angrily. Both of them spoke at the same time. Okay, okay, I'm going to play games, you can do whatever you want. Ha ha, number 17 backed away. Lazily, stop talking nonsense, can you help me? Sun Gohan was already a little impatient. HMPH, for the sake of saving us, let me help you once. Number 18 was stunned for a moment, but then he was still soft-spoken and agreed. Come on, give me your hand. Sun Gohan stretched out his hand. Number 18 tensed up and said, what do you want to do? Don't think too much, my instant transmission must catch people. Sun Gohan said angrily. After hesitating for a moment, Number 18 handed his hand to Sun Gohan. Sun Gohan grasped the soft, boneless, white palm and felt a slight throbbing in his heart. I couldn't help but pinch it. No 18's old face turned red. Go away now, you little rascal. Hee <laughs> hee. Sun Gohan laughed evilly and then teleported away. Gods of Destruction Star. Whis originally planned to find his opponent for him, but he came back not long after he left. He hadn't been out for a long time, and he had forgotten that he could use the Angel Scepter to contact other Universe Angels, so why bother to find it himself? So he came back again, opened the screen, and wanted to see Sun Gohan being beaten, but what came into view was the screen of Sun Gohan, number 17, 18. Why are you asking me? Shouldn't you ask that old Supreme Kai guy? Wiss hurriedly turned off the scepter projection. Mr. Wiss, what are you and the prophet fish looking at? Sun Gohan seemed to see a familiar scene. Ahem, nothing, nothing. By the way, why are you here? Wiss changed the subject. Please help me take a look. What's going on with the infinite energy pack in her body? Sun Gohan pulled number 18 forward. He really didn't want to let go of such a wonderful little hand. It's ice cold and soft as if it's boneless. Oh, 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 can the old Supreme Kai solve this kind of problem? Wiss said with a smile. HMPH, that old man is too perverted. If number 17 doesn't come with me, I can't let myself go. Sun Gohan originally planned to ask the old Supreme Kai, but then he thought about it, number 18 is so beautiful. So he changed his itinerary and came to the planet Gods of Destruction. Gods of Destruction star, Master Wiss, it's up to you. Sun Gohan pushed number 18 forward. Okay, let me take a look. Wiss stepped forward gracefully. The scepter is on the 18th body. The projection screen of the energy pack engraved with the R logo, the size of a fist, suddenly appeared. Hey, is it really made by Dr. Jero? If he can create infinite energy, then he is too perverted. Sun Gohan didn't believe it at first. But when he saw the logo energy pack engraved with the Red Ribbon Legion, he couldn't help but believe it. It's not that simple. Look again. Wiss Scepter tapped the ground, and the screen changed again, showing the core of the energy pack. A green ball with a diameter of about 5 centimeters. Exudes endless energy to be absorbed, transformed, and turned into the power of number 18. Wiss face froze in an instant, with a hint of gloom. Master Wiss, what's wrong? What's that? Sun Gohan realized something was wrong. Hee <laughs> hee, okay, okay. Although the seventh universe is ranked second to last, they are too arrogant to invade this universe. Wiss tone was cold, and even the smile seemed incomparably terrifying. Sun Gohan, do you know what that is? Wiss asked, pointing to the green core. I don't know, but from your reaction, it must be something serious. Sun Gohan guessed. This is Jackson, the core of Supreme Kai, no wonder, the infinite energy pack, really fits the name. Wiss tone was cold. Most Supreme Kais are initially held by Jackson people, and later successors may become other races. Jackson people are a race created by the time and space king himself, and their characteristic is Jackson. Boundary core, although small, 
but its role is very terrifying. Supreme Kai's energy to create planets is provided by Boundary Core. Jexon can also be said to be a positive energy core of the universe, but this core is mastered by Jexon people to correctly create planets and life. So it is not surprising to have unlimited energy, after all, it is an energy core that supports a universe discovery. If it wasn't for Jexon people to take over the position, then the previous generation of Supreme Kai would pass on Jexon to the next Supreme Kai of another race. What do you mean? Someone killed Supreme Kai, but the Supreme Kai of the seventh universe didn't. By the way, the three Supreme Kais who were killed by Majin Buu. Sun Gohan thought of the first seven universes dead Supreme Kai. At the beginning of each universe, only one boundary core will be born. The space-time king uses 18 boundary cores to create a family of boundary core people. Although it is a race, there are only 18 people at the beginning, but they have the ability to cultivate out of the boundary core. Ability, the seventh universe, is also a special case, there is a big supreme Kai, and there are five supreme Kais in the southeast, north, west, and north. Jackson is not so easy to cultivate and condense. The method of cultivating out of boundary cores. That's why there are so many Supreme Kais in the seventh universe. Wisp breathed a sigh of relief and continued. But this is abnormal and violates the rules of the universe's operation. Do you think that the birth of Majin Buu can really be easily created by a mere magician? It was partly affected, and the birth of that kind of thing. Balanced universe running. Wisp brought up the birth of Majin Buu, very abnormal. Is this also the reason why Lord Gods of Destruction didn't make a move? Sun Gohan asked curiously. Right or wrong, it was because Master Beerus was sleeping, but even if he was awake, I wouldn't suggest him to take action. Disrupting the rules of the world, you must pay the price. Wis mood gradually eased. I see what you mean, it's like Namek's Dragon Ball, if abused too much, it will cause disaster. Sun Gohan uses the Dragon Ball metaphor. Hey. Since you all know it, why do you still abuse it? This made Wis curious. Ha ha, there are no enemies, just create enemies. Q, Q, Q equals percent. Ha ha, really crazy, not bad, not bad. Wis instantly understood Sun Gohan's thoughts. Master Wis, you also said that the seventh universe is ranked second from the bottom. I want to improve the ranking, otherwise it will not be fun if I am eliminated. You don't have to die, we will die. Sun Gohan is high-spirited. You even know this. Your ideas coincide with mine. When Lord Beerus wakes up, you can bring the right candidates over. There are also three-eyed stars that can also be used. Ranking cannot be based solely on high-end battles. Strength, it also depends on the overall strength. Wiss reminded. I understand that if I can, I will find a way to restore the number of Saiyan. There's something wrong with you. Wiss looked at number 18, and thought of vital on earth again. Master Wiss, what are you thinking, I'm not a stallion. Sun Gohan instantly saw what his expression meant, and shouted dissatisfied. You're in a hurry, Wiss said calmly. I. Dot hum, I'm too lazy to explain. Think whatever you want, you'd better get down to business. Why was the world core obtained by Dr. Jero? Sun Gohan couldn't explain it either. External factors, whether the existence of this universe, interferes with the development of the universe, this world core is not necessarily from the seventh universe. Wiss explained. External factors, by the way, there is one thing I didn't tell you. Sun Gohan told Wiss about Yamcha's disappearance and what the old Supreme Kai said to him. Hee <laughs> hee, so that's the case, it seems that we can't let our guard down. Wiss tone was cold. I, can I say a word? Number 18 hesitated. Oh, did you remember something? Sun Gohan asked curiously. When I was being transformed, I woke up for a few seconds. I seemed to see a woman wearing glasses. She handed the core to Dr. Jero. From her tone, it seemed that she and Dr. Jero were husband and wife. 18 after seeing Jackson, I suddenly recalled the scene when I was transformed. Couple, a woman with glasses. Sun Gohan was shocked. He also seems to vaguely remember this, Dr. Jero seems to have a wife. Android number 21, who does not appear in the official history. I can't find the person you are talking about. It seems that she is not in the seventh universe. Maybe the world core thing is really her handiwork. After Wiss finished speaking on the 18th, he quickly scanned the seventh universe with the earth as the center. 
Universe, the white scene with his angel scepter cannot project Dr. Jero's wife. Master Wiss, where is the Supreme Kai? Are there any spare cores? Sun Gohan asked. You really want to help transform that bald man into an android? Wiss asked in surprise. Master Wiss, his martial arts level is no worse than that of my father. If he is given a chance to continue to become stronger without being limited by his talent, he is very likely to become the top combat force in the seventh universe. Sun Gohan's his tone was very firm, he believed in Klin. If Klin chose to mess up, he wouldn't come to him for help. There should be. In history, there have been many Supreme Kais who died abnormally. It's normal to keep one or two cores. Go get it. If the 15th generation Supreme Kai doesn't give it to you, then just do what I say. Wiss agreed to Sun Gohan's plan. After finally accepting a disciple, how could he not protect his calf? He will give it to him, hey, if there is nothing else, I'm leaving. Master, bye. Sun Gohan held no 18's hand again, already very casual. There was no reaction at all on the 18th, it seemed completely normal. Okay, go ahead. I've found a good opponent for you. When you're done, come find me. Wiss said. I know, let's go. The figure of Sun Gohan and number 18 faded away in an instant. He sent number 18 back to the earth and came to the Supreme Kai planet himself. Supreme Kai star. Yo, tisk, tisk, tisk. Old Supreme Kai circled around Sun Gohan. His eyes were full of surprise. Then he said, little guy, how come you have a trace of divine power? Ginger is still as hot as old. Lord Supreme Kai, although you are a little perverted, your eyes are really extremely vicious. Sun Gohan was very amazed by the eyes of Old Supreme Kai. Tell me, who helped you? Old Supreme Kai asked curiously. Master Wiss, Sun Gohan said calmly. Wiss, Master, Old Supreme Kai stepped back in shock. Is it necessary to be so surprised? Sun Gohan said helplessly. Angel Wiss will accept you as his apprentice, Old Supreme Kai said in disbelief. Anyway, he didn't refuse even though I called him. Sun Gohan said nonchalantly. Ha ha, you little guy is so lucky. Old Supreme Kai repeatedly praised. Stop talking about this, I have something to do with you. What's up, Jia Shin, do you have any Jia Shin that you have preserved? Some time ago. Sun Gohan told the old Supreme Kai about Klin and the situation he had talked with Wiss. Old Supreme Kai held his chin in his palm and pondered for a long time, Wiss, do you also agree to do this? Well, Master Wiss asked me to ask for it from you under his banner. Sun Gohan said. Okay, hello, Shin, is the core of the 13th generation Supreme Kai still there? The old Supreme Kai asked Shin who was standing aside. Ancestor, here you are. Shin respectfully stepped forward and said. Go get it and give it to Sun Gohan. That little guy from Earth is not bad, and he is very determined in martial arts. Although his talent is much lower than Saiyan, but if he really becomes an artificial human, his future prospects are very promising. The old Supreme Kai told Shin to get the World Core. Yes, Ancestor. A few minutes later, Shin handed the Jia Core to Sun Gohan. Thank you, old Supreme Kai, I owe you a favor. Sun Gohan waved goodbye. HMPH, you owe me more than just a favor. You'll have to pay it back someday. Old Supreme Kai walked towards the tea house with his hands behind his back. Shin respectfully stepped forward to make tea. Dot dot dot. Earth Bun Mountain. Klin, come with me. Sun Gohan traveled to the gods of destruction and to the Supreme Kai. A lot of time has been lost. He also promised Vital today to teach her how to fly. The agreed time was in the morning, and it's almost noon now. He quickly cut through the mess and teleported Klin directly to Bulma Manor. Bulma, the core of the infinite energy pack has been found. You should have a way to fuse the core with Krillin. Sun Gohan said. It turns out it's this strange thing. Don't worry, I'm absolutely sure, and I will transform Klin to be even more powerful than no. 17.18. I have their data and at the same time, it won't delay Klin's normal life. As soon as Bulma saw the core, her interest immediately rose. Okay, I'll leave Klin to you. I'll evacuate first. I have other things to do. Sun Gohan teleported away. HMPH, this little fool is getting more and more polite. 
Bulma said slightly dissatisfied. Bulma, when will it start? Clint couldn't wait any more. Start now. After you left, I have made a shell similar to the infinite energy pack in their bodies. If you want to use the energy of this core, you must use the shell as a medium to provide energy to your body. Bulma took the lead. Go to the research room. Krillin follows closely behind. Clint, to be an artificial human is actually to remove your original heart and replace it with this energy pack. The heart itself is the engine that provides the body with operation. Now it is just to replace you with an engine that is countless times more powerful than the heart. So you there is no need to treat yourself as an alien. Bulma comforted Krillin. Don't worry, Bulma, since I have chosen this path myself, of course I won't think so. Just go ahead and start. Krillin lay on the bed. Bulma begins to anesthetize Klin. At the same time, a loyal surgeon from the capsule company was called to perform the surgery, and she would provide guidance. Dot dot dot. Vital's house. Gohan, you are finally here. Vital ran towards son Gohan overjoyed. Although Vital is still young at this time, he has been practicing martial arts since he was a child, and his body is developing faster than ordinary people. It's already starting to take shape. She flew into son Gohan's arms. Is that kid the one my junior sister likes? The disciples accepted by Satan talked a lot. Who knows, it should be, I really admire him, he dared to pick up junior sister. Snapped. The eldest disciple stepped forward and slapped the person who had just spoken. What are you talking about? Junior sister is still young, what is bubble, show some respect. Yes, yes, senior brother. I was wrong. The disciple hurriedly begged for mercy. The screen comes to Vital. Vital, I will take you to learn in nature, it will be more conducive to your perception of chi. How is it? Sun Gohan asked. Okay, okay, go, go. Vital couldn't wait a long time ago, pulled Sun Gohan and walked out. It's too slow to walk. Sun Gohan stopped in his tracks. Just hold Vital and disappear. Obstacle, obstacle, obfuscation. Satan's disciples were stunned. Magic blindfolding the big brother also couldn't believe it dot 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 in the suburban forest not far from the city wow gohan do you have superpowers vital was stunned it counts son gohan gohan you are getting more and more amazing i have discovered a lot of your secrets the curiosity in vital's eyes couldn't be hidden at all hey in the future you will find out more come on i will teach you how to perceive chi and flying technique Sun Gohan sat on the grass holding Vital. Then teach her how to sense Kai. Ten minutes later. Hum. Vital sat cross-legged, his hands were naturally hanging down, and his hands were placed in a circle. At the center point, a faint energy appeared. Well, it's not bad, I've already sensed Chi. Gohan nodded and said. Gohan, can I fly then? Vital stood up excitedly. Take your time. First try to guide the Chi in your body to your feet. Sun Gohan guided Vital patiently and carefully. After another ten minutes, Vital's feet were off the ground, floating in the air. I succeeded, Pata. As soon as she opened her mouth, all the concentrated energy was released in an instant. Fortunately, it is less than one meter above the ground. No injuries either. You have to be calm and focused in order to use your chi. This is just the beginning, but you have done a good job. Sun Gohan praised her without hesitation. Children, praise is more effective than scolding. Yeah, Gohan, I got it. I will definitely follow what you said and study hard. Vital had an obedient attitude of studying. Ha, huh, successful. Sun Gohan suddenly looked up to the sky, and that direction was Bulma Manor. In an instant, all the strong people who can key sense on the earth looked up and looked in the same direction at the same time. Gohan, where, where are the monsters? Vital had just learned the perception of chi, and he also felt an indescribably powerful chi. Don't worry, that's not a monster, nor a bad guy, he's my dad's friend. Vital, I'll take you home, you follow my instructions carefully to train, see you at school. Okay, Sun Gohan said softly. Well, okay, Vital was obviously a little unhappy. Don't be unhappy, I have something to do, and it's Monday the day after tomorrow. See you at school, Sun Gohan comforted. Then sent her home and teleported to Bulma Manor. Bulma, it's strange, isn't the artificial human breathless? Why does Uncle Klin still have it? 
Sun Gohan pointed to the excited Klin and asked. Who is this girl? This girl is a genius scientist. I won't put the cart before the horse like Dr. Jero and change a flesh and blood body into a cyborg. Although they can live normally and have children on 17.18, they also transform many non-human things. Klin does not have their shortcomings, and can also quickly become stronger by exercising his body. The infinite energy pack in his body can not only provide him with energy, but also strengthen his body. Optimize his genes, said Bulma proudly. Yeah, you're a genius, okay. Gohan, I think I'm so strong. Keelan stepped forward and said. Nonsense, your current combat power, through calculation, is a full 20 billion points. This is just a transformation, you should get used to it, and it should be stronger. Bulma can manufacture combat power detectors. It is not surprising that there are several at home. This is really flesh and blood, mechanical ascension. Sun Gohan looked at him with interest. Earth. Sun Gohan looked at Keelan's changes, and sighed the mechanical flow he had seen in his previous life. The flesh and blood are weak, and the machine soars. Klin's form at this time is tantamount to surpassing the shackles of the Earth's genes. This made Sun Gohan instantly think of twelve universes. In a certain universe, except for Supreme Kai, the rest are all robots. Even Gods of Destruction is hiding in the robot armor. In less than a moment, Sun Goku, Piccolo, Tian Shinhan, all came to Bulma's house. Vegeta is disdainful, Raditz and Nappa are training. Wow, Krillin, how did you become so powerful all of a sudden? Son Goku was taken aback by Krillin's anger. Yeah, Keelan, are you an alien like me? Have you unlocked the genetic shackles? The blood seal. Tian Shinhan also showed a puzzled expression. Hey, I won't tell you. Let's talk after a fight. Keelan's fighting spirit spewed out. Okay, I'll come first. Goku became interested when he heard that there was a fight. Wait, are you trying to destroy my house? Get the hell out of here. Missy Bulma yelled angrily. Bulma is right, Dad, come with me, I know a place where we can fight freely, and I want to fight too. Seeing Tian Shinhan, Gohan instantly recalled coming back from the Three-Eyed Star in the end, he didn't know how powerful Tian Shinhan is now. You guys go, I won't go, Piccolo said suddenly. What's the matter, Piccolo? Son Goku asked puzzled. Ha, huh, I'm going to find abuse, let's go first. Piccolo flew away. Sun Gohan saw a few drops of purple blood faintly falling from the sky. Piccolo is not reconciled, very unwilling, how long has he been a fusion god? Falling into the back of the car again. Saiyan is better than him, and he endured it. Tian Shinhan is better than him, because he is the young master of the three-eyed star, with powerful talents, but it is just a seal. He also endured it. But he couldn't bear Keelan's bald head. He is obviously a person from Earth, so why did he become so strong? Piccolo sensed that Keelan's chi was about ten times stronger than him. Isn't it ten times? His combat power is about 2.5 billion points, after Keelan's transformation, it will directly reach 20 billion points. Although it's less than ten times, the difference is not too big. Moreover, he didn't underestimate Kling. Compared with Vegeta, Raditz and others, Piccolo still knows Kling better. Son Goku, Keelan, are all apprentices of that master Roshi. He has fused with the gods, and he also has the memories of the gods in his mind. He also deeply understands that master Roshi can be said to be the real martial artist on earth, but his talent is limited. With the same strength, he dare not say that he can beat that old man. There is also the magic sealing wave that seals him, which is an unforgettable skill for him. Why, why, while Piccolo was unwilling, he was also very lonely. Son Gohan at all here. Gohan, what's wrong with him? Goku didn't know so. Hee <laughs> hee, I'm so excited, you go to the temple to fight. In the temple, there is a failed product of the spirit and time room. The space inside is vast and boundless, enough for you to toss. I will help Piccolo. Son Gohan gave up thoughts I just had with them. He takes to the skies and goes after Piccolo. Goku, Tian Shinhan, Krillin, are also flying towards the temple. In front of a waterfall, Piccolo closed his eyes and stood under the waterfall, feeling the impact of the powerful water flow. Sun Gohan as soon as he hits the ground. Piccolo opened his eyes. Sun Gohan, are you here to take pity on me? I'm here to help you, 
Don't be so hostile, you know me. Sun Gohan said helplessly. Call out. Piccolo rushed out of the waterfall, and the familiar cape and hat appeared instantly. You, have a way to help me become stronger. Piccolo said slightly excitedly. Well, I found that the methods Bobo mentioned are too high level for you now, and it is difficult for you to do it. It's not that the methods he said don't work, but that you, and even me, can't do it now. I can't take advantage of the deep meaning. But I have another way. Sun Gohan held up two fingers. You have two other ways. Tell me, what way? Piccolo immediately understood what Sun Gohan's stretched out finger meant. First, fusion. Fusion assimilates Namek people, which will increase your strength exponentially. This method won't work. The Namek people are all my clansmen. In order to become stronger, I can't fuse my clansmen. Piccolo, as Sun Gohan expected, didn't bother to fuse his clansmen in order to become stronger. Piccolo's self-esteem does not allow him to do that, the kind elder, the tribe who is kind to him. He can't even think about it. Well, I guess you won't do this, but I know that besides Namek, there is also a Namek who is living outside, and he is very powerful, more powerful than the dead Frieza, but at the same time very evil, if you let you go you shouldn't have any psychological burden by assimilating him, right? Sun Gohan remembered that he saw Slug on the wanted list in the Galaxy Patrol. Slug, a Namek man who was also exiled on the planet Slug on the eve of the Namek catastrophe. He was born with powerful fighting power and an extremely evil heart. He is a super soldier that Namek only encounters once in a century, and his chapter appeared in the theatrical version. When he was living on the Slug planet, he fought all over the Slug planet with extremely high combat effectiveness when he was a teenager. He proclaimed himself the king and had many subordinates. He was very cruel and ruthless to his subordinates, and would be killed if he was even slightly dissatisfied. Moreover, as you grow older, your fighting power and evil heart also grow. Kaio in the movie version said that after regaining his youth, Slug's combat power far exceeded that of Super Saiyan and Frieza. In the end, Sun Gohan whistled to stimulate his weakness. Sun Goku absorbed Piccolo's energy and used it for a few seconds. It took a hundred times more Kaioken to penetrate his huge body. But he didn't die. Goku flew high into the sky to collect the energy of the sun and made a spirit bomb to kill him completely. Judging by time, he is about the same age as the original Piccolo Daimao. But he doesn't have Piccolo's talent and can't make Dragon Ball. So he is already very old at this time. Sun Gohan was surprised when he saw his wanted poster in the Galaxy Patrol. Why didn't he come to Earth? After all, Cooler from the movie version also appears. More evil than me, Piccolo asked after hesitating for a moment. You're nothing. He has strong fighting power and is born with an evil heart. You are not a Namek like you who was influenced by the entrance to the demon world and became evil. When he was at his peak, he was fighting everywhere in the universe. Even King Cold avoided him. It's so sharp. It wasn't until Frieza was born and Slug aged that the frozen demon became dominant again. You mean, let me defeat him and assimilate his body? Piccolo frowned. Well, but you make your own choice. After all, he is a Namek with an evil heart. If you assimilate him, I'm afraid you will turn black again. When the time comes, I will have to take action even if I don't want to. Sun Gohan gave him the choice. It's done. I don't believe that my dignified Piccolo Daimao will lose to him mentally. Namek's assimilation is mainly based on the party with strong combat power. I am better than him now. Piccolo decided to go. Well, okay, then I will take you to Slug Star. He is old now and doesn't run around anymore. He usually stays on Slug Star. Sun Gohan grabbed Piccolo and was about to leave. Wait a minute, Sun Gohan, even if you help me, I won't be grateful to you. Piccolo is soft-spoken and soft-hearted. I don't need your gratitude. But you have to promise me one thing. After you agree, I will tell you the second way to become stronger. Hee <laughs> hee, Sun Gohan suddenly smiled evilly. Hum, there is no good intention in your smile. Piccolo suddenly felt uneasy. Just tell me whether you agree or not. Sun Gohan grasped Piccolo's seven inches. Okay, I agree. What do you mean? Piccolo gritted his teeth and agreed. I'll tell you when the time comes. Hee <laughs> hee, Sun Gohan did not reveal. Are you kidding me? Piccolo was furious. No, you will know when the time is right. Sun Gohan chose to hide. HMPH, 
Then tell me what is the second way to become stronger. Piccolo snorted coldly. Hurry up, finish the first method first, and then tell you the second one. Son Gohan, if you say a word, you will be punished. Piccolo was almost pissed off by him. He found that when he faced Son Gohan, his temper could not help but explode. Too much nonsense, let's go, Shilich Shing. Son Gohan didn't bother to listen to his complaints and took him to teleport away. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.